Hello, everybody, and welcome back to New Shindoza. What are we doing today, Nush? Tell them, please, please. We are continuing the wonderful Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. That's Yesterday right. was the first stream, and um, I feel like we're already in love, not only with each other, but this game. I am so glad that you feel that way, because... It's I frustratingly fun. <laughs> that is how I would describe it. Yeah, there is a bit of that uh, that old game kind of design. I mean, there were limitations, but there was also a lot of beauty. Honestly, my favorite part is just the fact that we're back in a Zelda world. <laughs> it does feel it's nice. It's nice to hear the sounds. It's nice to see Link. It's It's been great. Um, I, got, I actually played the majority of yesterday, I feel, which was nice because this is a half-line run. Doza has played this game before. It is completely new to me. Um, so it's been nice that Doza is kind of being all sussy, um, mm -hmm. letting me do what I need to do. Right now, Doza is the one playing just to start things off here. Hello, Fry. Um, Eggs and Crop are new name change I see here. And come on, oh, <laughs> Samuel, nice. welcome mm -hmm. back, y'all. Um, it's good to see you guys. Congratulations, Fry, on getting your driver's license or passing your test. That's awesome. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. Are you going to give us like a ride when you like when we come to the UK? Like, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Um, they get picked up in the hot rod. <laughs> right? Instead of calling like a Uber or taxi or something, we're like, cry. <laughs> <laughs> Let's roll out. <laughs> oh, um, man, I love Transformers. And the Game Boy stuff, I just hit like a truck. Right? It's so nostalgic. Like, you know, even though it's like a game I haven't experienced, I still feel a, a lot of nostalgia just being here, you know? So, yeah, I wanted to ask you about that. I didn't get a chance to ask you because uh, I didn't think of it. <laughs> but um, today, I have thought of it. Uh, we've played uh, Link's Awakening, the remaster, well, yeah. remake, on the channel before. On th That was remastered for the Switch, so it looked amazing. It looked amazing, and it was obviously modernized comparatively. Super cute. This is, these are the, th this is one of the two games, Oracle of Seasons, that originally came after that. You know, as you can see, it uses a lot of, like, the similar things. You see these weird round, like... I don't know, tentacle trees and whatnot, and you got these, you know, familiar brown, uh, like, cliffs and stuff like that. Yeah. So, but you saw it in, in terms of like a, like a, like an HD diorama. How does it feel to see all of that again? It's nice. I, I like it. This is, it, it's been a while since you played, I don't know, would you consider this a retro game, right? <laughs> I, I would, I yeah. would put this in the retro game. Exactly. So it's been a while since we played like an old school type thing. So it's nice to see this feel. It's just, it's a vibe, you know? Um, and hello, Flo. Welcome back. How are you doing? Well, we can do this um, now. And it was hard to pass. Um, I actually, um, I don't know. I, I have... I, since I used to travel a lot and stuff, I have a license, or I used to have a license in three different countries, and, like, the hardest one for me to pass was actually in India, um, the easiest for me was the US, and then, like, I did get my license in the UK, and it was kind of like, eh? Like, it was in between, I guess. I, this was a while ago, though, so... I wonder. I don't. I like, think they've expired. I don't think I get to drive places anymore because <laughs> I haven't been in a while. I wonder if there's a lot of like, uh, like references, like in UK TV shows and, and movies, uh, coming of age particularly, if they include the whole driver's license thing. Um, when you said UK like shows coming of age, the first thing I thought of was Skins, the British version, obviously. Um, I don't remember a lot of driving is that like now that a, I'm thinking about it. like I mean obviously there's driving they're going from place to place what have you but like I don't think that was like a topic really that was discussed as no. much is that like a is that like a plastic surgery kind of show no it's a coming of age like show about like teenagers oh yeah <laughs> like it's a drama it follows a bunch of like friends and like a group of people it has a lot of like um heavy topics that were discussed i probably watched this when i shouldn't have watched it um i was probably too young but like everything from like um just you know disorders to like mental health to oh, uh, abuse sexuality like so many different topics and then the u.s had like an american version of um skins and then like i didn't like that i tried i didn't even get very far i was like you guys are just trying too much but I also, like, one of the reasons I even watched Skins was because of Dave Patel, who's in it. Oh, okay. And we well, haven't yeah, seen... That all makes sense. Then. Yeah, we haven't seen Monkey Man yet that he's in. Um, we want to. We just... We don't really go to the theater, so we're kind of probably going to wait. Um. <laughs> oh, I just forgot. I need to go to the... I need to go to the ring place. We got new rings. Oh, okay. 
<laughs> yeah, we, we need to appraise some rings. That's good. A uh, bit better play. now, working a bit with Minecraft. Okay, nice. Good luck with that. Mm -hmm. um, I thought you were going to ask if you should replay Link's Awakening on the Game Boy Ennis, so... <laughs> No, nah, no, nah, we're good. No, nah, that's we're, we're fine. <laughs> if we were to ever revisit, it'd be the uh, you know the one that we paid sixty dollars for. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, I um, I do like that one as a vibe in general. We also got to um, actually experience Link's Awakening, the remaster for the Switch, early before everybody else, like at um, PAX West that year, which um, we were given these little Link's Awakening um, keychains that are super super cute. Uh, we actually, I actually oh, use mine. Those is just hanged on our key thingy. <laughs> so we always get to see it every day. Yes, yeah. There we go. All right, what do we get? Friendship ring. Oops. Um, Symbol of meeting. Meeting, right. Yeah. And we already have that one, but we we're did. looking for something else. Where's the other one? Go back. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, discovery, discovery ring. And this one is the Moblin Mob ring. And what else do we we're have? We're going to put that on, but let's keep looking. That was it. We appraised, but we never actually equipped something different. So let's see what the Moblin Ring does. And see you later, Samuel. I wonder if it's going to make them not attack us. And have a good one. And Fry, since you weren't here yesterday, did you have you ever played this game? I'm curious. There weren't many people yesterday who had played it or experienced it. As I expected. I mean, it is an older game. It, it, well, and, there's a couple But reasons. it's on Nintendo Switch Online. It's been on there for over a year now. So, like, I'm, I'm curious if people have tried... Oh, it's my turn? Yes, your turn. Well, what am I doing? Uh, I mean, you can go wherever you'd like. Okay. I forget what what, what our thing was supposed to be. I don't know if we're going, right. like... Um, I know that you can go north. I know you can go here. We haven't been here yet. I can't move those. Those seem like, like they're coconuts. They're, like, really freaking like big, coconuts. too. We do like coconuts. We actually okay, have so one in our beach fridge. Now. We do. I was... I, I'm trying to... I'm gonna make, um... A fresh, like, coconut chutney... I've been wanting to for a while. Well, what are you attacking that guy for? I don't know. I, he I, just seemed like an enemy. I want to get back to all of me mates and dig the ship free. But Captain said, don't come back. Till you find me bell. Okay, we need to find a bell. Can someone take me, please? <laughs> <laughs> Samosa Desert. Ah, oh, so close to a samosa. So close. Okay, okay, so we need to find a bell. Or we're going to find one of those. The That's water? the ocean. I can't go in. Um, Just right there to the waves. Well, you know, it's the shore. You, you get to play. At least you get to splash around a little bit. Yeah, I wonder. I have the means, but old Zelda never really interests me. Like, I get the appeal, but eh. oh, well, that's so sad. Okay, so we need to find a bell. Yeah, we need to find a bell. Where does one get a bell? I don't know. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That's okay. I never mean to do anything. <laughs> Which one's the sword button? Is it the A button or the B button? The A today, because that's what you put. Well, that's what you had last time. Because mm -hmm. of the whole, that's like... What you had. Well, you were tired of dropping bombs oh, on your bombs. face. I did drop bombs on my face way too much yesterday. It was uncalled oh. for. What if you look at... What, what was that? That's a stump. Oh, yeah, we changed it to winter. You wanna yeah, try that. Oh, okay. So the one thing I still don't like about this game is that you have to constantly switch things. Mm hmm um, it's very annoying, but here we go. <laughs> we have switched. It is now winter, yes. And now that we've gone here, oh, oh looks like we can go in. to the other side. That's good. Oh, oh. <laughs> you gonna oh. keep dancing? Are we gonna go in this cave? Hey, now you have the upper view here. Oh, and nice, I got good a piece job. Of heart. You almost have uh, enough for a hole. I that, know, a whole good. container, that would be good. Because mm -hmm. I die, I, I do be dying. We are never full health. Um, you need to use the... Uh, another need to use thing. the power bracelet. This thing? Yeah. And I guess I'll put that for B. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. And then you can start picking them up. You remember how to do this, right? How do you pick it up in real life? You lean forward, and then you lean back? Right. Anyways. <laughs> You're literally it's crushing a, it. It's such a crazy, like, mechanic. It's different. It, you, oh, how did I get across? Well, you jumped downward. Now you're in a lower floor. I didn't mean to do that. See, those are the walls. How, that's another thing. Like, you, they had depth to convey... Depth perception is very hard. Yes, they had to convey depth with, with very little. So I'm sure that's been a bit weird. Yeah. 
I mean, I didn't realize, and I was just trying to... I probably missed something cool in the, those other pots. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because this is a top-down as opposed to, like, a side-scroller. So look, looking at what's higher and lower isn't as easy. Imagine puzzles that you had to solve, like, between different floors back in the day. Yeah. Because there was, a, I think, the sixth dungeon, the eagle something rather, in Link's Awakening. That one was a lot of, like, you had to kind of understand that you needed to, like, solve the dungeon puzzle in a vertical way. So this man needs oil? Yep. Which we don't have. So in a lot of Zelda games, there's, like, there's usually, like, a, a, a long, there's a long quest line. It's never, like, acknowledged as a quest line. Um, but what it consists of is a sense, uh, it's like a, it's like a trading system, in a way. There's, like, a specific start, it's always the same, and it's, you have to go and you have to talk to certain people that are needing certain things at certain points in that, like, quote-unquote quest line, you know what I mean? Yeah. Ugh. Um, Trivia question, here. in terms of pre-order bonuses, which Zelda games had key rings and what were they of? Uh, well, there's Link's Awakening. That's, That's all, all I know. That's all we know. <laughs> <laughs> I assume you know the rest. Right? What's up, Flo? Um, and that was Sea of Storms that you hear. The music, like, there's been such great music in this game. Which how it feels nostalgic, too, since we know the music regardless of having not played the game. Yeah, I mean, Nintendo... I'm not really sure Nintendo where... Nintendo does reuse it, Does right. he want to give me a little hint as to, like, what's Oh, up? well, you can absolutely, um... You can go north of the, of the town. You can try that. Because I think we've explored a, a decent amount of what we can... Uh, accomplish over on the east side, which is where we're at now. Yeah. Have we gone to the east of this square? I think so. I don't remember. We've done things. Well, okay. Oh, yeah, it's okay. fine. Alright, let's go here. Oh, okay. Oh, and I can so move it needs these, to right? be. I see. But you can at least, like, burn those things in the back. Bro, this guy's got a bro, sword. I was They're evolving. Throw the rock on you. <laughs> this is that flower, but it has to be spring so I can jump up. You want me to burn these? Yeah, you could try that. Hello, okay. what's a killy bunny? What are we talking about? Is that Sea of Storms I hear? Yes, you were correct, Fry. What we heard earlier confirmed. was Sea of Storms. As Noosh confirmed. Yeah. Love her so much. She's okay, great. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I need this to do this. Um, like the flower during spring. And Rylan, and hey, hello! Hey, how's it going? This is one of your favorite <laughs> games. I can see why. It's an amazing game. Um, we just started it yesterday, so we're still, um... Oh. Fresh. Oh man, Be I need careful. to. I need to change that out because, like, I'm always. Oh, you have a you have range, in the form um, of uh, the boomerang. Yeah, but that's that's all you because of the dance. What? Yeah, just. Oh, oh, oh. I, I got eaten. Your shield was eaten. Did you struggle or did you just sit in there, like all nice and cozy? So is my shield gone now? Yes, it's gone. Forever. Forever. You're I mean, like crazy. that that particular shield is gone forever. How many shields do we have? That one. Uh, so I don't have a shield anymore. You currently do not. It took it out of your inventory. It ate it. That's rude. Um. Oh, it seems like you need to be in a different season for that seed to be there. Yeah. But I, we only have there winter might be a available. Stump. There's a stump north of where you are. Okay. When I heard Song of Storms of Pikmin 4, did you do double take? Okay, well, yeah, now nice. we're going to be expecting it when we play Pikmin 4. Thank you, Fry, for the spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> we're not going to remember Doza. I am. Oh, uh, okay. I'll be, I'll be like, oh, that's right, this was in here. Hey, wait a minute, didn't Fry tell us? That's, what, that's exactly <laughs> what's gonna happen. You can go ahead and timestamp this moment, Fry, if you want. <laughs> Will they remember? Perhaps. Okay, so I'm going down, and then I'm going to the hey, right. It's the, oh, 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 it oh, matter. she's gone, she's, she's gone. gone, Din. That's okay. I actually went back and looked at uh, your first like bump in with her. That was at, I think it was at this particular square right here. And, um, you came out on top. Not only did you get all your hearts back, but you ended up with, like, so I can't do a few more this. rupees than before. So, good job. Proud of you. So, we're going north, you said? I mean, you just did that, so we can go ahead oh, and go back. Let's did go you, back to you town. You know, I could rewind. You, well, you, you could. know, I could. You could. I think That's you just, not the right button. You just have to hold. You, you, you have to hold. The same right. buttons, but you hold. You're right. I could rewind. Where was it? Uh, keep going. You were still in the same square. You were here for a while. Yeah, I was yeah, hitting all just those. having a lot of fun. Right. Right, okay, right this, one, this one. Yep. Okay. Okay. Well, let's run into her, y'all. Let's do it. Where is she? Is she gone? Mm -hmm. Oh, there, there she is. She there is. she is. 
Good job. Oh, Whoa, there oh get the so ring much stuff. and the potion. Oh my, gosh, oh my god. Oh my Go gosh. for those first. Oh my and then god. The seed. Oh my god. I'm scared. Go oh my god. What do I do? Right. Left, left down, down to, to the right. right. Okay, okay. Nothing else I've matters. I've got my objective. Okay, okay, okay. This is a good drop. Okay, okay. Oh, she got the she seed got first. The seed that's first. okay. That's okay. Uh, uh, just go ahead and grab everything else you can. Yeah, she's going to come out the loser on this one. What's she going to say? What's she going to say? Oh, there's still some more stuff. Can you reach that with your sword? No. Oh, I didn't try with the sword. You. I'll remember. This. Good job, you came out on top of that one. Way to go. And she really didn't like that. Okay, so okay. now you have an idea of like what kind of like whoa, that was yeah. some good loot. I wanna I wanna see what that ring was once you get a chance. Also, where do we I did go a little bit of again? To the, the to the which is ring. Where? Yes. Uh it's in the town, which is southwest from where you are. Southwest, okay. Yes, that's correct. Breath okay. of the Wild has wor the worn out Z in the logo as a key ring with a silent princess, and Skyward Sword HD has a Hylian crest as its key ring. Well, well, Fry, how many how many Zelda games had had a special coin? Oh, I wonder if you know that. What are you building in Minecraft, Flo? Are you building a sand cannon? I ask randomly. Oh yes, this is the good stuff. Pretty sure Song of Storms also makes a small cameo in this game. And, yeah, that's right there. And hey, Hunter. Um, <laughs> How's it something going? Something that we didn't realize. Welcome back, first of all. Is that not only did you give memberships yesterday, you became a member yourself. So thank you so much for that. Um, when all the notifications came in, we I don't know if we especially like recognized that yesterday. So wanted to make sure to do Happy that today. Happy almost first 24 hours as a member. I know. <laughs> we really appreciate it. Um. Do you think this man has a bell because of the music? Um, I don't know. The seasons are all disorder. Spring, summer, what will come of it all? Even I cannot see. I think he's just a random bard that just hangs out. And Five says, more memberships, Hunter. Oh Thank my you gosh. so much. Flo, wow. Ethan, Cassandra, William, and Azzy. Congratulations, <laughs> and also thank you. <laughs> you you are quite generous. We really, really appreciate it. That's 15 in two days. Um, I... you, you have no idea how much every single one of those means to us. And yourself as well. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so maybe Din has one, but we're trying to protect her. No, 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 Din. you failed to protect her. The... You have to save Din, her. Din, oh. This is different. Why does he have a sore? Why is this here? Is this where? What is this? I don't remember. Should I go back and talk to him first? Uh, you like, can sir, can I enter? See you? what he says. <laughs> okay, so show my courage. No. <laughs> You'll figure it out. You showed your courage to get through the door, but you gotta wake him up. How do I wake him up? Level not like you woke him up last time. You have it's done with this. With a sword. It is in with a. You did use a sword last time. Yes. What, what what possible thing could you interact can, with him? Can you tell me? Does it just tell me we're gonna be here all day? <laughs> Do you think we're gonna really be here all oh, day? Oh, the bubble. The snot bubble, yes. There we go. Okay. Good job. <laughs> oh, spool swamp out west. Something is afoot. So west. West. Okay. So that's to the left. <laughs> Correct. That is to the left. <laughs> I've been directionally challenged this uh, this game <laughs> in case for those of y'all just joining us and not knowing um, all the insanity that happened yesterday. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and get some appraisal on these rings, huh? Yeah, let's see what let's see what you got. What do you got? What do you got? Appraise. Yeah. And Flo, you're gonna make a mob spawner. Let's go. Get hype. Oh, 20 rupees. What is this? The fist, fist ring. ring. Punch when not equipped. That's what That's that ring cool. is. I'll add it to your list. That's just like you know, Bo. It is like you know, Bo. We love punching. <laughs> Are you gonna equip it? Worn. I guess I can. Cause I um, don't know what the moblin thing is. It seems like you were still struggling. So we go down to rings, right? Or I forget how to get there. <laughs> uh, there's like a jewelry thingy. Oh, well, oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, ring box. Um, can I not open it? I'm sorry, I thought the coin was... You have to talk to him to do it. I thought oh. the coin was uh, Breath Why of the didn't Wild. Why did you just tell me before? Unless there is a Tears of the Kingdom one. What do you mean? I'm telling you now. Jewelry, what can I do? A pr list. Okay, so... Shane says you have to use a loud alarm clock for the tree. A, lo a loud alarm clock? Well, yeah. that's a well, novel idea, try that. Shane. Also, hello, it's good to see one? you. There is a clock maker. There's a clock How store. Do... How do I switch again? It's, um, select it, because that's the that's the thing you're selecting, and then you can move around either left and right, or you can hit the minus button, which is select. 
Okay, well, see, so you could have told me. Well, you're welcome. These uh, games, I believe, the third game involved for Robo's plan, but complications Discovery of the Kingdom linking the three together caused that thing to scrap. I do know that uh, Oracle Fist of Ages and Seasons, there you go, you put that. I know oh, these two games were really late in the uh, Game Boy Color life cycle. Okay, so did I equip it? Uh, I think you can equip it outside of this. You have it in your box. This is like putting it in your box menu. Okay. So you can so leave this, now... you can go to your item screen. This is just too much switching around, move to, move to the right with select. Oh my goodness. And then you can do that. This ring, and I'll a button. put that for B, not A, right? I mean, you select it with the A button. And there you then go. I put it. Now you're good. Oh, you're really? done. You finished. Congratulations. <sighs> that was a lot, y'all. Okay. Yeah. All right. I am wondering, um, when did the Game Boy Advance come out? Do, do any of y'all know? Okay, so West. That's where I'm headed. But probably higher up and then west, right? Should mm. I buy another shield from this man's? I would recommend it. Yeah. Just having one, you never know what you're gonna run yeah. into. And Rylan, if you, like, obviously no spoilers, but if we're missing something that's so crucial and secret that, like, would be really cool, feel free to, like, nudge us in the right direction like if you'd like hint. to. Yeah, yeah. But for the most part, we're having Noosh do this, like, totally blind. Because I know I'm nothing. also nudging and her in certain I've directions. been asking Doza for help, and he doesn't really help me, so maybe you'll help me more. <laughs> she will literally run around in circles in the same area for, like, 20 minutes. So that you can be like, yo, uh, don't do that. It's like, you could try going left. Have you done that? And she's like, what do you think of it? What do you mean? <laughs> what is left? <laughs> what is left? What are okay. frogs? Uh, let's see. That was definitely the keychain. No, I feel like didn't because we got the we got the the bundle thing. What for what? For, for Breath of the Wild, I'm pretty sure it had a coin. I don't remember was owning there? the coin. Oh, frick! I lost the heart. That's okay. I didn't need it. Um, do you think there's a way out this way? Because this is left. Um, there is another. There is more left. But, but how do I get there? Well, it would have been here. Unfortunately, the bridge is not built. Okay, so who's gonna build it? Where's Tom Nook? Oh. <laughs> See, we've already done all this. There's that down there, but I've never like... You need to be able to like somehow... Get that. Make make an ember go farther. And then oh, I think your weak like a bow and arrow? Can, like, or something. Do you know how? I do know how. Right now, you can't do it. Oh, okay. I thought you were just not going to tell me. Like, again. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's not... How's our week been so far? Busy, Shane. Quite busy. Yeah, but I mean, it's almost over, so that's exciting. Yes, yes. Taxes um, is, is, is like... It's, it's not... It's counting down. So it's not... We, we survived tax day, but hey. like... What? I'm confused. Did you go into that cave ever? I think I did. I know you went into the, like, the hero's okay, we cave. we can try. Yeah, oh, this that's is, what this yeah. is. Okay. Yeah, well, you're always feeling this. great when you see one. Exactly. You guessed 2000? I feel um, like I need to look this up. The Game Boy Advance. There were some, like, changes to where, like, services, like, creative services, like, video editing, things like that, now have sales tax in our state. So, um, I, it, this is, like, we have our sales tax, like, our first, like, something due this weekend, and we have another appointment tomorrow with our tax guy to kind of get some stuff resolved and it's it's just been a lot and then next month we have a franchise tax thing that's due it's just a lot of taxes like i can see why not everyone creates their own like um business for sure like it is hard to do especially if you don't really have a business background we both have not even a creative background like we just we kind of fell into all this and just went all in, you know? I mean, generally, if you're, like, Aww. in a cubicle, you probably got air conditioning and, you know, yeah, and other so stuff, we're, so it's we're reliable compared to, trying to figure things out. Yeah. Um, I'm going okay, here. Okay, so I looked this up. So, okay. the Game Boy Advance came out, um, and this is just Google's first thing. I'm not differentiating between America or Japan. Okay. We don't have a key But that was this. a June... You already did this. This was the first dungeon. Okay, where do I go? North. North. Can I move that? Yes, with a bracelet? Yeah, you got it. Um, this game's so gonna to teach equip. you where the start and select button are, finally. We've only had the Switch for, what, eight years? Sure. Se seven years? You're gonna get it. Okay, Game Boy Advance was June or July, one of those, I get them confused, okay, of so 2001. Hey, you can just keep going, just explore, babe, have fun. Right, but I just don't wanna die in the process of exploring. You can only attack them when they like, slow down. 
Otherwise, okay. they're technically above you, but they can right. still hit you. Right, but I, I need to remember my buttons. Right. Yeah, A button is... Oh, careful. Whoa, what is it that? shocked you. It did a whole heart of damage. How was I supposed to know it was going to shock me? It's like... Think of it as like an electric choo-choo of some sort. I'm not chill actually out. sure what they're called. Those okay, are weird. Up here. And then Oracle of Seasons and Ages came out in oh February gosh. of the same year. It's like literally like four months apart. So... Before, like, Game Boy okay, Color so was obsolete. Okay, this is different. Oof, it's heavy, like a rock. Oh my gosh. I guess it's too heavy for, for, for your little... Yeah, your power can I walk bracelet. on this thing, though? No, it looks like it's too rough. And I'm, I'm basically cooling you're getting, myself. You're getting yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting wrecked. Maybe if there was a way to block it, like with a shield. Sure, sure, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I got the bundle okay, with so the switch like, release, guidebook, map, west. and a keychain. I, whoa, is this a okay. kangaroo? Oh, yeah. Hi, Ricky. I'm Ricky. Spool Swamp is my backyard. If you go south from here, then around and back up, there it is. I'd go with you, but I can't do a thing without my gloves. A guy named Blano took them when I lost a match to him. And I know it's not healthy, Shane. I don't intend to die. It just happens. You know how you lose hearts sometimes when you bump into maple? What if she, like, killed you by accident? This is a tree that would be a stump if it was a different It would be season. withered. It wouldn't be a stump. Oh. But, if, but you are you are on the right track, and I applaud you for recognizing that. I recognize Pretty proud of you. Because hey, I need to go south. Far, far east, sunken city. It's far. Try to find a ride. Well, what's north from there? I don't know. Oh, it looks like maybe you, know, you can use fire on that. Okay. Uh, Most so we'll of the time, that. those are there. There's got to be something, right? They don't just mm -hmm. accidentally leave them here. Master Chief Collection, $10 on Steam? That sounds pretty good. I keep thinking that the fire is going to get me and I need to move out of the way, but I don't. It's your fire. You oh own it. God. Come on, girl. Own that. <laughs> yeah, but then the bombs, when I do that, those bomb me. Well, that's a bomb. Oh, oh my, my gosh. God. Where you know am what? I? Doza, here you go. Uh, Can you... You're going to die. Well, why did you... You're dying. Yeah, well, you were... I was giving you the controller and you just ignored me. We tag team it here. You can just leave if you want. Go somewhere else. No, like, why don't we want to go there? Why, what about, what did Ricky say? He needs something, like some gloves from someone who stole it from him. Another bridge that I cannot cross, and I just died into the water. Is there any way that you could reach that, that switch over there? Do you have any what kind switch? of range? What do you mean, what switch? You saw the water and then left immediately. Well, yeah, because there's no bridge. Yeah. You're right oh, on that. Okay, so it looks like... Maybe from down here? No, this is also... Oh, wait. There's a bridge over there. So <laughs> let me go down here and go across this you bridge. You got quoted. It just happened. It really does happen. Like, you guys are here. Like, oh, goodness. Okay, okay so there's a hole. Oh, my gosh. How do I get past the hole? Because to... if I fall in, I'm just going to die. Yeah, you will. Doesn't seem like you can get past it right now. Looks like you're going to have to come back later. Okay, Doza, maybe you could give me a hint as to what I should be doing Avoiding rather than the just enemies. maybe later. I know you can move and attack at the same time. I, I know really you're can. capable. What's above you? Okay, uh, remember, those electrocute you. We went over this. Yes. What, are, what those? are those? Those look new. You got scent seeds. Their smell attracts monsters. Open your seed satchel to use them. I don't want to attract monsters, though. That's but dumb. if you could attract them to a certain area, then maybe you could make it easier for you to avoid. Huh. Yeah, like, you remember... Oh my <laughs> gosh. Remember in uh, Tears of the Kingdom, you could just lay down some meat and the moblins will go for that? Or That's you can good. put one down. Blano's gym. Okay, Blano, let's get these gloves back for the kangaroo, bro. Uh, says it, don't we're die. About it's to not be healthy. A boxer up in here. Oh gosh. This little fella. Good luck. I'm the legendary champ Blano. You want something? <laughs> then earn it in the ring. Will you... Be Ugh, fine. Yesterday I was dancing, today I'm boxing. Listen up, we trade punches till one of us gets knocked out of the ring and no item. If you break the rules once, the next match is for 20 rupees. No rings, only fists. Okay, so you have to, you have to take off your... I mean, you literally have a ring to help you, like, punch. So you should probably take it... Okay. Oh. That's okay. Well, it, I thought it would give me a you. chance. Nah, he'll take your money first and then call you a cheater. So you went out of the ring. Right, so I could take it off. What the heck? If you're mad, tell it to your fists, huh? Once more? Yeah or no way? So I guess I just gotta go for it, huh? <laughs> You'll learn. 
Listen up, we trade punches. Yeah, you've, you've read this. See, till one of us gets next, knocked, knocked out of the ring. You know this, Noosh. You, 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 you understand. <laughs> oh, oh, careful. Oh, oh, oh. Looks like when he raises his fist, that's the time to attack. Oh, oh, good one, good one. Way to go, babe! Yeah. You did it so quickly. Wow. Huh, I lost. Your fists are golden, kid. You're the new champ. Here, take these. Ricky's <laughs> glove. Okay, peace out. Oh, he's supposed to be like... Hard. Oh, like Ricky as in like... Ricky Stallone. the kangaroo. Yeah, like the kangaroo. Ricky, I'm coming back to give you your gloves, bro. Are you gonna punch things? No, I'm just gonna give Ricky his gloves. Gotcha. Is okay, he up that here? makes sense. I forget. So apparently, um, oh, I need Ricky to, like, is a female stuff. because Ricky has a pouch, and only only females have. The okay, pouch. that's fair. Yeah. Well, you seem to know a lot about kangaroos, Flo. I don't actually know a lot about kangaroos. I don't either. I so Kirby like has a kangaroo as well. Uh, Kirby has a kangaroo? What do you mean? Th those are- these are your gloves! I brought them to you! Here you go, Ricky! If you beat Blano, you must be tough! What's your name? Noza! Noza? Cool name! I'm Ricky! Nice to meet ya! Here, take this flute! If you need me, just play the flute! I'll try to find you! Do you think the flute could, like, also be a ring? Um... I- I don't know if it could also <gasps> be We're in his pouch! No freaking way! Yo, way to go! Mount unlocked! How come his gloves are- Oh, ha, I guess Ricky's ha, gloves don't ha. need to be red. Oh my god. Look at this <laughs> man's! Uh, whoa! Y'all. Well, you unlocked the mount. Good job. Wait, I need to go south, right? If you'd like. What are kangaroos really good at? I wonder. If you move toward a hole, I'll just jump right over. You can clear a hole easy. That's Give it a so try. Crazy. Hell yeah. We did it. I'm proud of you. For being in a kangaroo, yeah, I need that. I mean, that this you, day you got happen. the gloves yourself. I sure did. You beat the crap out of the other guy. What happens um, if you hit the A or B buttons? What, what, what happens there? Punch. Oh, nice. Wow, you kicked his ass. I hope you get that. You're gonna die. Oh. Oh, Ricky. Rewind. Right. <laughs> You're just so ready to accept your fate. There you go. Now just make sure that you don't get hit. Watch out, watch out, the fire's coming. Good job, good job, watch out, watch out. There you go. All right, all right. How do I get that? It's gonna fly towards you, maybe. So avoid the fireballs until it flies. Closer. If it does- Get over here, you little- Oh no, it didn't! All right, well, we, we in it now. Oh. Oh. Okay, well. Womp, 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 <sighs> womp. The boxer likes the Game Boy Kirby character. Oh, that's what you meant, Noosh. Off of what Flo said. They can... Oh my gosh! You can't touch them. They still do damage to you. Yeah, I know, but like, I'm starting at a disadvantage here. Yeah, it's pretty tough. Take out the range first. Or the melee. <laughs> you know, you can punch without moving. Might make things a little easier. Oh, look at that. You're getting some hearts. Oh, that was close. Female kangaroos have pouches on their own, meanwhile female humans don't How do we kill pouches. these fish? <laughs> I think there's a little bit of a difference there, <laughs> Shane, but you know, you're not oh, wrong. Oh, Barry! Yes! You were so close yes! to just leaving. Good job. Now you're in it. You have the power. I'm in it By to the win way, it. that uh, potion that you got earlier from Maple, yeah. you used it up. How? By standing still and letting an enemy attack you over and over again. Okay. It saved you from dying, but it's gone now. I, in case you missed it, I just wanted to let you know. Nice, nice, nice. All cleared out. Did he tell you, or did Ricky tell you how to jump out? No. Just and if he did, I don't know. <laughs> well, uh, what? I was Ryland. just trying to read the sign, bro. Well, it, I guess not. Ricky can't read. It, mm. They're kangaroo. I, well, Ricky has gloves and like is doing all this other the stuff. The only thing they can read is their opponents. This is one of my favorite mechanics of the game. There are actually several different animals you can get here. Two others, <laughs> I believe. I don't even remember them, to be honest. I remember Ricky Kangaroo, because he's How do I get out? the best. What's RNG based? Oh, the other oh, animals. Oh, that makes okay. sense. Okay. Do you just, like, do the thing again? No, I think, like, if I get out... See, he's not going to be here now? Oh. Um, y'all, how do I get out of the kangaroo? I don't remember. What happens Maybe if I you press hit the, a. the thing again? Oh! Well, look at that. Whoa! You have range! But I can't go in here. Huh. 
How can you jump what out? What am I supposed to do? What if you hit A and B together? Did that work? So you knew. I didn't know. So you were just kind of no, clowning us. No, I didn't us. know. No, I you knew. No idea. How many of y'all think Doza knew? He's just frying. No, no way. Oh, it's so hot. Even sitting by my prize soothing pool doesn't help. I need something creepy to send chills down my spine. Oh, well, aren't you Oh, luck? my, that doll. It's so ghastly. It gives me chills. Let me have it. Smart boy. Here, take this fine iron pot. Iron. <laughs> iron. Because of the accent. I That's nice. I like that. Good world, world building. So it's like a cast iron. Yeah, so if anyone's like looking... Oh, my yep. God. You can't swim. We've been over you this. You can't hide. You can't hide. Okay, so now what? Hey, Box, why is it going? Y'all were uh, at the top of my recommended page on four of my accounts. That's amazing. Shout out YouTube for finally like All showing us. All four of your accounts have great taste. <laughs> <laughs> A cliff like that is one leap. I'll jump if you move up to it, so give it a try. Oh, that's good. Okay. Nice, way to go. I feel, like, it. I feel like I'm lost, though, to be honest, because he said go south. South? Wasn't that to get the, the gloves? You have the gloves, so what is no, it No, 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 the swamp thingy. Oh, okay. Or was it still going west? No, I remember, I definitely oh, these remember are seeing new. something. You gotta cut them off of the tree. That's cute, though. Okay, so you said press both at the same time. It's not working now. Oh, yeah, we got the shield. How do I get out? Ricky's trying her best. She was brought up a fighter, not a scholar, and had bad education, so can't read. You <laughs> can donate $5 today to give kangaroos a proper education. Oh, that's his flute. <laughs> that's a nice-sounding flute, though. Maybe that should be my email. Does it? I don't know why. For a different email that. account, though. Right. If okay. I could do that. Maybe I'll just download a bunch of different email uh, apps. That way I Pegasus can have different... seeds. They'll make you as quick as the legendary steed. Open your seed. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I don't mean to keep hitting yeah. that. I need to switch that. I mean, you could just go through the text of B if you'd like. I could check the other three to see if you're also there. I mean, if you'd like, Box Boy, that's up to you. I wonder how many tests will Minecraft <gasps> Killer Bunny? No, no, I don't no, know. no, oh, no, 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 no. What is going on? You're just attacking. I was trying to get him. I was trying to get in him. What is happening? Why do I keep getting out of? I mean, at this point, I died. That yes. I understand. But what I mean is, I was trying to. You probably got scared and then slapped all the buttons on your controller. Let's just go back to the safe room. Okay. <laughs> all right. So let me switch out because I like the. Arlen says that the seeds are very helpful. By the way, the ones uh... you just got. Oh, the Pegasus seeds. Yeah. I'm glad. I'm glad. Um. Let's do, I guess that for now. Okay. Okay, so let me get in here. I love the hairstyle and then, of that tree. So now so I good. can just attack with this. So we're gonna start attacking things. Right, right, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, good, cool. good, good, good. I can't attack so that So it's got a though. rock on top of it. Like think of it as like a shell being protected. Okay, can I go up there? Yeah, I think you can. No, I can't. Is this too high? Yeah, this is too Or are you just like high. not aligned yet? Probably need something else to get up there. That sign may indicate something like that. What the like heck? That. What do I- You need to take off the rock. Take the rock off. And then do it. How do I take the rock off? Grab it. Grab it before it can attack you. You got a little too close there, but it's dead now. Okay, so let me read this sign. Okay. My secret. Read in summer when vines grow. Oh. oh. Well, we only have winter. Unfortunately, we do only have winter. What's up, come on? How's it going? Welcome back. Actually, the backpack looks like the gold legend of Zelda cartridge. That is amazing. I'm <gasps> jealous. No! So kangaroos, <laughs> I guess, can't swim. We learned that today. Yes, we did. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm just going to keep going west. Not curious what's over there? Well, I am, but like, there's a lot of things I'm curious about, Doza. So feed that curiosity. Oh my gosh. Looks like you're going to have to be careful. This area seems to be heavily populated with hermit crabs that are very aggressive. Which legendary steed? The game really just said legendary steed with no explanation. Yes. How will you deal with that, Fry? Pegasus. Yes. The Pegasus seeds. I'm so glad we're all on the same page. Let's go. You weren't in Mother Swamp. Well, actually, I lost the key to open the floodgates. Oh, okay. That sucks. Why would you lose it? But there's a lever or a lever. There is your key, dumb. <laughs> you got the floodgate key. You're just gonna call him a dumb? Uh, I was gonna say something else, but I remembered that we were, you know. You dumb dumbo. You dumb, dumb dumbo. <laughs> wow, you just double downed. 
You can get the keyhole in that puddle outside. Okay, good. Okay, bye. Helpful purely because speed. Running fast is great. I love running fast. Oh, right. I should do the thing. That was the thing that you did. You think he can go in it? No. Too, it's too small a hole. That's a whole ass kangaroo. Link is too heavy for like the water. How, like... There you go. It has to be like perfect. It's annoying. <laughs> Um, can I go on that water? Yeah, yeah it's okay. shallow. That water is deep. Um, I have to do something here. It's an owl statue. Yes. What was it? The owl said to feed him the mystery seeds. Right, right, right. Okay. Six. I knew I remembered something. So we want to go to the seed satchel, but we want to do the mystery seeds, and then we want to go... Um, I'm going to go ahead and switch this there. Actually... No, that's bad. Six um, out of seven okay. accounts are new Shindoza. Let's go, Box Boy. See. That's hype. There you go. That's better. How's it going, Andrew? And then Welcome I'll back. Do this. Blue seeds will give you speed. Well, we already knew that, bro. I wonder if that's relevant in some way. What? <laughs> Whoa, what the heck? I wonder if using Pegasus seeds is relevant in some way. <laughs> you know. Maybe you're onto something. I might so be. So at this point, we're going to go here. We're going to go to our seed satchel, and we're going to choose the Pegasus seed. And uh, that's, okay. that's going to be that. Nope, that's wrong. Almost what there. I did. You almost, so, almost had it. Pegasus mm -hmm. seed. There you go. And then I yeah, and I'll then go leave. back. And then have to use one yes. now. Uh, just see how it works. I did. Oh, that was close. I did it. Way to go, babe. I'm proud of you. Okay, so now I need the bracelet. A gentleman that could use more oh, knowledge, wait. you. This what is a that puzzle. reference to? Yes. You can reset the puzzle just by going right and then back left if you ever need to. Uh-huh. Um, I think if I get the... I do that. Yeah. Oh, see, like, switching isn't such a big deal. It is. Okay. Thanks for playing. <laughs> um... So those move, but I can go up here. Always check the optional route. You never know what you're gonna get, right? I guess so. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything that you could use to, like, bring up the dirt. Like some kind of shovel tool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you'd like. I mean, it's up to you. That looks like it might be too hard of a floor. That's a rock. That's a hard floor. Now we're back oh down here. Oh my gosh. Doza, here you go. I need a break. Okay. <laughs> oh, goodness. And hello, Kate. How are you doing? All right, let's try. Call the old man who lost like he that instead of... Yeah. <laughs> just dumb. <laughs> goodness. Some people just aren't as intelligent as others. I wonder if there's anything over there. I don't actually know. Just, just, uh, we'll, we'll, set, we'll have to see because my curiosity is too much. Ah, just as I thought. The soft looking ground is Just soft. chilling. That's always good to hear. Yeah, after our morning, like, calls and everything today, the rest of the day was pretty chill. I actually squeezed in a nap, which was glorious. Yeah, she kind of crashed. She's getting kind of loopy. I was getting loopy. Talking in tongues. <laughs> Not tongues, but, like, I don't know what I was saying. Because, uh, like, I was also hungry because I hadn't eaten lunch yet. And like this morning for breakfast, all I had was like a bagel. So I was like, I'm hungry. And this is like around like one or two o'clock, like been working all morning. Like I'm tired, I'm hungry, delirious. And Doza like fed me. I had some baby corn that I had made that he like heated up and I was able to eat it. It's called baby corn manchuria. It's really, really good. Try it if you're ever in like an Indo-Chinese like place. But anyways, um, <laughs> ate that and then like, Normally, like, I don't want to sleep or, like, right after eating, but I was so tired. I was just saying all kinds of, like, randomness. And so, like, eventually I kind of just, like, just, I don't even remember. Like, I just kind of fell asleep. <laughs> and Doza just let me. <laughs> so that was good. Um, Sometimes you need it. Yeah. I I'm glad I did because I would not be coherent right now if I, I, I think I did. Uh, when we were toddlers, we didn't appreciate the, uh, the concept the, of naps the enough. The gravity of it all. Yeah. Yeah. I think, oh, wow. like, I remember in school, like, we actually had mandatory naps, too. In, like, kindergarten, maybe? I don't remember that, but I don't, I don't really remember kindergarten that much, either. I'm 
not exactly sure. See, I vaguely like remember four? like nap time, or maybe it was just like quiet time. I remember. But, like, I would feel like I should just sleep. <laughs> I remember getting too much lettuce on my quesadilla from Taco Bell and then not eating it there ever again. When I was right, four, right, that's my yeah. core memory for being four <laughs> years old. Anyone else have um, core memories from being four years old? And really, I don't think it's like really the puzzles that I'm struggling with. The thing that I hate the most is having to switch between everything. Because once I like, I jumped off that ledge because of my lack of depth perception with these like cliffs or whatever in these caves. I fell down and I was like, I don't want to switch to the sea to go fast and then go back over there and switch again to the shovel, switch again to this. That's what I'm getting like frustrated with. I'm just constantly switching and because I'm not quick with it all, which is why Doza was making that remark. Like she's finally going to learn all of the buttons, like the select, the start, all of that as a joke. <laughs> <sighs> the time has come when a new power of seasons is needed. This means you must find a doorway to the Subrosian land and go to the Temple of Seasons. Seems like there's gonna be one nearby, Noosh. That's good. Oh, jeez. Is this supposed to be like a Deku? That's exactly what that is. Greetings, let me share my wisdom. South of the floodgates is a strange vortex that seemed to be linked to another world. I offered my wisdom, so buy <laughs> something. A shield for 50 rupees? No. Then be gone. Maybe it wasn't an official nap time. I don't remember. Cause yeah, I don't I don't remember having a full day either of kindergarten when I was in it. But but yeah, I just remember something like I don't know. But I I do love naps and I think as an adult, like I wanna take more naps. <laughs> um Boxer said in Headstar, I had mandatory naps and only ever slept during one of them. <laughs> so would you just act like you're sleeping? Like just you know just pretending. <laughs> I had a history with the principal because awake. he was just confused why the teachers were so mad at me quietly sitting instead of sleeping. <laughs> That's so real. It's hilarious, though. Like, why are they mad if you're not breaking any rules and you're just sitting there? Like, it's okay, right? Because it shows it shows individuality, and that's what that's what a big part of school is designed to stump out. They want you to conform. Yeah, yeah and because even if Boxboy was well behaved, like the let's say hypothetically Boxboy was a model student, right? <laughs> At you don't know if he whatever. was or not. I don't. That's why I said, let's say hypothetically. <laughs> <laughs> the very fact that Boxboy did something that the teachers uh, like didn't say to do teaches the other kids that oh, hold on, maybe I don't have to listen to the teacher. But other kids are are you know they're stupid and they might like act <laughs> up and be a fool. And see you later, Fry. Have a good one. Um, and yeah, hopefully I do get the hang of it eventually. I just, I was struggling with it yesterday too, and now Keep we're just mind, getting more and more items. Very little games have a direct and repeatable necessity for the select button. Noosh understands pausing. She does not really care much about select. And a lot of games recently- Don't use select. They don't. They do, That used to be the map button for a lot of games, including this one, right? A lot of games these days, they put map either on like its own separate item or within like your pause menu in some way. Like, or like it's always there and you always have a mini map. There's just not a lot of reason to have a select button these days. So, there's just, there's not that training. Is that like, does that make sense, Noosh? Does that kind of feel like it tracks? I don't want to speak for you too much. Yeah. What? You can go on the water? Oh, right, the floodgates. Right, the floodgates. Right, right, right. Yeah, we, we went over this. Yeah, we did that. <laughs> I was about to get mad. <laughs> <laughs> Not from year four, but my earliest memory is being a little crying baby. I even remember that I was crying because my mom left the room. I'm surprised that you remember that. But that's cool that you can. I I don't remember a lot of... Like, I only know of things that my parents have told me when I was really, really young. Like, early memories. Back like, in the day? Yeah, like, once... So, I was born in New York, and because of that, like, m the majority of my family at that point was still in India. Um, other than, like, my mom, dad, and brother, basically. And so, after I was cleared by the doctors, like, oh, okay, she's she can fly now. They had told me, like, when we flew to India, like, I was completely quiet. I was just a well-behaved baby on the entire plane ride. Everyone was, like, gushing over the fact that I was so well-behaved compared to, like, other babies on the plane. Um, and all that. And then, once we landed, though, the heat of, like... Once the plane doors opened and like I got off the plane, I started crying immediately because of the heat, because it's a lot hotter there than it was in New York. Um, You're and being such a baby about it. <laughs> but no, like even the transit, because we had flown through London Heathrow, and like 
Uh, my family, like, when they tell me this, they're like, you were fine through the airport, through security, through, like, all of it. Like, everything. But the moment I landed in India and I got out, I just started crying so much that my dad was, like, shook because I had never cried that badly, um, ever. And he was like, I don't care about the luggage. I don't care about all of this. I just need to get this baby to, like, you know, air conditioned to a home, like, right now. Like, really quickly. Like, you know? So, like, he left everything there, just got everyone out, and then went back for the stuff later. And I remember him telling, like, he, like, that was the most that, because apparently it was worse than any crying that my brother had ever done either. Dang, that's pretty intense. <laughs> and in a public place, like, in the airport. <laughs> <laughs> just like, how can this well-behaved baby this entire time now just, like, you know, <laughs> scream? Just act up. <laughs> yeah. That's one of my earliest, like, crying memories that, like, I don't remember, but they, they do. Um, Dang, Noosh, that's crazy. Yeah. I'm so um, glad you're better now. I don't cry because of heat. I can handle it. <laughs> I prefer winter and cold, though. <laughs> uh, you've turned the, the crying into whining. Right. It's moderately better. Oh, square um, jewel. Nice. Random fun facts about gaming. If you play traditional fighters, you have the select button ingrained to your head more than most other people. It is a universal training mode reset. That makes sense. That is funny. I didn't play a lot of fighter games, and when I did, I would just press buttons. I didn't play a lot of fighter games that had a training mode. <gasps> yep, just smash. Violet, uh, did you have to go to the hospital this. for eating a glow stick when you were younger? Did you eat the glow stick? Or I mean, did you drink what was in the what, what, what happened? My smile truly lit up the night sky, which is funny, but like, oh I'm curious gosh. about your health. Like, obviously, you're fine today, but like, what happened? Because those things come with so many hazardous, like, disclaimers and stuff. <laughs> I don't even know what's in one. Yeah. I can only imagine and bad. I, I'm sure my parents did know, like, the tricks as far as, like, getting me on the planes and stuff. They just didn't expect me to react like that to the weather. Um, and yeah, they had to help immediately for that. And, like, it was just not going to happen through immigration. <laughs> <laughs> so high stressful <sighs> situation in, in all around. Yeah, but my parents were seasoned, like, travel. I mean, even to this day, they've traveled to so many countries together just doing all kinds of things so oh noosh what is this fake news about like having difficulty getting out of here watch this what it doesn't you already knew though you no, acted no, no. like you it, didn't no know. it's only the b button oh a is punch you told me a b i asked if that could have been a thing mm -hmm. but you just you were only in here and you never hit the other button why because you didn't tell me it's the, there's two options well go ahead Dozo. okay I missed. Continue on with the game. It's nice getting a little break. Is it? Yeah, because I can drink water. I can, like, sit. You Seems know? like a lot of times I'm the one who's spending time down here in hell. Well, when we originally started this, like, playthrough, we said you were going to do the more difficult part, but you didn't stay true to that yesterday. I did. So we're just trading off occasionally. I did, like, most of the second dungeon, which is technically harder than the first dungeon. So, Ryland's glow stick, uh, thing. It didn't have to go to the hospital. Don't remember much about it. I remember staring at my parents as they walked in. Pretty sure they just cleaned my mouth out and made me spit the liquid out. So you didn't, you, hopefully you didn't, like, ingest it at that point. Well, that's good. Like, you didn't hopefully swallow. Hopefully it's no worse <laughs> than, than swallowing too much fluoride or something. Right? Um... Speaking of swallowing things, if a kid over the age of one swallows a button, battery, give him honey on the way to the earth to minimize damage. Very important to know. I remember seeing, um, um, there's a I Instagram foodie person, uh, content creator named Milk and Cardamom. Her name is actually Hateful, but her username is Milk and Cardamom. She was on MasterChef, um, and got pretty far, um, for the U.S. show. And she actually had that scenario with her daughter, and she had documented the whole thing, um, like, afterwards, talking about it. Not documented, like, from the moment it happened, but, like, she immediately called, like, her cousin, who's a pediatrician, like, as they were headed to the ER, and that's what she had told them as well. So she, like, makes content about it to let everyone know, like, do this. This, like, literally saved her life kind of thing. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it's risky with those little batteries. Yeah, I mean, I don't even know what would happen if I like. I don't. I don't think I've don't ever, do ever it, had Dosa. that happen it's to not me. Worth I'm not, it. No, I'm not gonna like try. <laughs> Twenty gale seeds. I think we have gale seeds. Man, we can't afford anything. We're poor. I need to keep exploring. What does this say? Sabrosia Hot Springs. Sabrosia Seaside. Do you okay. know where you're headed now? Um. Yes, we need to find. Everybody's talking about um some pop star, uh, who has a key that can unlock anything including doors at temples. So we need to find them. 
Where are they? You can find star-shaped ore in the sands That's all I'm looking for. We're not looking for that, but it is useful to get something from uh, the shop. There was one thing that this dude would only trade star-shaped ore. The, the shop in this underworld area, the Sobrosia, is different because they they don't just trade for, like, the currency. They trade for the currency and items. So you just be digging. Yeah, I don't actually remember where this is. <laughs> I don't know where to get the star-shaped ore. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be on the first one, though. What does this guy say? I heard Rosa lost her ribbon. I'm looking for something else she'll like. Well, the ribbon is in the shop, dude. We just saw it. So we need to get the ribbon. Yeah, so we'll, I... And then I, we need to find Rosa. Yep. And then maybe she'll help us with her key that unlocks anything. <laughs> Friends, like, oh my god, it. it took me so long to find it. And Flo remembers who the girl is and is like, maybe you remember them too, Doza. I only know of one other... I only know of one character that has a ribbon that looks like that. And it was something that uh, Noosh had a lot of trouble with. Yeah. Do you remember? Whoa, what the hell? Whoa. Well, it didn't even drop anything. It just hurt me. Ooh, oh, and another one. This it's funny how you did the whole chill. area almost and like nothing and then the last like couple. I know, right? Oh, you mean me. Wait, I'm Noosh. That's Doza. I'm, I'm Doza. Because Doza's the one who would know. Yes. I wish I could go on a date with Rosa just once, but how do I get her interested? With the ribbon. How do I get her to notice me? Oh, I don't know, dude. Just talk to her. Have you tried that? That could help. Can I get the... No, I can't get underneath them. There we go. Nice and easy. A Found star a star-shaped shape ore. ore. Maybe Let's you can go. trade it for something. That's probably what I need to do for do the it, ribbon. Do it, do it, do it. We're just going to go there now instead of instead of exploring. So, so do you need a hint? For what? I don't know. I, I remember this know whole game, and also not her. at all. I don't know. I don't know anything, unless it's Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> a cute ribbon. I'll trade it for star shape ore. How about it? Yes. You got a ribbon. What do we need for this? Rare peach stone? <laughs> uh, I'm good. 20 ore chunks and 10 ember seeds. Well, the Wait, girl with the ribbon was the one we were following, like, all sussily. She didn't want to see us yesterday. You know, that is interesting. So is that the same Rosa? And she lost her ribbon? And we're giving it back to her now? She didn't tell us what her name was, but... She truly didn't. She just didn't want us to follow her. Is that who it is? We got a piece of heart. Turns out it wasn't a rare peach stone. We love hearts. Yes. So finally, we finally filled our first container. Way to go us. Hopefully less deaths in our future. <laughs> yeah, in your future. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about mine. I feel like there's more deaths coming. Well, I mean, at least you're uh, positive about it. Am I? But you're positive you'll die more. Yes, that is true. <laughs> it's nice getting a little break. Rosa's Rose. mystical necklace opens locked doors. Celebrities get the best toys. What makes her a celebrity? Huh. Why are they reacting to us? And we are a tag teaming. I mean, I played for quite a bit and then I passed on to those a little while ago when I got, when I didn't want to switch out to the CZN. <laughs> yeah. What a cute ribbon. Is it for me? Yes. Wow, like, thank you. <laughs> there she is. Now you recognize her. Since you're so nice, I'll go on a date with you. Let's go look in that temple. I'll uh, link the Riz Master. Clearly, all you have to do is get a girl a ribbon. Get a bow. Like, seriously, I wear bows. I love bows. <laughs> you know what? This bow looks a lot like your bow. Yeah, it does. Huh, I'm not interested. That's weird. Huh? I, 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 wow, wonder if there's a correlation. Thought? Who knows? Everyone's looking like, what? He got the date? No oh, way. probably. I should go talk to all of those lonely dudes who would like couldn't get a date. I'm gonna go back and talk to them. That's rude. It's not rude. It's not rude if it's like I can't I, like I can't help it if I'm in a relationship with you. Everyone just has to deal with it. Dude, what? Come on. That's that's okay. That guy was that guy wasn't thirsting over Rosa. It this was the one to the left. Oh, this guy no, wasn't, it was this the one to the left. The one to the left. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Your Bosa, <laughs> like her Bosa. <laughs> there you go. I'm so jealous. I want to date Rosa. Dude, just treat her like another human being or whatever you are. I wish I could go on a date with Rosa just once, but how do I get her interested? Don't say that so close to her. It's weird. Mm -hmm. I love that she just put it on too. It's so cute. It is adorable. <laughs> what? You're dating Rosa? What present did you give her? I'm not gonna tell you, bro. Uh, I treated her like a uh, an equal, and I actually talked to her. 
Crazy, huh? That's I don't like when people talk about you when you're like literally standing right there. It's one of my like pet peeves. Like, that's so especially weird. like that's negatively. Like, I don't know. Obviously, people talk behind people's backs. I feel like it's human nature at this point. Um, well, I actually have but, an issue with that phrase. What? Talking behind someone's back just means you're in front of them. Well, I mean, like, from that one time that we didn't go to, like, the friend hangout, and then they all talked about us, and then another friend told us about it later. That's what I mean about talk behind your back. Not literally when you're, like, turned around. Oh, okay. But in this case, when you're standing in the room and, like, everyone's talking about you, like, it it's just weird, I think. Like, in a negative way, I guess. Facts. They do it on, like, TV shows and stuff all the time, but, like, when it happens to you in person, it's just like, ew, stop. <laughs> Why are you like this? Yeah. People are into the chisme, which I believe is Spanish for gossip. If I'm not mistaken. I wonder if she can run as fast as we can. Oh my gosh, Rose is the keeper. She's down for the adventure. She she fast, she's zooming. Yeah, she's not lying behind you're at all. The temple? Yeah, because she has the key that can open any door. Right, right, like, right. Like maybe a key to a door or another at a temple. Season. Or possibly another season. Yeah, maybe. Ooh, we in here. Um, I pretended to talk about someone to get them to act all slick for being able to see it and use that to make a friend. Never saw the person again after the next one. Oof, box boy. <laughs> it happens. Remember that one Owl House fail where they call a witch tried. a human in German, but in the original they say person and infinity. I've never seen Owl House. Same. Um, we, we had, there's quite a few people in the community who like that show, though. <gasps> oh, we definitely you got that You have come, adorable hero. I am the spirit of summer. I'm summer, in, or in summer, <laughs> vines grow tall and creeks dry up. Remember that. Ancient Hyrulean legends say the hero destined to overthrow evil has a Triforce on his left hand. Perhaps you are this hero. Now I grant you the power of the spirit of summer. Now we'll get those vines to climb up that one thing. They did say the vines grow in the summer. Yeah. Okay, blessed with the summer day, climb atop a stump. We can do that. So I guess our date's over then. Well, what if you can unlock another door? Why not unlock every door that you can with her? I wish we could just be with her forever and just unlock every well, unlock, like, small key door. Spring. And... Well, spring's here. Oh. Unlock, um. What is that other fall. What is that other one? Yeah, is it? Autumn. <laughs> Ugh, we can't get across. Okay. The ore is all in chunks. This guy's not helpful. All right, well, at least we got the vines so we can go out to do the thing. Yeah, that's good. Thanks, Rosa. You have been very helpful. Oh, Best yeah. date ever. Well, yeah, the date was, uh, hey, do you want to go explore that creepy temple? Wouldn't that be cool? I think that'd be a cool date. I mean, she's still kind of with you. She is, which means, like, I don't know, maybe, maybe she wants to hang out with us? What if we just, like, leave? I think we could just leave. I don't want to, though. Because that would be rude. I don't think there's anything else that we can interact with her. I think that was literally all we had. That, that, was, was, close. Yeah, that was close. I want to go see if there's anything else we can unlock at the, um... What do you call it? The dance studio. I want to go back. You can go dance all you want, Dova. I I'm will. good. <laughs> As you can tell from the stream title today, please, no more dance practice. Maybe dance practice. We're about to start practice. Will you dance with us? Let's try. Join us in the circle. Okay. I'm hoping that we get, like, a piece of heart or something. Feel free to talk over this douche. Well, Kate said, a comedian <laughs> that she watches said that she always finds out when someone talks behind her back online. She was referring to her activism. The Kate joked, oh no, people better stop talking about how pretty you are. <laughs> <laughs> and then she replied, oh no, I've gone too far. <laughs> That's, That's funny. awesome. I like how you're crushing this without even saying it out loud, making me look like such a chump from yesterday. Oh yeah, and uh, the volume is much lower too. So I'm really just going off of like visually what it is. I'm crushing it. Yeah, pretty, pretty good. good. Best answer. Here's your prize. 50 or Okay, trunks. well that's pretty good. That gets us that gives us a, a, a comfortable like pillow cushion. I mean that's kind of the same thing. We need to go back through the uh, portal that was next to Ricky. I don't want to go through that one. You know, speaking of dance practice, yeah. when I was younger, my uncle who lived with us for a while while he was like 
you know, doing college stuff or whatever when I was younger, um, he, when he was responsible for taking me to dance practice, he would actually just, like, instead we'd go on a drive and I'd skip. <laughs> and my parents didn't find out for quite a while. Wow. Which was, which I thought was funny. Because, like, you know, I, I don't know. It was just something that I remember. And I always tell that uncle, like, he used to instead, like, we'd go, like, pick up, like, a drink or some food or something. And then we would, like, drive around in his car blasting music. Really? Yeah. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. I think you mentioned that you didn't dance as much as you would have. Oh, we could just keep going on dates. I love dancing, <laughs> but when it's forced on you, it's a little different. Because I was put in Indian classical dancing for a very, very long time, and I didn't really enjoy classical dancing. I prefer more freestyle, just kind of, you know, I think if I was chill. a kid of that age, I think I would have preferred something a little bit more upbeat. And chill. Yeah, yeah, I think classical dancing, based on what I I've mean, seen, is very... It's beautiful. It's just it, you have to it's, be really disciplined. You there's a lot of very... grace involved and... I it's guess not even just grace. It's like no, it's they're a, just so strict about it. Yeah, well, or I, mean, I feel like dancing should be more what, fun. What I'm saying is, what you're uh, what you're striving for is grace. Yeah. And the only way to get it to look right is to be strict. Or to be very perfect. Right? Yeah. There's something that's well, perfect. Yeah. Well. And like, ah, oh, frick. It was just I don't know. There's just a lot of things about that. <laughs> But I do enjoy dance when it's like I want to dance and I want to like you know just have fun with it. Oh, that's what that's for. Smart. Yeah, I mean it can do lots of things. That and hurt enemies from far away. I forget what we're doing next. Ricky's been so helpful. Oh. Oh, what the hell? See, everyone gets hit. Yes, it's it's gonna be okay. We should There's go back the to the vines thing. for the summer. That's. Yeah, we need to go to the stump here. Since we drained the canal, we should always be able to uh, access it, no matter the, uh, what do you call it, the season. So yeah, that's a good idea. Let's go do that, Moosh. I would be too nervous to heckle a comedian, Kate, because <laughs> they would just clap back and they'd be way better. <laughs> I don't want to get called out. Um, also, Flo, I don't know anyone except Kill Bunny? Like, I don't know what that is. I, I, I'm not understanding your comment. I asked earlier. I don't think I got an answer. Oh, okay, okay. I think it's a Minecraft thing. Ah, gotcha. We are still pretty much newbies to Minecraft, even though... I think we um, always will be. I feel like that, too. But we'll be continuing that adventure with Fry the Fishes, um, Minecraft Globtacular adventure that he created. Um, I look forward to finishing it at some point, because at that point, we'll also have beaten Minecraft on the channel. Yes. Which will be insane. So you got a ring! Yeah. Let's go get it appraised! So Vasu left it here, the ring appraisal guy, on purpose, specifically for us. I don't know how he would have assumed we would be the only ones able to get it, but uh, that's what happened. <laughs> um, Kate was also forced into dance class and was not good at it because I don't have a lot of bodily awareness. It was so bad that my dad accused me of being bad on purpose or protest. <laughs> I was not, in fact, doing it on purpose. Oh, I'm so sorry that you had to go through that. It's it sucks, but I'm like, I mean, you know, we're past that now. Now you can make your own decisions, you know. Sometimes um, I'll I'll go back and I'll be like, hey mom, so like you know how this? Well, actually. Why did you do that? <laughs> yeah, I try to explain to her like th you know this is what this was, and I just didn't have the words to ex express it, um, and or you didn't you assumed one way and it was actually another. Yeah. The combination of both. So you see what I'm doing, Noosh? You see these guys that, like, are super annoying? Yeah, you're killing them. Yeah. You're crushing it. But I have to block with the shield to get them to flip over and then and I can And then you like can that. do it, yeah. Yeah. We're gonna try and keep our health really high and minimize the amount of um, two beeps. Okay, beep. what type of dance were you forced into? Was it a specific, like, ballet or jazz or something specific? Or was it kind of just a general dance class? Ouch. And hello, William. Um, which you were here earlier, but, uh, let's see. Pet peeve. Collective groups of families who walk at a snail's pace at the store make me want to summon a mutated kangaroo with boxing gloves to sweep them all away. Yeah, if they take over the whole entire lane, that that's kind of annoying. They should go in a single file line on one side. Uh, we actually, when we were at Costco earlier this week, there was a whole group of people like that, and we were just like, Really? And we went all the way around, because like when we go to Costco, we like to go down every lane because they move everything. Yeah. And so we were like, we'll just go down that one and then come back. <laughs> oh, God. A kiddo hip-hop class? Gotcha. 
Yeah, my parents would never let me no! do that hip-hop class. <laughs> I reject this outcome. <laughs> There's your right, this is hard. Thank you, Doza, for accepting the truth about this video game. I never said it was easy. But you've said it's it's hard. <laughs> yes, th I've said that now. It's and out there. And love right back to you, William. <laughs> <laughs> for sure. Are you grocery shopping right now, or did you, like, do that today, like, at the store or something? Because it can be really annoying right in the moment, mm. for sure. We try to avoid busy times at grocery stores, too. If we can help How it. the heck? Like, we don't go to the grocery store on the weekend unless we absolutely have to, and usually if we absolutely have to, it's for, like, one item or something, and so it's, like, in and out. But if we're trying to do a full stock up, it's usually, like, first thing in the morning when the store opens at, like, certain places, like, on, you know, like, a Wednesday or a Tuesday or something. Well, we try to be, like, there's definitely a certain crowd during certain days during certain times. Yep. What the hell? How do I get this thing to stay down? It's hard, isn't it? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> what is wall masters, Rylan? That's what the the hands are. Oh, that's what I was yeah. like. She knew what that. She just didn't about? remember. I didn't remember. Yeah. Can I hit this with the boomerang? Okay. Probably just a ceremonial table of some sort for sacrifices and such. Oh, the evenings work really well for grocery stores too. That's true. Um, we don't typically like. 8, 8, 8 p.m. Like I mean, three nights a week we're streaming during that time. The but only other thing than about that, the evening grocery store is sometimes there are slimmer pickings on the produce. Yeah, that's something the that we've other noticed thing. at least in our area. And like our favorite like um, Asian grocery stores that we get a lot of produce from, they usually only get groceries on Fridays or Mondays or something like that. Like mm -hmm. they're different schedules for different ones, so we'd like to try to go first thing in the morning, like once they've like loaded up. <laughs> <gasps> I didn't know I could push these. That's how I need to get through the next area. What are the others? What is the other thing called? New sh in terms of like hand enemies, there's the wall. There's the wall the masters. Gloom hands. Well, well, there's gloom hands. Oh my gosh, there's like a recurring theme. Um, the other one. The other one. What the is hands it called? Are always gonna get you. The I don't ones know what that the stick one... out of the ground. I don't know. Uh, I can't remember what I, they're called. I don't remember all the, the floor masters is what Andrew's saying, but that's oh, the one. Oh, yeah, yeah. So there's I wall masters so. and floor masters. Yeah, and there, I think there's a floor master in, like, a toilet. And then there's a master hand in Smash. Skyward Sword. Oh, yes, yes, you're right. Oh, I hate so these So hands guys. have always been around, and they're here to clap. <laughs> yeah, they're here to clap <laughs> some cheeks. Um, And you know, William, we're big fans of breakfast all day, every day. Like, eggs. there's never a bad time to have, you know, eggs, coffee, toast. There's never a bad time to have, like, pancakes, waffles, breakfast, tacos. I mean, yeah. I mean, list them off. That's great. It all sounds good. I ha want all of it. Hash browns. Uh. Orange juice is always great. We prefer mango, but, like, orange is great, too. We actually have a bunch of oranges as, like, snacks right now. It's always good huh. to have, like, a couple of fruit ready to go to grab as a healthy snack rather than trying to grab a naughty snack. Yeah, we passed up on uh, those chocolate chip granola bars because this is basically dessert. Yeah. We, um, we did see, like, the veggie straws were on sale at Costco, so we got those. Which, I don't feel bad about eating that or, like, eating popcorn as much as, like, you know, grabbing a bag of chips, which we try not to buy too often. I don't even really care for chips all that much. Does it doesn't. So it kind of all falls on her. Yeah, I used to eat chips a lot. <laughs> but nowadays, it's kind of like trying to find alternatives. One thing that helps me, though, like, as far as, like, to stay, you know, kind of healthy is I do start every morning with, like, hot water. Um, just heated up water and almonds every single morning. Without fail. Yeah, it's super helpful. Sometimes, I guess, if I sleep in, I don't do it. Because it's not morning anymore. <laughs> but, like, if I wake up in the morning, which is the majority of the time, then yes, that's what I do first thing. And yes, mango juice is a thing. It's so delicious. Mango is my favorite fruit, so we always have so many... Honestly, we have so many types of mango right now. Like, we always have frozen mango. We have always at least one can of mango pulp, like, ready to be used whenever. We always try to have mango juice. Um, fresh mangoes, it depends, because, like, we're in Texas, and I don't know, we don't always have the best mango selection. 
We also always keep green on uh, green mangoes on hand as well, like diced green mangoes, because there's a lot of stuff you can do uh, like cooking wise with that. Um. Well, that's the good. That's yeah. Well, there's of so course. there's so many different types of mangoes. I'm really too. glad that we have variety though, just in general. You what bought? You here? Yeah. You bought a crepe maker recently. Have you used it? Have you been enjoying it? Are you more of a savory or a sweet crepe, uh, like? Taste person. <laughs> uh, and that goes for everybody in chat. Like, oh. do you guys like crepes? I love me a good crepe. I love like savory crepes a little bit more than sweet crepes personally. If you don't, if you never had a crepe, you don't know what it is. It's like a really, really thin pancake. Yeah, with lots of like fillings and stuff. Um, there's also like this Indian savory crepe. Like they they compare it to crepes a lot called dosas. Um, they fill it with this, like, masala, potato, spice, um, stuff, and, like, every- we actually just had those as recently. Um, but yeah, they're- they're good. I'm quite fond of those. Get me yeah. a good filling and some- some real nice, like, chutneys. Oh, man, I'll go to town. Yeah, which is why we bought the coconut, so I can make, like, some fresh coconut chutney. I'll try to record it when I make it. Please do. I'll help. You should. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna just leave it all on you. Imagine if I was one of those people, it's just I, like, alright, make me something and then I'm not gonna help at all, I'm not gonna eat it all. Goodness gracious, right? I, exhausting. you're not that. We, we usually love being in the kitchen together. Usually. Well, what I mean is, like, <laughs> sometimes we can't always be in the kitchen together. One of us has to, like, you know, be working and the other cooks more during, yeah, like, the work Sometimes we week. have to diversify our efforts to tackle the day. <laughs> yes, but when we do get, like, to actually relax a little bit and be in the kitchen together, magical things happen. <laughs> <laughs> I would say so. That's real um, nice of you to, to, to express it in that way. <laughs> means a lot and we should send it to my mom. She she actually knows because obviously she got me on the habit of it. I don't know why it's a lot of a lot of Indian moms did this to us. But my mom, what she would do is she would actually soak them in water overnight, the almonds, and then like in the morning, like that's that's how to have it. I just kind of I, I forget to soak them, so I'll just eat them in the morning instead with hot water, and it kind of does the trick. Um, and Rylan, I hope you get to have some crepes someday. They're pretty dang good. Yeah. Love being in the kitchen to eat, can't cook. Well, you know, you can start learning some basic things. It's never too late to learn. It's not that you can't, it's just that you won't. Until you will, and then you can. <laughs> I believe in you. Yeah. Start off with, like, learning uh, how to make some eggs. Like, there's so many different ways to make them, and they're delicioso. Very. Muy. Muy delicioso. <laughs> Gracias. Um, does a noosh in chat in real life. What change is higher to get hurt from a single... Yeah, I don't know. I've never had a rabbit attack me in um, real life. I saw that, that video of the, of the, of the train, not trainer, but like an animal handler who had to like separate a rabbit from its mate. And it had, they had the female, you know, grabbed by the, the, the skin of its scruff. Um... And the the male rabbit was just going insane, and it was just like boxing like Rocky Balboa, which I guess is the reference to the kangaroo Rocky. And yeah, they, look, sense. there's bunnies right there. I hate them. <laughs> so annoying. Um, <laughs> and it was just yeah, it just did that, and it's like it, people were making comments like, oh, like when you're when you when you invest everything into dexterity and nothing into attack. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, almonds being brain food, that makes sense. They wanted us to be smart. I think we turned out okay. <laughs> also, I love that you like invested in a crate maker so that way you could just make them at home since you recognize that you've been bad at takeout crepes. The strawberry crepe sounds amazing. Enjoy. I need the speed. Um, I had recently made some gulab jamun, which is like these ah. like kind of like deep fried donut holes, but they're in this like rose syrup. It's like an Indian dessert. Um, we finished the, the actual, like, balls, if you will, but we haven't, we have a lot of syrup left over. So, Doze and I earlier were like, we should make, um, either pancakes or waffles to put the syrup over, um, to get that completed. Because we just have, like, a little bowl of syrup in the fridge right now. <laughs> to complete the syrup? To complete the syrup, yeah, to finish it. <laughs> yeah. I love her so to much. To finish it. Yeah. Because we had to pour it over. Because I don't want to make more gulab jamun, so we will just pour we it over some waffles. We need to reach a stage of completion for our syrup. Because, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's like, when you make a homemade syrup, it's a little bit different. And we already had, like, the jamun, like, soaked in them. So it's a little different. 
Yeah. And it's kind of like fusion. It's like making gulab jamun waffle pancakes. You know, that's a great way to put it. Yeah. Man, now I want all of the breakfasty things. Thanks, William. I can do this again. <laughs> okay, let's see. I could see. go for some roasted potatoes or hash browns. I don't know how to make hash browns. Maybe because it's like I'm. I, I I know like how I guess like the concept, but I've never made them. I just feel like it's a lot of effort. You mean to, that like shred that the potatoes? Oh, okay, hash browns. Yeah. Yeah, I got stuck on the roasted potatoes part. I was like, that's yes, why yes, I, you do. Yeah, that's why I usually <laughs> just roast them because like I'll just. For br our breakfast potatoes, our go-to is usually just like peeling, dicing, seasoning, and then cooking, right? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my Nutella, god. bananas, and strawberry case. That sounds delicious. We did That's a pick good combo. up some Nutella. Um, with like spring and summer coming up, we were like, let's get some Nutella. Because we haven't had Nutella in a while. And um, with Mother's Day coming up next month, uh, we know like Dose's mom really likes, I wonder if she's listening, this would be awkward, but she likes our Nutella brownies that we make. Whoa. So we're thinking of making our batch. I gotta be Because we haven't made here. them in a couple years, I feel. Yeah, it's been a while. That's trivia, it's making me dizzy. I need to kill all of these. Imagine this on a really small screen. Uh, yeah, How it's did not you lit do up. It? It's not lit up. No backlight. How did you do it? I just did my best, you know? Ooh. You got Rock's <laughs> Feather. Congratulations. Yeah. That was a very good ooh indeed. I love Rock's Feather. You wanna why? know why? What does it do? Go ahead and hit that B button right there. I'm gonna hit the B button. What does that do? It makes you jump? Yeah. Try moving and jumping at the same time. Get some height on there, yeah. So does that mean you can jump over stuff now? Yeah. Why am I here? Doza! Yeah, okay, I got it. <laughs> I just had to jump, but now this <laughs> happened. Well, luckily for you, there was a floor underneath. So now we you have, have Mario has jumped kind of clearly. Green Mario, not Luigi. Oh no, poor Luigi. I wonder if there's any Mario references in these games, because I, I wouldn't be able to remember them. Yeah, we fall here, we're gonna fall on the higher area. There we go. When you say low sugar chocolate hazelnut spread, is it like a different, I'm assuming it's not Nutella, it's like a uh. different brand, potentially? That's smart to make it a bit better. <laughs> I, I don't know if there is a low sugar Nutella. I haven't seen any variants. No, it's just straight up Nutella. Ah. Um, I think like three years ago, maybe, um, Nutella actually sent us a bottle for World Nutella Day with Nush and Doza on it. Um, obviously, that bottle is long gone, but we kept the label. <laughs> yeah. We're like, well, we can't just keep the the, the bottle because, you know, it's Cause plastic. Because will eventually and rot. You it know? will, ah, yeah. Whoa. But we wanted to keep the memory. And this is kind of like Mario, the ah. bricks and everything. I fell. It's crazy. It's like they knew what they were doing. Now I remember. Now that you said that, I remember there is a reference. Can you I think jump? it's in Link's Awakening. No. <laughs> <laughs> keep in mind, this was 2001. But, I mean, this game already looks a lot better than Zelda 2. You remember Zelda 2? That was a side-scrolling Zelda game. That was. And this is like the most... This is like the closest homage, I guess. Okay, okay. You <laughs> need to be careful. There we go. I'm not gonna rush it. I thought that it was not gonna get that close. Here we go, here we go. Remember when they added, like, the Link mode to Super Mario Maker 2? That was fun. They have Lincoln. Oh, yes, yes, yeah, I remember, yes. That was pretty cool. Oh, don't forget to give it the seed. Thank you, Noosh. You're welcome. Mystery seeds unite. Even if you're not playing, you're still part of this playthrough. Of course, 100%. <laughs> Jumping up and on, and on will send you even higher. Okay. Ump and on what? On everything, really. Ump and on. You're oh. so quick at selecting everything. I love it. <laughs> it's why I guess I say it's like, yeah, it's not really that big of a deal. Because you're used to it. Yeah, I suppose I am. You're a lifelong gamer. That's pretty fun. I love the trampolines. That's awesome. That's what you that thing was compass. earlier. Now we can see all the chests and stuff. Let's yes. go ahead and look at the map. We haven't looked at it at all. Each map usually is in the shape of something. Like this one's in the shape of... Well, a, a crab. A crab, yeah, that's... Yeah, you know what? 
Poison Moth Slayer, but it's probably a crab. <laughs> a moth. <laughs> well, I didn't read it first. I was just looking at it to see what the shape felt like to me. You guys see it, right? Better. And maybe we were on the beach earlier. There were crabs. Yeah, is this more of a crab crabs. or a poison moth? <sighs> Whatever it oh, is. Oh, look, there's this too. This is more like a chest, though. Sure. If I, had to, if I had to guess anything. I can never tell if something's meant to be taken as top down or like side to side. You know? <laughs> I like how you said, uh, because of chorus. Yeah, most things here are so unhealthy. Oh. I don't know what the U.S. does this. I don't know. And Flo, are you referencing the Goombas? Because Link's Awakening had the Goombas, I'm pretty sure. I think Apparently, that's what I was thinking of. you can have the boots and the feather. And, and the will, fur? Let's go. And it'll bring you far. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pegasus and the feather. Oh, like combined. Oh, that's combine that's that. crazy. And hello, Twinkle Toes. How are you doing today? Hello. How's it going? Oh, I can just jump so over this. So you can this jump over Instead those. of like having to go all the way around. <gasps> and a jump. All right, I'm leaving. I don't want to deal with these. No one wants <sighs> to deal with them. Oh, I can't jump over this though. I need to get over there. You're, you're making progress. This definitely does take us farther. So that opens up some options for us, not just in this dungeon, but the overworld too. If you remember, there's plenty of. Oh, uh, oh, oh, it went down. Yeah, it's a thwomp. Right? Sort of. Are they it's called got an eye. Oh, oh. <laughs> I just get scared you're going to die every time. Well, just jump oh, right before you hit the ground. Oh, is that a moth? No, it's ah. a light. It's just a light in the background. It's, it's called <laughs> it keeps, ambiance. It keeps opening and closing. I, I do like the ambiance. Oh, well, that's so sweet. I mean, I know, the, I know you like the graphics, but the ambiance, that's another thing. You know what other game has a good ambiance? A lit Double candle dragon. can do so much. If only we had one. We have candles, we just don't use them as often as can we I should. Can I move this? Hold on, let me see if I can move this. Doing all right, currently falling down yes. the rabbit hole of my obsession with Bluey again. Aw. <laughs> I, is you Bluey- the game? I wonder if you have. I think it's on Xbox Game Pass, right? It is. It is on Xbox Bang Sh Bad. People told us like the games like we've heard mixed reactions, but people did say that like it's really bad. So, I believe like, the base Peppa Pig game is also on Game Pass. Oh. And we played that one, so I don't know if we should play Bluey at some point. Well, I recently listened to this is like kind of relevant. Uh, I recently listened to um one of Matt Pat's theory videos about like how oh. to introduce like gaming to somebody who hasn't like gamed before. And it's and, Bluey. Yeah, well, he kind of used his son as like the guinea pig for this because obviously he's being introduced. The kid's sure. like what, like five years old now? Yeah, it's crazy. And um, through like a lot, a lot of games that they've like introduced to him weren't games that like Matt Pat would have grown up with. It's actually a lot of Paw Patrol. Like different Paw Patrol games, because apparently those are those, huge. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently those have certain like elements that are very like beginner game friendly, and like you can actually learn like how games work when you have never like interacted with a game before. And obviously, it's about cute puppies, I imagine. So that's always gonna score well with kids. You know, maybe different uh, if you like were to throw Paw Patrol at your grandma. <laughs> so, yeah. you know, your mileage may vary on that front, but I thought it was a really interesting video of like, he's like, okay, so now this game, the point of this game is to introduce like moving in a 3D plane. And the purpose of this game is to teach them yeah. like how to interact with like platforms and stuff. And it's like, oh, okay. You fell. Oh, you wanted to. Yeah, I, want, I wanted to. Got it. Um, As far as like spoiling a reference that we 100% won't see in this run, how do you know, Flo? Like, you know? <laughs> um, and we can draw the Triforce without putting the pencil down as long as we can go over some lines. Yeah. Yeah. That's... We've done it. We've drawn the Triforce so many times. We've even done the Triforce with the heart, which is the emoji that you used. Uh, a glob force, if you will. <laughs> Isn't it great? Yeah. Oh, can um, you draw this particularly without putting it down? And hey, Chris. Yeah, just draw over How are you doing? Lines. It's, be um, fine. it's okay. You can unequip this sword. It won't kill you. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I feel called out, and I'm fine with that because it's so true. I always had the sword. Okay, so because Noosh is part of this playthrough as well, I'm being forced to put sword on the A button. Because that's just, what I've learned. That's what she's learned, and, and keep, she's not going to yeah, let go of it by this point. I'm not. So now, like... It, Though I still panic press B. Yes, that is still something that happens. Because you wanted to put it on B. 
Like, I understand, but you had A always as your bomb, and every time you talked to somebody, you tried to kill them. <laughs> on accident. Yeah. Accidente. Oh, it's just if you enter a code. Do you want to know what the spoiler is, Doza, then? Hello? Like, flow's, like, code thing with the oh, game. Oh, so, yeah, I was gonna talk about this a little earlier, and yes, go ahead. Um, so while there isn't a link Wait, cable, Rylan says no. No? Okay, then don't, don't do it. Never don't, mind. don't do it, flow. Backspace. Don't do it. Backspace, no. backspace. Don't spoil the code stuff. Backspace. There's something, yeah, no spoilers. Not unless everyone here agrees and the, the glob has spoken. I guess I'm not sure what, how, how That's serious That's true, this... we don't know. Okay, no spoiler run. <laughs> um, Flo got it. Now you're getting it. <laughs> Way to go, Flo. And Twinkle's Toes, uh, thanks for telling us about the Bluey game. Congrats on beating it. Um, I'm wondering Ooh. if, like, since we've never seen Bluey at all, <laughs> um, like, if we should play the game and that can Is be our okay first introduction. Yeah, like, maybe, like, we never saw Peppa Pig before we played the Peppa Pig game. You know? I, yeah, that's true. If you guys plan on playing both games, you don't spoil codes. To oh, good to oh, know. Oh, okay. I had no idea. Context. And yes, we do plan on playing, um, what was it called? Oh, the I'm other dying. one? Oracle of Ages. That one. We don't know when we're going to play it. We have a couple of other games after this one that we're going to be tackling. Um, so it may not be for a while, but... I mean, at this point, I think everyone knows we don't play two, like, games of back-to-back -back for the most part. No. Except for that one time when we played we Breath did. of the Wild, and then we played Tears of the Kingdom right after, because we were trying to beat all of the games before Tears of the Kingdom released, and we were crushing it right down to the wire there. <laughs> Was that literally, like, the day before kind of thing? Kind of, yeah. Jeez, we're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that was our biggest streaming goal, and, like, once they dropped the release date for Tears of the Kingdom, we were trying so hard, and we did it. It was great. Um, and this is actually the first ga Zelda game since Tears of the Kingdom finished for us that we're playing again. I know. Yeah. Isn't it nice? It is nice. It's great being back here. Oh, no, I have the sword still equipped. What are we gonna do? Um, Peppa Pig is unfortunately Twinkle Toes' childhood, so it's shocking to hear people who never watched it before. Yeah, my childhood was like Arthur on PBS. Blues Clues, Teletubbies, Arthur, um, a lot of I didn't of really watch Teletubbies. I can't believe it. I just knew the references. I'm I've like, always been a supporter of foreign media. I, me too, even more so than you. In the form of Teletubbies and anime, I don't know about that. I watch a lot of foreign films. Oh, yeah. Okay. Compared to you. Yeah, I watched uh, Dragon Ball Z, The Tree of Life. Sure. I, I also watched a foreign film. Yeah. <laughs> but who's seen more? Me. Me. No, Doza. There's no way. You've seen more English things than me, but other languages, it's always me. Like, I've seen, like, Arabic stuff, uh, like, Hindi stuff, Telugu stuff, Kanada stuff, Malay. Like, I've seen so much movie. more. Those, I just listened to so many languages that you've never even seen before. <laughs> not to mention, like, I'll watch every, uh, not every, but like a majority of the foreign film, like, entries for, like, the Oscars and stuff. Korean. Okay, you can have your win on this one. Yeah. Thank I you. obviously can't remember every single foreign film I've seen. So. <laughs> Unlike you, who just has the list ready to go at any I, given moment. I do. Just in case. Just in case, yes. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Grew up watching Blue's Clues and Team uh, yes. Umizumi. I've never heard of Team Umizumi. There was a but... show called Code Lyoko. That was. Weird. I think like that song from Blue's Clues, like we just got a letter. I wonder where it's from. We just got a letter. We I'm just sorry. got I'll a letter. Ahead. Wonder who it's from. Is it who or where? I bet it's who. Is who that? it's from? Where it's from? I mean, who cares where it's from? It's about who wrote the letter. Well, you know? yeah, I guess so. Unless it's like a postcard and it shows where it's from. Do people still send postcards? You guys like getting postcards? I know we do. Wait, no. Yes, we do. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking I mean, on a technicality I, basis. I love snail mail. We actually, you know, on Patreon, we have a goodie level tier. One of my favorite things to do every single month is to create these little mail packages to send out to our lovely patron globs. Um, it's a lot of fun. We create these like little motivational inserts and then we have some like stickers or magnets or like little goodies that we create. And it's just, it's nice to know that something we packed and created here is being sent um, across the globe at this point <laughs> to other countries and stuff too. We actually have to buy like stamps and that's always fun to get a good deal on, but also like the designs. Right now we're in this whole like flowery theme mm -hmm. <laughs> just cause like it's spring. But we'll probably use them until we run out because like, you know, <laughs> we're not gonna change them out just for every season. Ouch. 
But yeah, mail is fun. I'm so glad that you've been finding so much joy in it. I, I do, yeah. And like when we've received mail too, like it's nice like to open up a letter. Like, you know, it's different than opening up an email. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're not wrong about that one. Got some postcards that you got by playing Mario Odyssey um, at Best Buy before release, collecting dust. Feel free to send one our way. <laughs> we'll shout you out and everything. <laughs> <laughs> we certainly will. Um, we actually have some old Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, Let's Go Pikachu. No, no, no. Um, what, Sword and Shield. Sword and actually. Shield, I'm sorry. Pokemon Sword and Shield postcards. They're super outdated. I'm wondering if we should do like a random like, would you like a old Pokemon postcard sent to you from us? And just put it out there, maybe for law points, like just as a redemption. Yeah, that could work. If you guys, are any of y'all interested in getting one? <laughs> <laughs> and handwritten letters slap. I think a lot of people like struggle with reading, um, reading like just handwriting general? sometimes. Oh, okay. We we do when we write thank you notes. Sometimes I will handwrite them out, um, but typically we'll type them out and then sign it kind of thing with our signature. But we use a fun font. We use our font, our glob font, the same font that our names are written on uh, the stream overlay with. Yep. Ooh. Um, What's down and yeah, way? we never saw Team Umizoomi. Should we watch it? Is it good? <laughs> Is that uh, the show where like, it's it's a, it's a girl and her friends and then they have to, they have to like kill the viruses or something? They're like, a police force of some sort, maybe that. Maybe oh, that's it. Twinkle Toe, speaking of Avatar, which is obviously an amazing show and really good taste in shows if you like Avatar, um, did you hear about the concert finally coming to the United States and a bunch of other places? Uh, the tickets went on sale yesterday. We actually forgot to look them up for um, our city, but we're thinking about going. If, Hopefully, like, we haven't the date, missed out. I don't think we've missed out. And I also think like there's plenty of dates in San Antonio, Austin, Dallas. We have a couple of options for us. Mm -hmm. Um, just gotta figure out if we can do it. Are you gonna go, Twinkle Toes? I I'm hoping we can. We went to... It would be kind of cool, because, like, so far together as a couple, we've gone to two symphonies. I mean, the Zelda symphony we've gone to twice, but we also did the Sonic symphony, so it'll be great to add, like, Avatar to the mix. There's also an Elden Ring oh symphony happening, but it's in... It's in like Scotland or something. It's in the UK. I'm hoping they do a world tour as well, though. Hopefully, because the, the DLC is going to come out. Maybe they'll announce it after. Maybe. That would be cool. They'll add the DLC music. Wouldn't that be amazing? Yeah. More hearts, please. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. There we go. There's, um, also, since like Chris mentioned Best Buy, I was going to say, Doza really likes going into Best Buy just to walk around. Does anyone I've, else like that? I've been liking it less and less, though. I feel like... It's gotten worse. Yeah, I, I, feel, I feel like everybody's going online. more online. Yeah. And the stores are reflecting that, and it's making me sad. Is mall culture going to be dead soon? I feel like it's been dead. I feel like really? you have to have some kind of unique gimmick to like be a mall these days. Do people still like hanging out at the mall? Because we don't. I don't think so. Maybe shopping strips at most? I mean, that's what I did when I was growing up. There were malls to hang out at, but... Well, I did enjoy a good trip to the mall, like, with friends to walk around and everything and like, you know, try on stuff and you couldn't really afford much, but <laughs> <laughs> it was good to window shop, if you will. Oh, yeah. I spent a lot of time in, at American Eagle. Yeah. Yeah. Back when that was a thing. I don't think American Eagle's around anymore. Oh well. I never was really big into like Hollister, Amber Crombie, and Fitch because they were just so pricey and the their stores smelled so strongly of cologne and perfume and things like that. It wasn't really my uh my scene. Chris I guess says you could it say. still is. So it still, still like, is? Yeah. I'm sure people still do, like we just don't. But... I still have a wallet from there. My aunt um... gave it to me. Do so, Flo, your whole list there. I know Doza watched Power Rangers growing up. I really didn't unless it was on because my brother was watching it. Um, also, Tom and Jerry always slaps. We still enjoy watching clips from Tom and Jerry like when it cop pops up on our feed. Tom and Jerry is so good. Apparently, there was a lot of drama back in the day with Cat Concerto, the piano episode, and there's also a, a Bugs Bunny piano episode. episode yeah. And it's like the same... It's the same premise... And Bugs Bunny is even also dealing with a mouse, and it's the same song, if I'm if I'm recalling it correctly. And one of them won the Oscar, and the other one didn't that year. 
So there's, yeah, Ooh, there's, there's a spicy. lot. There's, I, I want to learn more about that. <laughs> it's super spicy. I can't imagine it being 1945 or whatever. And like getting up in arms about, you yeah, know, which cartoon whatever, was the best yeah. one. Like, I wish I could meet those people. <laughs> Most of our shopping is done um, online these days. We don't really go in person as much to like try on. Like, I can't even remember the last time I was in a fitting room. I will just buy stuff online. Try them on my home, and then if I need to return it, return it. But if not, like, you know, it is what it is. The inconvenience of having to return something is less than having to go in and, like, fight for clothes and then... Um, <laughs> fight for clothes. Well, sometimes... I don't know. This has been my experience. But, like, I'm a very... I'm a very popular, like, combination of sizes. And in a town... Where there's a lot of people who look like you and who are around your size, that means that selection is going to be lower. Mm -hmm. I'm not a big hulking giant, and I'm also not, uh, like, you know, I'm not a twink either, so... <laughs> <laughs> it can be difficult to find things like, in the color of like, the size that I want. Yeah, and sometimes like with Doza, like he's not short, but like sometimes it'll be long for him, even though the top fits perfectly. Like it'll just be a little too long, and like why? <laughs> I can never be happy. It's, so we always for his suits and stuff, we get them like custom made, which is great. Um, or like better. we'll buy a bigger size and we'll get it tailored down. Yeah, there's al that's always that's, an option. It's always a little bit cheaper doing that too. Um, and we've noticed quite a few, like, Japanese, like, stores opening up in our city as well. There's um, always been a strong, just in general, a like, strong Asian presence. Yeah, there's actually this anime, like, convention over this past weekend that was happening. We didn't even know about it. <laughs> well, we have San Japan. I think we have an anime expo. We have um, so there's many There's Comic-Con. There's, yeah. there used to be PAX, although that's not really, uh, not happening Asian anymore. specific, but, um, oh. or happening anymore, that too. But yeah, there's a lot of things, <laughs> surprisingly. It, you just, it doesn't get the fanfare of like, Oh, watch out, New York Comic Con. Oh, New York Big Apple. Um, <laughs> so Team Umizumi, it's about a girl named Millie who has pattern go. power. Geo who has like shape stuff, so only don't look it up. Um, oh, totally didn't look it up. <laughs> a robot and then saving the day and stuff. So, oh, so kind of like Power Rangers, but different. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. Um. Okay, so I like the theory that Tom and Jerry are actually good friends and have to put on a show for the owner of the home so she doesn't kill Jerry. I like that. I think that that's, that's sometimes cute. kind of more or less the, the plot. But Yeah, um, <laughs> but they don't explicitly say it because it's more like better to keep them as frenemies. There are episodes where like the owner's like, Tom, you better get rid of that mouse or else. <laughs> and it's like, well, that means Tom was just being like bros with Jerry the whole time yeah. until this interaction, right? That's and, probably what it was. And hello, Jazz. How are you doing this Friday Eve? Hopefully well. I hope so. <laughs> and Kate, you know, it's funny. I had to send my driver's license to someone today, so I was looking at my height on there, and it says 5'6", but I think I'm more like 5'8". You're closer to a 5'8". Yeah. I think, like, I just never updated, like, the, the height on the thingy. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm like 5'8". It's not like the DMV is like barreling down the door to get your height exact. No, and yeah. like the past few times for renewal, I haven't gone in. I've been able to just keep the same photo <laughs> and like just update the address. <laughs> so, yeah. Give me a heart, please. And Doze is a little bit shorter than me. Very slight, like a centimeter. Maybe two. <laughs> Maybe 2.54 centimeters. <laughs> There's no way to really tell. It's impossible. Oh boy. Careful, Noosh. We got a poison mop on our hands. What? Why is this game so much harder than A Link to the Past? Because it's a hard game. I guess. Oh my god. I only have three hearts <laughs> left. How ah, dare you be no. so tall? I was hoping if we ever meet up in the city, you would be close to my short butt. <laughs> yeah, people are always shocked, which actually today, when I had to send my driver's license for something, um, for this work thing, uh, someone had said, I did not picture you to be this tall. And I was like, actually, I'm a little taller than what my driver's license says. So it's funny that you're asking today, like, when that literally happened this morning. Because, <laughs> like, when you're, I guess I've never met these, like, people. I've been working with them for years, but it's always online. So, like, they see me on Zoom and things like that. They don't see me, like, you know, completely, like, standing up ever. And they were, like, kind of oh my God. shook. Because comparatively, like, they're 5'2 and 5'4. And I'm like... 
Oh. <laughs> so if we ever meet, we're gonna do the whole like uh, your network <laughs> bars, like tallest to shortest kind of situation. But yeah, I'm me and my brother are really tall. He's actually like six two. Um. So like he. No, he's a bit of a giant. Yeah. Yeah, he's really tall, and um. Uh, we. My parents aren't though. Like we're both taller than both of my parents. I don't know where the height comes from. Maybe my grandpa, but like he passed when I was a baby and like I knew he was tall though from like the photos. I don't know exactly how tall he was though. Um, you're shorter than that. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's regardless of height, like that, that doesn't matter. You have a wonderful personality and I look forward to um, hanging out. <laughs> Let's go. We got the bright sun. An essence of nature. Young shoots grow quickly under the warm rays of the I, bright sun. <laughs> well, I am not a six three. I said my she's brother. Not. No, I said, she's not. My brother is six two. Not me. Um, and we played basketball, so like you know, height's really important. Yeah, there. you couldn't really connect with Tall Girl. I could not connect with the movie Tall Girl. Doza loves to hate on that. Um, <laughs> we never saw the sequel though. I'm not a superhuman. Doza's just a Whoa. little bit shorter, but Thank it's great because I don't have to wear heels. Unless I want to. Right. Which is rare these days. I too feel a bright sun. I dreamt of the waterfall on the mountain north of Sunken City. Perhaps the next essence is near. Essence is near. There. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Very cute. Um, I love pineapple on pizza flow. I think it tastes great. I love loading my pizzas with a bunch of veggies. I'm talking bell pepper, onion, uh, black olives, sometimes Palomata olives, um, mushrooms, like fresh tomato on top of like the sauce and stuff too. Um, what other vegetables do I like? Sometimes I like artichokes, like it just hits different and like sometimes. Mm -hmm. I also like having um, red onion, which is great. Um, I like red yeah. onion cooked. Well, you can cook it and then put it on. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, I, I kind of have to. I don't mind eating raw red onion, though. Like, on the side of, like, some Indian stuff, like, I like to have raw red onion to, like, kind of cut through the heat. Mm -hmm. It's popular to do that. Oh, hello. We got a gem earlier. Jewel fits perfectly. We need to find three more gems. Wow. And we need to get treasure maps from the Horon shop. Where's There's a that? lot happening here. Yeah. But we made it back to it and more like, oh. you you hate oh, tall turn. girl me too oh my god <laughs> i played uh dmc3 a lot today and i'm actually almost done with the game after playing it sporadically over a year and i'll i uh, i'll stalling by playing the beginning levels again aw <laughs> um congrats on almost Ugh. beating it though that's awesome jess ah. i can't I, believe I, it i oh. do appreciate and love that you like you know, really savor your games. Like, even with, like, Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom and stuff, like, you were never in any rush. You are like, I'm just going to do this, you know? It's really nice, like, especially when you talk about your journey with games. Because I feel like, I don't know if it's because of we're streaming it or what have you, but sometimes we do rush ourselves more than we probably should. And, like, when we hear about experiences from you or others, like, it's, like, nice to know, like, you know what? Nah, like, we don't have to rush. Let's just, let's just go with it. Yeah, it's difficult. We'll play the same with, like, game uh... for one year. <laughs> I'm just, like, on stream, I feel like people might get bored of it, but, like, for us, if we're not bored of it, if we're enjoying it, like, you enjoy DMC3, like, why not play it for a year or two years, what have you? Like, Doza still plays Elden Ring regularly, even if it's not on stream, and he's thoroughly enjoying it this entire time. Yeah, secretly I've been everything. enjoying it. Yeah. <laughs> Um, cases. I think my brother was secretly happy that he ended up meeting his love in Japan because she is in fact shorter than him. <laughs> I don't think height matters for relationships. Like, I know that was a big thing. That was actually something that like my dad said, like when like I you know had told him about like Zoza and stuff originally. Like, is he taller? That that was one of the questions. Like, why does that matter? <laughs> and to be fair, like I couldn't really remember like what to say. Like, is he shorter? Or is he taller? Because I never really looked at that or thought about that. Well, good on you. Because we, like, I don't know. Like, our relationship, like, started pretty quickly. Well, I'm glad that uh, you're fine with me not being, you know, like, like the size of Thor. The size of Thor? <laughs> yeah, I don't know how much truth to, like, put that stock into, because if there was ever for, if there was ever for a reason that I could come up with 
for Did someone to not be like romantically interested in me, it was probably not height. It, it's more, it, it's deeper than that for a yeah. lot of people, and I think to assume that height carries so much weight, I'm sure it does for some, but like if you're if you're around good people, it probably doesn't weigh as much as you think. Yeah. Um. There's usually other more important most, things, like you know, if I, you're a douchebag or not. I will say this though: most of your family is very short. <laughs> yes, they are. How dare they? <laughs> like I'm taller than pretty much the majority of your family. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Unless someone's through marriage, I think you're taller than all of them. Yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, careful. Oh, there we go. Uh, Mario Luigi Bowser's Inside Story, as we see, still watching streams here. We appreciate that, Andrew. That is a game that's been on our list for a while as well. Um, we'll actually be starting the Paper Mario series soon um, after this game. But uh, Mario and Luigi is also series that we should hopefully get into. But I'm glad you're enjoying it. We saw Fry stream a little bit of that game in Discord, and it's like, it's literally Bowser's inside, you know? <laughs> it, inside Bowser. Yeah, like Bowser's it's kind of crazy. I didn't take it literally until I learned what it was, and I was like, that's wild. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cool, right? Yeah, and as far as which one, we're going to be starting with the first one, Paper Mario. We're starting a new uh, Mario series, essentially, because the Thousand Year Door Remastered comes to the Switch next month in May. So we're hoping, like, we're going to do this game, then we're going to do Paper Mario, and hopefully squeeze in another, like, indie game that we may have y'all choose, and then do Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. Just depends on the timing a little bit, but I think we can do it. Um, I'm, I have faith. Yeah, I think we're gonna and be then, fine. um... The only other like thing that we know for sure, like based on a date happens, will be um, in June when Elden Ring releases that we're hoping to start on release day, the DLC. Yes. Yeah. And Tears of the Kingdom one year anniversary stream in May. That's a wonderful idea, Rylan. You know, recently we put out that poll for like that random, like what should we do, you know, for the one day stream on a Friday. I was so surprised that um, one, playing with viewers didn't get a lot of votes, like, to go back to, like, Mario Kart or Mario Party or something like that, but also, let's return to a community favorite, which was probably gonna be Tears of the Kingdom, um, or, like, Super Mario Odyssey, like, people didn't really vote for those two, they just wanted a new indie game, I was shook. I was shook I did well. not expect that, so it's been, it's interesting to see, but yeah, we could, I mean, we... We would definitely love to revisit Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> I can't believe it's been almost a year. <laughs> oh, <sighs> just this glaring hole in our chest. Yeah. Our I mean, chest. when we played Tears of the Kingdom with release day and everything, some of those early shorts that we put really popped off and helped us. They did, yes. Yeah. Uh, community definitely grew with that game. And we'll all always be grateful for that. Yeah. We met some really wonderful people during that time. Um, oh gosh, what is I think the men in my family just want to feel like they can physically protect their loves. The men in my family do tend to be quite strong. Aw. Yeah. I mean, I know Doza can protect me. He's done it. <laughs> so it's nice to have a man that can, like, help, you know, support. But, like, also women these days are very, like, you know, we're strong, we're capable, we're independent, too. In both ways, like, in a couple, in a relationship, friendship, like, protect each other. Yeah, but in, in, in a pinch, you know, 2v1 is better. <laughs> yes, that's true. <laughs> Come at us, there's two of us. <laughs> Bill, watch out. Um, also, just, I also just don't have time to play games as often as I did when I was in high school, and sometimes I think about playing a game instead of actually just picking one and playing it. We I definitely... I resonate with that a lot. Yeah, there were times before we started this streaming journey... Um, where Doza would be like, I want to play a game, and he'll literally, like, it'll be like an hour or two pass by, and I come back, and he's like, I haven't even played yet. And I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> Basically nothing. Yeah. And, you know, when we started all this, too, it was because we really bonded early in our relationship, especially because we were long distance for a while, too, of, you know, playing games with each other online, that once we moved in together we did not play as many games together as we thought we would have. We thought like, oh my gosh, now we're going to play games every single day together. It's going to be awesome. We're going to cook together. We're going to do this. We're going to do that. But like now that you're living with someone, you're 
your whole lives get kind of intertwined, right? Especially when you're living with someone who's like a romantic relationship, like you're working, you're cleaning, you're doing all these other things that take priority over just sitting back and relaxing. Whereas before you had your responsibilities, but you also made and set aside time specifically for gaming because that's the only time you could have hung out with a person. Pretty much. So there was a huge dynamic shift in that, that like we actually, I think like when we first started streaming, it was like, hey, this is an intended like thing in our schedule to play and experience more games together, even if it is just for two hours, like a couple of nights a week kind of thing, you know? Yeah. And I think for us, obviously streaming has helped to experience more games because outside of streaming, Doza plays Elden Ring right now. I really don't have a game right now. I'll play Overwatch occasionally, but it's usually only on Saturday nights. Sometimes if I wake up in the middle of the night, I'm talking two, three o'clock in the morning, then we'll hop on Overwatch and then go back to bed. <laughs> but other than that, <laughs> it's like that's- the only thing that soothes her. It, it's the only game that will like <laughs> get, you know, the competitiveness out of me, the whatever's on my mind Whatever out of anxiousness. me. Yeah, and then yeah, I can get back to that. sleep, yeah. That's good, because either but, you win a lot and you feel great, or you feel down and defeated, and you might as well just go to sleep because you're tired. Yeah. So uh, either way, it works. Win but or lose. We, but if we didn't have streaming, like if we weren't doing this, and of course all of the lovely friends and all of y'all that we've met along the way, like we probably wouldn't be playing as much games How, as we did. Like what? I'm just there's there's a ton of games out there, and there's lots of things to like share with each other. But, like definitely Nushindoza gives me a massive excuse to be like, hey. Let's play Oracle of Massive Seasons. That's a privilege. <laughs> yeah, and a privilege, yes. Let's play Oracle of Seasons. Well, let's do like, it. Because this would I don't know. It, it's hard to think. Because we were... There were times, like, when once we moved in together, Doza would sometimes still play with, like, the boys online and stuff. But I was... There was no time for me for some reason. I had to intentionally set aside, and it was usually, like, a Saturday or Sunday morning thing. But I'm glad that we're we're doing all this like oh, look at we've like experienced over like hundreds of games to go oh, not hundreds but like uh, over 160 i think is like the last count or something maybe. yeah around there Wait, and it's just or it's fun close. there's a new character hello welcome um, I, thought I am Faro, oracle of secrets this Ooh. is the hall of secrets where your secrets take form at times and places you will hear powerful secrets at those times, come see me. I can give you shape and form to your secrets. Secret, secret. <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess we haven't heard any secrets I yet. I thought it was, it was a few centimeters tall, purple glob on the corner of live streams, and the same height as you. She was a light blue glob. So, like, our globs, we made the same size. Though, with my bow, I usually end up a little bit bigger. <laughs> a little bit taller. Taller, yeah, yeah. Well, I, we definitely um, have to adjust for that because obviously her her image dimensions are different than mine because yeah. of the bow. So you know it's tough out there, but we make do. <laughs> <laughs> I've never played Thousand Year Door or any Paper Mario series, so I'm glad you loved it, Kate, and I hope we love it too when we play it. I'm I hope so. I would it would be really something if we played Paper Mario and you're like this game sucks. sucks. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I bet Thousand Year Door is gonna be even worse. <laughs> to be fair, out of all the games we've played so far on this journey, there are very few games that I said sucked. Hello Neighbor being one of them. Correct. I'm playing now? Yes. Okay, where do I go? Oh, baby! <laughs> that we named Buddy. <laughs> Buddy looks a little strange. I want to take him to a doctor, but we have no rupees. Could you please lend us some? Of course! Well, we don't have much. We but... gotta protect the baby! Really? How much can you lend us? Girl, I'm gonna give you 150. Thank you, Noza. You are a true Sam Samaritan. Samaritan. <laughs> I am so glad that you came across our channel too, Kate. Definitely. Um, from Tears of the Kingdom. So it's going to be almost like a year since like we've known each other. That's crazy. I feel like I've known you forever. <laughs> hey, who's this? This is the dad. Who that? Who that? Hey, hey Noza. Noza. My boy is ill, but still, I have something to teach you. <laughs> Finding spots to plant Gasha seeds is hard. Dig holes, move rocks. So what am I supposed to do? I don't know. Is, is the baby feeling better now that you gave them money? Let's go see. So as you probably picked up on, as we progress with the game, stuff happens with these people. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the seasons are changing. Life happened. Life's moving by so quickly, y'all. Mm-hmm. What's the biggest change that's happened in your life this spring? Um... Oh, I, my whole life revolves around taxes. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be over soon, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Maybe a shovel? 
Are you gonna dig up his dirt? You don't have the shovel equipped. Does, uh... What? I d Just equip the shovel. Don't overthink it. You have the equip. Go. <laughs> Oh, isn't she precious? I love it when you play. What happened? You you can't dig up his dirt. That's his Why dirt. Why not? Because you have to respect the establishment. So what do I do here? Nothing? Uh, you did what you needed to do. You gave the money. All right, bye. Like you were just saying, we, the, the seasons pass as time moves on. I need um, I need to put this stuff back where I need it. Okay. Sure. Whatever, okay. whatever you'd like. Sword and shield? Go look little sword and board? That's good. Drusy went back to the first time you showed up on stream and knew she was so welcome and got really emotional. Aww. That's good. Thanks for like telling me that even now. <laughs> like that that's really sweet. I I always hope that I can make anybody that stops by here welcome. Um and like regardless of, you know, anything. Like I just I never want, that's why, like, I never want anyone to feel ignored. Like, I always want to try to foster that, like, inclusivity here and everything. Like, yeah. I, I really appreciate you telling us that, Total Toes. Um, here's Bob Ross. Does he have anything new? I guess seeing scenery from all the seasons is kind of nice. All right, Bob Ross. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so grateful I'm an accountant relative. I go to her office and she's like, okay, done in 15 minutes. That's amazing, Kate. We're jealous. Uh, yeah. I mean, we have a really great accountant now. The only thing is, like, there's just been so many changes and, like, with running, you know, our own creative, like, business, like, we finally merged our two freelancing businesses last year. Yep. Um, so Doza and I both were freelancing, but as independent freelancers, and we finally combined it to create kind of like a little creative agency, small business, which is really exciting. We were so excited. Like, it was literally May last year. So this is our first year kind of dealing with the fact that, you know, we have to do sales tax. We have to do franchise tax. We have to do... Um, Everything. all kinds of things that we didn't know about. This is our first year again, and it's just a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but we're, you know, we're grateful we found someone that can really help us, and hopefully it gets better. better. Yeah, but like something's not right, right on the mountain north of Sunken City. Okay, hmm. so that's where we're headed. You gotta head north. Yeah. Remember, now you have the power of, uh, what, summer? So you can climb vines. And okay. uh, it also dries up water as well. I have a hard time getting myself to play games after work, but then I start playing it and it's always so good. Jess, I wish I I wish I could have really have harnessed that kind of that power. Oh, oh, oh. oh. There is an apple. It's grown. That's a gasha nut. Yeah, an apple. Okay, yeah. You got Not a, nut. a gasha nut. Check what's inside. A ring was inside. I guess we should get this appraised, but then maybe we go inside and get another seed. Well, do you think this oh, guy's wait, just no. gonna keep giving no, you seeds? No, we have seeds. We should I already think, have one. You had one from earlier. I just picked one up from the from the Deku tree. Maku tree, the Maku tree. <laughs> Plant. It's just convenient. I... There's another seed actually north of you that I planted earlier. Oh, really? Yeah, like Where? near the first dungeon. So just keep going up and you'll see but, it. Or isn't the guy with the appraisal down though? Yeah, but like what if you get another ring? Then you can get the backtrack oh, okay. again. Is it up here? Yeah, just go one up and one more square. Oh, Lijidoza. Yes. You remember. So smart. A ring. ring! Okay, let's, let's go, go get these appraised. Let's learn about these rings. Hell yeah. Like Lord of the Rings. It was great meeting you too, Doza. You're one of the rare male streamers I watch. You're always making me laugh. I really appreciate that. I also try to make sure that I can <laughs> give a nice, warm welcome to people. And, and a bit of sass. A bit of sass too. <laughs> but hopefully inclusivity and joy and kindness is the overarching veil over everything <laughs> that we do. <laughs> um, I love Dova. He's great. Thank you. <laughs> I think you're great too. So yes, Twinkle Toes, thank you for sharing. This is that not as where well. the ring thing is. Where do I go? Where? Don't have your own business. Taxes are pretty simple. Either what, regardless, Kate, it's still a great asset to have. Nah. You know. Where is the ring? The ring. The guy that appraises rings. Yeah. I oh, mean, right maybe there. Maybe the okay. yeah. The, it has so a big ring I just on need it. To go down. Okay. It's just been a while. Okay. Yeah, you got this. So to the right. Wait. Oh no. What's she gonna do? Should there it is. Yeah, let's go. I found it. <laughs> <laughs> and Pika, hello. Yes, it does drop tonight. Are you a Are you gonna poet? wait till midnight to listen to it all? Uh, do not text me. I hear that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> new job? What you doing these days? Yeah, congrats on the new job. Nice. You got two rings. This is the most ever. Call this. I call this the whispering. Like no Will of the Wisps? Ori? Anybody? 
Oh, I love that game. That this is what is. this ring is. Okay, so that'll be helpful in some dungeons. I call this the Blue Holy Ring. No damage from Zora's fire. No, Zora's just put that domain? On. Just put that on. Is this <laughs> Zora's domain? Anybody? Oh, uh, that's a place in some video games. Okay, so now I need to talk to him. To do the... To do the thing to, to list. The list. And then yes. you're saying... Hit A. A. And then hit select. Select. And Which there it is. the healing one? This is the, the holy one. Okay. And, and then, then back, back out of this. Out. Yes. And then don't forget to put it, it on. Put what Rings on? do nothing unless worn. You have it in your box. You haven't put it on yet. Uh, hit sl uh, start. Right. And, and then, select. Oh my gosh. Everything start and select. You'll get it. And there you go. Get out. Yes. Uh, select. There. Start. There you go. Perfect. Okay. Way to go. All you right. made it through. I'm so glad. So glad for you, babe. Um, all right. I did it. I'm going down. Just had to deal with insurance stuff today, and it was one of the most annoying things you had to do in a long time. Of all time. Yeah. Yeah, insurance is no fun. We um we both used to work in healthcare at some well, I worked a lot longer in healthcare than Doza. So we've, we've dealt with <laughs> we've lots dealt of with so many insurance, insurance crazy things. It's yeah. Insane. Okay, so now they said go north. Yes. So I'm you, gonna go north. You need to go north. But where? And hey Kirby, how are you doing tonight? How's it going? Um, you're on the final boss of ages? Yo. What? How, how? What, what do you when think your you... playtime's at? Does the game does this game track playtime in the uh the file select or does it track deaths? I can't remember. Obviously, we're doing everything off of, you know, restore points or, or, or whatnot, and that's kind of it. <laughs> okay, we've been there. Oh, so we want to go here. Maybe. Um, why can't this just stay away? Why can't there the be a, a button specifically to just pick stuff up? I I know, but there's there's A and then there's B. It's dumb. And then you gotta pull back, like that's yeah. Okay. It's not dumb, it's just different. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Yeah, but it's funny, because you're playing this on a Switch Pro controller, so you have all these buttons, and it's just like... I can't just use anything, a just thing. A and B. Yeah, you know, they figured that out by uh, Ocarina of Time. Oh, wait, that was five years ago. <laughs> uh, <laughs> 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 Almost, one more pixel. Pixels, am I right? There's oh, over 60 deaths. Yeah. Nice. Uh, I can't go this way. Kirby, would you say ages is? Oh, is but more if difficult? I change, do you think there'll be vines? Um, did it? Did it? Was it? I, I can't remember. Did it have like oh um? Was it grooved? If um, the cliff is grooved, then vines will grow. Okay. Like if it's see. eroded a bit, like it has a bit of an erosion look. Okay, that only that can only be attacked when it's down. Doesn't seem like it, but if you had like a some kind of thing that could jump. Ricky. Wow. Where is our friend? Oh wait, I can just call him. Yeah. I don't have to run away. Ricky, where are you at? Call me, <laughs> meet me if you want to reach me. If you want to meet Ricky, here's the flute. The vault tracks were already wrote, just not recorded. All I should do was to sing the songs. Yeah, that that sounds right. I think people were complaining about potential leaks. There he is. <laughs> Let's go to a different screen and maybe it'll spawn somewhere that you can actually get to him. That is funny, Noosh. There we go. I applaud you for keeping your cool. I was about to be upset, but, <laughs> you know. Remember, you can start punching. Right. There you go, way to go. Look, look at that, one shot him. No problem. Ricky as long the for me, kangaroo. I get lost a lot. <laughs> the Kim Possible. I love Kim Possible. <laughs> <laughs> I think ages. Is I wanted a, a beeper game. so bad, and when I did clinical rotations, I, I finally got, got a beeper. <laughs> I had a palm pilot. But being on call and getting like a beeper that way is a little different than like you know Kim Possible's "Call Me, Beat Me." <laughs> <laughs> I felt so cool though. It's okay, you are I can cool. jump up there, right? Yeah, you can. Maybe you find a clear path. No, I have to do it over here. Yeah, it looks like you're gonna have to the be path very right careful. Here. There you go. Yeah, aggro, yeah. aggro. Let's go. I'm glad that other one spawned down Call here instead. Call me Kangaroo Tyson. Oh, yeah. Do or your little Muhammad wind up Ali. punch. Do your wind up punch. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> no, there you go. <laughs> Bob and weave, gentlemen. Bob and weave. Wow, yeah. that is cool. I, I love how... I, I don't know what it is about cutting grass. It's just so... Cut grass is a vibe. Yeah, sorry, I got scared. Especially in Texas, I feel like it smells right good. 
That grass does smell good. I don't like the gasoline smell that usually pairs along with it, though. <laughs> Maybe there's a hidden cane sometimes this game does that. Sometimes there is. We know of one, but I don't think we can progress it yet. Behind, like, a... Oh, no! <laughs> I'm sorry, Ricky. Ricky Raccoon, the kangaroo. Ricky Ricardo, anybody? <laughs> Wait, can I go up here or the water's gonna kill me? Nah, you'd have to make it like frozen. Right, right, right. Okay. Oh, no, 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 I forgot. <laughs> Why are they there? Why do you respawn? It's a very fertile soil area. Mm. Not as great as fertile soil, though, or dirt, or whatever. I'm supposed it's to go north, so should I. Just keep exploring. Yeah, but like. Just keep exploring. You want me to go down? You might be in the northern area. Like, check your map. Because um, if it's north of the Maku tree, then you're... Yep. Look at that. The Maku tree is like eight spaces down from where you are. Okay, so, so I can you're go down. directly north of him. That's true. Yeah. Okay. I think Let's you're fine. Keep going. Don't overthink it. Just have fun. Who's Ricky Balboa? It sounds familiar, but I can't remember who that is at the moment. Anybody? Ricky Balboa is the Sylvester Stallone character oh. from that movie series we haven't watched yet. So can I move these rocks? Uh, no. Oh, I can bomb them. I don't know if you can break them. You can try. Or you can just... <gasps> I can jump up! Yeah, Ricky! There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh Ricky's great, huh? <laughs> Ricky! <laughs> I keep forgetting. <laughs> Man, I really wish we had seen at least the first oh, Ricky movie. Oh, it's Rocky, Bella, like the Rocky movies? Yeah, but like, it's a boxing Ricky. kangaroo. What did I say? Did I say Ricky Stallone? I said Ricky Ricardo, and I don't think anyone knows Ricky who that Ricardo. is. Ricky <laughs> Ricardo? <laughs> yeah, this is direct reference to Ricky Ricardo. <laughs> <laughs> Lossy. I will. <laughs> <laughs> and other uh, things that he says. Yeah. Other things. Oh, nice. Oh, 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 okay. What do you Maybe think not. that is? It's a cave. It looks like one anyways. Mm. Ah! Oh. Oh, it's... <laughs> I got sure that was gonna kill me! What a great song. Don't you agree? Yes. Here's a human I understand. Let me fill your satchel for you. Oh, oh that's really nice. Love, love the seed. What a great song. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's just get all these. What's everyone's favorite love song? Is oh. it Love Story by Taylor Swift, Pika? Looking at you. <laughs> um, uh, or no. is it that L is for the way you look at me? <laughs> it's from, the rest I only of know it from um, Parent Trap. What is a man? What has he got? <laughs> okay. Just making sure. Okay, so let's Pika, get back to the When you mentioned Disney, what, are you talking about like Kim Possible? Dropped a clip from the music video for the track one. It's literally insane. We haven't seen anything of it yet. You belong with me. That's a good one. Oh, that's yeah. I like that one. I feel I like there's an see. Alicia Keys song that I really uh, like. What is this? Oh, it is oh, a cannon. Oh. Be careful. Oh, okay. We leave. Yeah, I don't think we can do any damage to that. The Penguins of Madagascar TV show. It's a male kangaroo with this bag. I've never seen Madagascar or Penguins Madagascar. Oh, none of them. I know the Move It, Move It song though. I don't think I've seen a single episode. I've only I've seen Madagascar one, two. Whoa, maybe is this three? a castle with like a flag on top? I think so. I think you're really high up in the air right now. I think that's kind like of what I it's implying. <laughs> they actually made it back before stream ended. Welcome back, Shane. You, you boy. This is the great Moblin's realm. If y'all wish to get by alive, pay me toll. Ha ha. Or... Or you can just leave. Well, I was gonna... You're gonna kick his ass? Well, don't I have a Moblin thing? <gasps> you do have a Moblin ring. Go ahead and equip it. I wonder if that uh, does anything. How do I do that? Uh, start. Start. The plus. Right, you know, right, right. The plus. Then the select. The minus. Okay. Oh my god, we don't have it equipped. We don't have... Oh. Not worth it. God dang, that's... Not worth it. So how much does he charge? <sighs> Fine. Wait, I can do it with him. Right? she basically haven't seen anything I grew up with. Well, name all the things I, that you grew no, up okay. with. Okay, Phineas and Ferb, I've seen, but Doza has not. Watch out! I love Phineas and Ferb. She's um, seen the whole thing. I haven't seen anything. I haven't anything. seen the whole thing. She's seen most of it. But, like, it. I really loved, like, what you doing? <laughs> We're trying to find the days of summer. I think that's how, what's happening. So I'll pay the toll, bro. How do I pay your toll? I don't no? know. Is it just gonna keep attacking you? You're back, bombs away. Okay. Maybe the toll's just to not get him to 
Hello. Ew, it smells like medicine. I can't stand it. See ya. Oh, okay, bye, Ricky. Looks like we found a new whole town. The whole city's flooded, but since I can't swim, I'm just here blowing bubbles. That sucks. If only... Oh, right, right, right. If only I could change... What are you trying to change? The seasons. Oh, it's yeah. It's Oracle of Seasons. We you changed could, like, the freeze seasons. It? That, that makes sense. What about Love Story? That it would be your favorite love song. That's what that's what Noosh was saying, Pika. Potentially. Thinking about the slow dance they played at every party I went to the child the other day. Elton John's Can You Feel the Love Tonight? 90s Baby, The Lion King. Kate, that is an iconic song. Uh, how do I... Right. Um, B. Okay. And then if I go back... Uh, right. So winter, mm -hmm. and then maybe I can use the kangaroo to get up here. I think the bulb is in the way. So... Then how do I do it? Well, what was the other one that... What was the other thing that you have? Summer? But then it's too hot? Like, the flower I think only grows in spring? Did you want to rewind? Yeah. Okay, rewind. <laughs> <That messed up>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, right. Do we have enough? Oh my gosh, we do. <laughs> the white screen. Okay, so let me... Oh, that was close. I don't yeah. know how much more you had. So should I just go back up? Uh, yeah, you could do that. He got the oh, theme song wrong? Is... Oh, Who got the theme song wrong? You did. Wait, I can't hit her, though. I've only heard the theme song. Of I can't hit her. Oh, oh, there you we gotta go. You gotta bump into her. Oh, but everything's like this over there. This is an unfortunate position. Okay, well, good luck. Yeah, yeah, you can use your sword. Yeah, yeah, definitely use that. Nah, and I mean, those, that's, that's hers, unless you had some kind of boomerang. No. <laughs> You're sorry, I have more stuff than before. See ya. She robbed yeah. us! Ugh. Don't forget, you have a, a feather that allows you to jump over at least one square. Okay, why are you saying that? Because... Because that's another way to get past water sometimes? Oh, right, right. right. Oh, to get past water? Yeah. Oh, like what this? What does the sign say? We haven't read that yet. Now entering my domain. Great Moblin. Oh, okay, yeah. That's scary. What does this do? Nothing? Oh, can oh, I walk no, on that? No. No. It's, it's a rough rock. Okay, there was a hint. Be, okay, Where do go, I go? go back to the water village. Which was over this way? Yes. Why did you not tell me? We were just there. I thought you wanted to keep exploring. Well, I wanted you to tell... Like, you gotta nudge me the right direction, This babe. is nudging you the right direction. No, I literally had to ask for you to oh, nudge. Oh, no. Well, I asked. Two, two minutes behind where I you know. Been. It's what will we do? We can't get those minutes back. I apologize in advance for Dose's actions today, guys. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh -huh, okay. Your favorite love song would be Gold Rush? It's not a love song, but it's uh, Let Me Dream. <laughs> Pika, that's fine. I, I don't think I've heard that one. Unless I have. Right, so just like, maybe we hop over the water. That's what you were saying. What do I need for that? You need the rock's feather. Which is the feather. You have to I put it on your... It. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There you go. Give yourself a little bit of a running start. That is uh, that is another guy. Yes, I'm trying to talk to him. Okay. My pop's a master driver. He had a secret diving spot, but he never told me where it was. Stingy guy. That's unfortunate. Is your pops inside? Is he gonna tell us? Maybe. My husband was a master diver, but now he's old and he's hidden his diving gear and gone off somewhere. Well, let's steal it. When you said, what's your favorite love song? I thought of Despair by Leo. I love that song because it's about a person who cannot handle affection whatsoever. Me. Aw, Jess. That's, that's, that's really touching. Wow. I'm glad you have a song that you can resonate with like that. It's always good to have a song like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... What's up, Kessler? What did I do wrong? I didn't tell her exactly when she made a wrong turn. <laughs> and it cost her two minutes. <laughs> and happy Friday Eve, Kessler. How are you? <laughs> Are we gonna have a party when we binge listen to Taylor? When are we gonna have a party when we binge listen to Taylor? Maybe tomorrow after work if you're down. Yeah. I do want to listen to it. I just won't be. I need to sleep tonight. <laughs> Vases wanted. Okay. Ingo is that? That's the guy from from Ocarina of Time. The Ingo? Evil, yeah, Ingo. He was the one who had the thing. Shoot that big Goron! No matter how often I ask. He won't give me his vase. I give my dinner for it. Fish. Oh, fish. 
I wonder you mean else. all of the whole album? I mean, if there's enough time. I don't know, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true, Flo. Speed and jump Spram, will bring don't brother. touch my bases, I swear. Okay, you know oh, what? Oh, well. Wow, he just goes he's, the whole... He just makes sure everything's good before he, he lets you, like, walk again. Yeah, I guess well, he doesn't want me to, to be here. I guess we don't have to control our bodies with a game controller. Imagine trying to talk to a stranger and actually stabbing him instead. Well, it was Nusha's choice to have sword on the other button. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay, well, let's go in here. That just does look like Luigi. This one doesn't. This one is like a Kirby head with something else going on. You mean every album, but like one a day? Peek, I do not have the time for that, sir. Unless like it's one day every month. <laughs> Legends say some sort of treasure sleeps on the summit. It's also, a boy's dream, I think. Did he ever say what his new so job much. is? I can't sleep. Oh, did you? I didn't. I didn't catch anything about no what new job. What is this? A fireplace? A lot of Taylor Swift, though. Uh, I don't know. Can you go in the fireplace? I don't know. Is this like Harry Potter? No, it doesn't work. <laughs> Diagonally. <laughs> One day every month is cool. I will see what we can do. Sometimes we do put Taylor Swift on while just randomly, like we have a Spotify playlist. Um, we're okay, we're also see. very into 2000s music. We listen to a lot of old school stuff because we yeah. wish we knew each other as like angsty teenagers. Which would have been nice. Uh, oh well, at least we we know each other now. Isn't this that is neat? Weird. This is an empty room. That's very strange. Is oh. that where the the, the grandpa dude used to live? Maybe, maybe not. Whoa? Oh, Gale Seeds. Their gust can take you where you want to go. Open your seed satchel to use them. There you go. You unlocked teleport. I unlock teleportation devices? Yes. yes. I wonder where so it goes. So seed satchel. We'll put that on B. And <laughs> we are going to use the Gale Seeds. I feel like I have We're a favorite love back. song, but I can't think of the name. That's How do okay, I do Shane. it? <gasps> you did it. Where is it taking? Oh, Look I can go to any of those? Yeah. Where do I want to go? There are all the different trees. I mean, it, you, oh. you just unlocked it, so it's your choice if you want to leave the place that you're making progress in. No. Okay. What do I do? Then you would just go back to where it was. Go back. Got it. There you go. Good job. Neat. Okay. So let's keep exploring this area, shall we? I'm so sorry you found a moth. That's unfortunate. I didn't. Sorry, I was so infatuated. Do mothballs work? <gasps> I found okay, something Pika. weird. It's Whoa. a monster. It, it came to attack the city. It did. We must protect the city. Ha! Take that. No. <laughs> you just immediately try to kill it. No, I'm trying to talk to them. Try to talk to the kid. We shall protect the city. What about the other kid? We're protecting the city, but without weapons, we're helpless. Do you have bombs? Us. Yes. There's nothing to fear now. Let's go out on patrol. I'm so glad they didn't bomb this Dodongo. You saved me. I am Dimitri. It talks. You can't swim. I can even swim up waterfalls. You helped me. Now I help you. Get on my back. We ride in. It's like oh. Gyarados up in here. <laughs> I chomp when you Literally press A. Gyarados. Or a la la lapper? La la Let's go with red Gyarados. It's cooler. Red Gyarados. Yeah. I'm shiny. I swim like a fish, even up waterfalls. You can also carry me using the power bracelet. That's cute. Wow. Look at that. Another Look, I'm in unlocked. the water now. Woo. Wait. Have we gone there yet? Maybe. So Peek is a dietary aide at a senior living home, getting them food and keeping stuff clean. So his job, so basically his job that he had a Cracker Barrel. Hmm, okay. Very awesome. nice. That's awesome. Yeah, and you're helping a lot of people. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. We're going up <laughs> Dimitri waterfalls. Dimitri used a waterfall. Hell yeah, this is awesome. Everything's awesome when you're part of a team. Okay, we were... Oh, right, right, right. That, what that is was... Blackpink, Twinkle Toes? Would that, is that another... Is that like a band? I can't go in there, like though. you can go inside. I mean, you're literally riding around on a dinosaur. So maybe it's <gasps> fine Sharks. that we're outside. No! Whoa, watch Fish out. are my sworn enemies. Yes, they are. And uh, I... Speaking of uh, enemies... Jess just found a moth right now. I Her saw. I said I'm sorry that happened. That sucks. Um, should Better I get than off? Better wasp, right? Yeah, you can get off on the right. I wonder what we're gonna find in here. Well, so is one tree maybe a new one you didn't unlock? I think it was only the trees that she's found, but maybe if we need to use the warp thing, we'll take another look. 
Mothballs are poison. I would avoid using them in a closed space at least if you must use them. I don't think I've even seen mothballs in person. How do I get over there? Seems like you have to drop down from somewhere higher up, and this was kind of like a little hint to keep your eyes open. I think you knew exactly, but okay. Let's go up this waterfall. It was a 50-50, Noosh. It was a 50-50. That's somebody that looked like they have fishing gear on. I am the master diver! It's the husband and the <laughs> father that won't share the details. To become my pupil, go to the next cave and open all four eyes in a single stroke and bring back proof that you have done so. Okay, that's weird, but sure. We can try. The number one, the two, the one album. Oh, nice. Good job, Mish. One Taylor album a uh, month, you gotta help prep for his so debut in Rep TV. So, he wants me to go back okay, to this cave yes. and do the thing. Right? You have to light things? Is that what's happening? Um, or you have to hit things? All at one time or something like that? Yeah, so I'm assuming you can move them. Yep, that's exactly what can happen. So, you, I guess you need to move them in such a way that you can kind of do all that. Yeah. Yes, I did reference the Lego movie. Noosh hasn't seen it yet. She saw Batman, though. She enjoyed that, so I could probably get her to watch Lego Movie at some point. I don't know when, though. Okay, Nusha's cooking. Let her cook. Let her cook. Nusha, why don't you go ahead and uh, take us through your thought process here? Oh, wrong thing. Oops. So I'm supposed to light them all, right? Um, I, I'm not sure if you have to light them all or hit them all. Just try whatever you, you, you can. Oh, uh, right. Oh, see, I was gonna do, like, something, like... Hold on. Why? I can't throw this? Oh, the boomerang. Well, you could try the boomerang. He did say it had to be basically all at the same time. Let's see. Mm, that didn't seem to work. So I messed up. Let's go out and, and, and reset these positions, and maybe we can get a different orientation where you can reach uh, all of them. Yeah, it just has to be in a circle, right? Yeah. Yeah, see, I, I misunderstood. That's okay. You got it, you get it this time. Not everyone gets it their first try. Yeah, but I'm not everyone, you know? Well, yeah, you know, that's fine. I, you're unique, and I love you. I love even you if too. Even if it takes you two tries on this. Even three, I'd still love you. Can you really? believe it? That's crazy. I know. Blackpink is the biggest K-pop group right now. Number 436 artists in all of Spotify. Damn, okay. That's pretty awesome. Many games there's a spawn you didn't unlock. Gay credits for ages. The fight was hard. Congratulations, Kirby. Way to go. Also, way to go, Noosh. You did it. I did do it. <laughs> Wait, what? Why did I? You just gonna leave the chest there? Well, how do I get across? The water? If only there was a way to get over the water. Oh, the jump! That's what I was trying to do, but I don't have it equipped, because that's dumb that you have to equip something to jump. If only it was on a button, right? If only, If Doza. only. You know, we didn't get a, a specific button for jumping until Elden Ring. That's just insane. Right. <laughs> just to see that you could. I like the Lego movie. I'm sure Noosh will too. I agree, Kate. I think Noosh will will enjoy the Lego movie. Uh, didn't we see a Lego movie or was that some Lego we Batman? We saw Lego Batman. Ah, uh, that was a good movie. Yeah, it was good. Lethal Company got a new update. What'd they change, Shane? What'd they change? I passed his test. Yes, he'll accept us. Take, Take these the flippers. flippers. Zora's flippers for Zoro's domain. Congratulations. Okay. Secret, secret, secret roots, roots of Mount Cuckoo. There's a hole among us. Reefs and towns use the flippers <laughs> I gave you. Okay, all right. We're cooking. But, you know, why when you can just, like, fly Ninjago! Oh, is that the study or, like, the what is it? The spinner of ninjutsu or something like that? <gasps> hey. There's a stump. There's a stump. That's you the first time you it? can enter. I mean, it's up to you. They, they, they're, they're given to you on a platter. What should I change it to? Uh, let's try summer first, and then if that doesn't work, then let's try winter. Let's see what summer looks like. Okay, we'll go to winter. And then this guy still? Yeah, you can still ride around with this guy. I'm guessing some of this stuff is still way too deep to freeze where, over, but at least a little girl I... can get over, right? Oh, that's true. I hope so, anyways. Elden Ring did not invent jumping. 
I mean that we had to wait until Elden Ring before the Souls games had. She a still jump can't button. go over. Why not? Is she scared? She's probably. It was scared. winter before, wasn't it? Uh, no, it was summer. The default uh, season here is summer. It looks like. Oh, but look. Ah, that is something that you couldn't do before. No. All right, Doza, it's your turn. This looks angy. <laughs> it does look pretty <laughs> angy. Okay. I hear there's a creature that can swim of waterfalls. I remember... What kind of creature is it? Um, us with flippers. That's the creature. <laughs> remember, yeah. Jess, we used to send us a lot of, like, Ninjago stuff, or Ninjago stuff, and, like, we hadn't seen it yet, but, like, I don't know, you pick up things from all the, like, little highlights and stuff. Yeah. Well, yeah. That's fun. It was yeah. nice. Yeah. If Mabel were here, I'd send her to Mount Kuku for mushrooms, but since she hasn't come... Back, I can't make my magic potion. Well, that's right. sad. Oh no, where did Dimitri go? Did we have a thing to get Dimitri back? I miss Dimitri. I really, like, haven't had much time to just scroll. I usually, like, <laughs> we go through your stuff that you sent us, Jess, and, like, other, like, DMs and things, and that's kind of our for you right now. Doza has been on YouTube Shorts a lot, sending uh, me stuff. You need the whoa. dragon. I don't know where he is. He's oh, you gone. have the flipper. Okay. Yeah, I at least have that. He can't go, Did you go through falls. this? I don't think so. Oh. I don't know. Actually, yeah, that's where I was. That's where I changed the season. Yeah, but did we go into this cave before? They didn't have jumping in souls games? Not really. You have mm. to do like a running and oh. you have to do like a run jump, but it's the same button, so it was awkward. Flo said that there is a house that we can enter now that we couldn't before. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Let me check to make sure there's nothing behind this this uh, waterfall. Gravity Falls. I never finished it, but I, but we we did watch. We got to the time traveling episode, I and think. then we couldn't. We didn't continue for so whatever reason. Is that the house? No, because that one was already on land. But I'm gonna double check this one over here. Oh, maybe it was this one. No, or is this the empty one? Yeah. This oh, is the empty okay. One. We don't know what this Do is. Can you like push these together? Yeah, I have no idea what this is. But I don't know how to get Dimitri back. He's just gone. I'm kind of sad. I didn't yeah. know we get to ride around. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> I can dive. That's cool. You, you can't go up the waterfall? No, unfortunately not. Can you change it to summer and walk up the vines up there to the right? Oh, that's so smart. You're so smart, Noosh. Way to go. You're welcome. Now we can go up this. And because we have the flippers... Yeah. And a seed. Oh, Agasha. That's good. I'm glad we have that. You know, now that we can, like, teleport around, why don't we go appraise that? Or not a, just appraise. I mean, why don't we go swap, swap out our ring? Wouldn't that be good? And then we if can, that's what you feel. I want to make sure that we, we got everything. So the Moblin ring, right? That's what we needed to get? Yeah, you know, to go by those Moblin guys. Or you can just go up higher with the vines right now. I could. And you there's can also warp back, I guess. There's also something that sells maps. Because this is Horon Village, and I, and I remember seeing that sign. You're saying that there's a cartographer around? Something. We don't have a card yet. How do I get a member's card? I don't know. It's Maybe not as easy as signing up for money. Costco. No, not really. We went the wrong way, apparently. I did use my gamer brain. Sometimes it comes in handy. <laughs> <laughs> and we we hopefully should and can revisit Gravity Falls. We're currently watching My Hero Academia like in English, um, slowly getting through that. We finally surpassed where we were the last time we watched it in Japanese. So it's getting good. Um, I don't want to give any spoilers for anyone who hasn't seen it or wants to watch it, but like there's a lot of like family drama going on right now with a specific like hero family and it's just quite intense. I like it. Yeah, you're really all about the drama. I watch a lot of drama shows. That's what I do. <laughs> okay, let's switch out the, the the ring. It'd be cool if we could, like, equip more than one ring. That'd be awesome. I never watched Kirby right back at you, but Doza did. Oh, yeah, I've watched uh, quite a few episodes. Rylan, I love your Lion April. It is my favorite anime. It is so dark, so beautiful, so, like, it hits hard. That's something that we need to watch. Um, Again, after I watched it the first time with Doza, every April for a while, I kept watching it. Um, it's April right now, and I, I actually had earlier said like um, this month, I was like, we should watch it again. 
Um, it's so good. Um, it's beautiful. I actually, like, um, because the violin is such, like, a big, like, or, well, music is a big theme. I actually found, like, the music online so I could try to learn how to play it on my violin. But I didn't have my violin at that time. It was at my parents' house. <laughs> but, um, I think it would be cool to, like, I wish I would when I was still playing violin actively, I wish I had watch your line april so i could have played it because i used to do that a lot i would if i watched movies or if i watched shows and i really love like the score or, like the music in it i would find it and i would learn how to play it uh, one of the first like movies i ever did it for was like my heart will go on from titanic <laughs> <laughs> uh i think i have that one memorized now if i wanted to play i feel like it would come back to me i think it would yeah what? Oh, How man. does he know? I love that you recently found it. Like, have you finished it? Like, it's so good. So sad. I assume you have. It's, it's just so tragic. I, I'm, I'm a mama. <laughs> I tried the moblin mm. ring. It didn't work. And you know, elephants are actually very strong flow. I'm sorry that the ring didn't work, but it was a good theory. It was. It makes a lot of sense. But you know, hey, what can you do? Where else did we need to go here? If there was a new Shindoza show, what would it be? really is just a story about our life and our adventures together, Shane. I feel like that would be the best show. <laughs> a slice um, of life. And then there would be a movie about like our love, like our love story. Cause I, honestly, our story is pretty epic. And the fact that like a lot of people are against us being together, which I think is so stupid and dumb. Um, like they don't have a say in our life anyway, but it did affect us. And I think that story is very interesting and like, I can't wait until one day when we are finally kind of like married happily ever after, if you will, maybe putting it all together to like share all the nitty gritty details now that we're past it. Um, just cause it's, it's, you know, for us, our relationship, we are an intercultural couple. We come from very strong, diverse cultures that have lots of similarities, but also a lot of differences. Um, yes. Not to mention coupled with like very strong religious backgrounds on both ends. And then for us to kind of like make it work and really like we appreciate each other, we love each other, all that. But it's been a difficult journey with our families, which is probably one of the reasons why we're not married yet. Um, I mean, that's basically what it is. That's basically yeah. what it is. And we're still kind of hoping like they'll come around, you know? Um, we, we do dream of like a lot of things. So we'll see what happens. And at the end of the day, like we just... We're happy, like, together, regardless of the marriage certificate or not, and we're building our life and our businesses and what we want to do each and every day to make us happy, right? So... Yeah, I mean, that's the most important thing. Yeah, and we're so grateful that, Kessler, you and others here, like, the support and love that we get, um, you are, you, you know, like, they say, like, your chosen family, your chosen community kind of thing, like... I'm just so grateful that we built this community, all of us here together, each and every one of you included, like you're here and you support us, you love us, we love y'all. Like, it's it's so nice. Um, we always feel this is our like safe space. We can talk about anything, we can talk, play games, we can have fun, we can uh, talk about more serious things too. It's, it's just, we get to I, exist. I feel so comfortable and authentically myself here, like more so than really anywhere else. Uh, in life these days. It's extremely true. Um, there is a stark difference in just how New feels like she can carry herself. And it's, I've it's got very no environment filter. dependent. <laughs> yeah, you've got a strong <laughs> filter. When I'm around other people, because I, I worry too much, not necessarily what other people will think, but like it's hard for others to really understand sometimes, like the cultural differences, the like my upbringing and stuff like that. But here, I don't know what it is. When I talk about things, y'all, don't react in a way that's like where, where you have to so like you don't react in a the, way of judgment here's a big difference like Noosh, when y'all when she talks to y'all she doesn't have to give like you know 20 reasons why the way i feel about something is justified whereas in my real like i guess in my life in person with like the friends and families of like i'm constantly defending myself and it's exhausting yeah. My every decision so from like... So it's better to be quiet, it feels like sometimes. It is. And so I do I do become pretty reclusive um, outside of all of this. But I love to talk. I love to like... I, I love positive energy. I love being able to speak to people and all of that. And like, it's just nice to be here and like, thank you for listening. Thank you for being here. <laughs> it means so much. Uh, 
That's why I love hearing all of y'all stories and things, whether it's, you know, what happened to you today or childhood stories. Like earlier, I still can't like Rylan, the glow stick thing's been in my mind this whole time. Uh, <laughs> like I've just been thinking about that. Like, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, it makes sense, right? Yeah. <laughs> It's not something that you hear every day. It's not. What a I, unique experience. I hope to share someday I will feel like, I guess, like strong enough in my own ability to be able to just share my story completely, hundred percent, what it is. Because um, I think putting together cohesively, I think it could help others. Whether it is someone who, you know, an Indian American girl trying to find love, trying to find hope, trying to find whatever freedom right freedom was huge for me i felt so restricted and like even me leaving my parents home to like move out before marriage things like that that was difficult um and then to move in with doza <laughs> like that was huge like i made a lot of decisions that my culture my family like they do. exactly and not like they wouldn't approve of or be okay with and stuff um but yeah enough of that how's all the going <laughs> <laughs> it's going good we finally made it to the northern peak Nice. Yes. Let's continue onwards, fellow hero. Um, just actually started watching Bridgerton season two. That's a epic timing because season three is gonna start, I think, next month, right? It's gonna be released. Yeah. There's also the the spinoff of the Queen. Queen Charlotte. Yeah. I don't know if you've seen that one yet. That Watched like two good. episodes like a year ago, but I'm starting over because I didn't get into it last time, and it's so. It's so what, Jess? You left me on a cliffhanger. Oh my gosh! I can't believe it. It's so what? I hey. hope it's so good. I hope you're loving it. What do you? What race do you think this is? Just going off of where we are and what the music sounds like. Goron, Goron Mountain. Nailed it. Na Noosh nailed it. It's just so crying emoji, right? You know, um, so you're watching the one with like Kate, right? And like all the season two is like all the um, kind of like the Indian esque stuff away in a way. <laughs> yeah, um, I relate a lot to her in a way. Um, uh, that makes sense. There's also so many references to some classic Bollywood movies in this season. Um, I don't want to spoil anything, though. Um, oh, my goodness. But, yeah. <laughs> so many things. Feel free to talk about it more in Discord with spoiler the tags. And their relationship is hilarious. I, I could talk about Bridget's head. I, I, I can was, feel Noosh just holding on I, I don't so want to spoil much. it for you. Yeah. Um, I hope... Yeah, we should talk about it after. I'm actually thinking of rewatching Bridgerton in, in anticipation, like in the background, like in anticipation Just for Just like new how season. Noosh really pushed for us to play chapter one over again when chapter two of Delta Rune came out. She's also I, big I like on rewatching <laughs> things in preparation well, for other these things. These seasons come out like one or two years apart, and like it's good to reacquaint yourself with everything. I think I should read the books. I hear they're just as good, if not better, but I never, I don't really have time to read for fiction or fun right now. It's all educational. Yeah. But it is what it is. Rylan's is big news, and finally the same height as my girlfriend, no more being looked down on. <laughs> way to go, Rylan. Hopefully only literally and not any other way. Congratulations. Right. <laughs> Congratulations, King. Yes. <laughs> uh, that reminds me of another YouTuber who was originally from Egypt but lives in Canada. She literally hid her entire relationship and hid living with her boyfriend. Then her boyfriend asked permission to marry her, pretending they didn't date at all. Goodness. Um, <laughs> I've definitely heard stories like that. I have plenty of friends right now who are hiding their relationships from their parents. Uh, it's common. I actually, like, went through a pretty bad breakup with someone who cheated on me. Um, but also, like, I kept, like... How do I say this? I kept, like, making... Like, oh, it's okay if you're, like, being a horrible person to me or whatever. Like, I'd make excuses. I don't know. I was really bad about it and stuff. But Well, you were young. And I was young. And he was my longest relationship before Doza. And he was also someone that was close to my family. Like, my parents, my brother, like, like in the community. He was also Indian. Um, and he... Or Indian-American, rather. And he... Um, I don't know. We just had a long history. But... He ended up cheating on me, and then, like, we went through a bad breakup, and a long time after that breakup, I did not care about dating, I did not care about guys, I did not care about friends, nothing. I was, like, Yo, completely focused on <laughs> my life, like, my career, my education, went gung-ho, like, straight into work mode, like a workaholic, right? 
and that's like that's what I was and then I didn't expect to start dating anyone or find anyone and that's why like when Doza came into my life I wasn't looking for anything and I he just started he kept talking to me <laughs> Doza can talk and talk and talk. He kept Hello. talking to me, and I enjoy conversation, as you guys can tell. So I talked back, and we were just, we hit it off really well. We had so many common interests. We were also just unique about the, like, our conversation ranged so much in the early days as just friends to... What kind of enemy do you think this is? It is a Lionel, sir. <laughs> 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 um, but yeah, he, um, we just kept talking and talking. And I liked him, but I was so still burnt out from the past relationship. And like, yeah, Castle of Love comes when you don't look for it. I was so burnt out from that relationship and stuff. And it had actually been a couple years. So when Doza came into my life, I was about to leave. I had one foot out the door, like about to go travel and do some stuff. And he asked me to be his girlfriend the day before I left. Yep. I said yes. And then I immediately was about to meet up with my parents overseas. And I told them right away, I told them, hey, I met a guy and he asked me to be his girlfriend. But like literally yesterday, even though we've been friends for a couple of few months at that point. Yep. Um, and I said yes. And I said, this is horrible timing. Who knows what's going to happen? Because I'm going to be overseas now for a few months. Like, you know, and I told my parents and they were actually happy for me at first. They thought <laughs> they thought Doza was going to be like. Um, rebound my rebound guy. guy, like a guy to get me back into wanting to be in a relationship with someone. Nothing serious. Nothing serious. But finally, they're like, finally, knew she's happy or she's smiling again. She has a guy in her life. Like she's gonna get even better. And then, lo and behold, here we are, like you know, seven years later. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Almost eight. Oh yeah. yeah. I guess we're our, creeping up on that. In a couple months, we'll be eight years together. Can you, can you match it? So, yeah. <laughs> no shields, no deflecting seeds allowed. And yeah, being in love does make you a bit stupid. And that's how I felt early in my relationship. But I learned a lot from that relationship and other, like, dating and other things. So it... I, I feel like when I finally did meet Doza and, like, we got into this relationship, it was at the right time for both of us. Clearly, since it's worked out so far. Thank goodness. <laughs> and yeah, Doza was in the rebound. So, like, then of... I think it was a year later from that, I was finally, like, we had at that point told each other that we loved each other and everything, too. And I finally told my, like, after our one-year anniversary is when I told my parents, like, yo, so, like, Doze has been in my life, and I love him, and things are, you know, getting serious. I know it's only been a year, but things are moving along quickly. And I still lived at home at this point. <laughs> like, in my parents' house. So... It was interesting. They they weren't very happy. <laughs> but it's not because of Doza. It was just because he's not Indian. Yep. He's not Hindu. He, they, they were concerned about the religious differences, about the cultural differences. But lo and behold, this man Doza loves Indian culture, appreciates our food, appreciates things, and he respects the religious aspects that I want in my life. It's not a lot. It's mostly like I love celebrating the festivals and things like that. He embraces the clothes. He like, I don't know. There's just so many things that they didn't see that. And I, I, it's still hard for them to see that even today, even eight years later. Respecting all of that. It's been very easy. I don't know for why Doza, people make yeah. it such a big deal. And Doza's not very religious from his side of the family, like his stuff. So even if I he, was... I, yeah. just, I just don't see why it has to be difficult. Though. Yeah, exactly. So it's just, it's been a difficult journey for us as far as like getting our families to understand. Like, and I, I know I'm talking a lot about my family, but there's also people on Doza's side of the family who we don't even talk to anymore because they were so against us. Yeah, it's real. It, it's, it's, it's like the ick, but on like such a, such a massive scale and intensity. It's, it's really hard to, to deal with because it's, it's like you just don't see life going the way that it does sometimes in in a, in the more negative ways you, yeah you would you hear about and, stuff but you don't think that it's gonna happen to you and then when it does it's like it's very whiplashy in my opinion yeah 
it's it's been a lot um as far as like conversion converting goes no that's never a thing so in hinduism there actually isn't a thing to convert into hinduism that's not something that hinduism like preaches at least like as far as i know like there's no process there's none of that it's literally just you know acceptance you know yeah. um and again like there's nothing in that nature with doza's family um and because doza was raised catholic there's a there's a massive emphasis on, on spreading converting. the word of god which and is converting. basically converting <laughs> Yeah, which that is a whole other Like, I'm totes cool thing. if people want to, like, come into a faith, uh, but I'm not really on board with, like, um, forcing them, forcing people or, like, pushing it on others. I'm, I'm really against pushing religion on other people. Same. Even if it's, like, implied to be a literal rule of the, of, of the way things go. And I, just, and I just don't agree with it. And neither of us have pushed anything on each other. Like, it's really, like... Those are, let's celebrate Holy, let's celebrate Diwali, let's have some fun. <laughs> I'm like, let's celebrate Easter, let's celebrate like Christmas. Christmas, let's have some fun, you know? It's, yeah, Doza's never, like, his, like he's never, like, like, you don't have to yeah, convert or anything. I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make her go to, like, CCD and, like, l like, get her to do all the sacraments and all that stuff. No. Like, I'm, I'm just not and gonna do that. And those are some conversations we had early on. Yes. Um, and there are some people that think... In our families, unfortunately, like that, like our marriage would not be valid because of whatever, which is really stupid. Yeah, I really don't like the holier than art thou that some People, individuals kind of take yeah. religion with. So yeah, it's been a struggle, but hey, one day, all of this being said during uh, the Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons, <laughs> maybe someday we will finally get married and it'll be, you know, the right beautiful ceremony for us to be able to just take that next step. Yep, that's what I'm. That's what I'm looking forward to. Yeah, that's why we haven't like been in Russia. And that's another thing with friends too. Like they don't understand why we haven't like tied the knot, quote unquote, like whatever. Um, and it's hard to explain. <gasps> what a big Goron! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Achoo! <laughs> <laughs> nice voice. Go with it. <laughs> it's all stuffed up. It's so cold. Do you have anything that could warm a body up? Mm, oh, I, he's I, cold. We, we will have to come back because I, I definitely want to help this guy out. But right now we're unable to. He's sadly. so big. Yeah, he's <laughs> huge. That's Big Goron. Everyone's been talking about him. So all of these Gorons are really sad that there's just been like this awful perpetual winter that's been happening. And we need to figure out like how to also get access to another season. <laughs> Which we will do. He should be in the Tears of Kingdom DLC, right? <laughs> He's so cute. Let's, I'm glad you like the voice, Tickle Toes. Let's also stick and, Big Oron in, uh, what's that game that we like to play together? Uh, Age of Calamity? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> here. Um, I definitely did relate to Mrs. Kim, as well as, like, Lane. Like, her whole journey, hiding her boyfriends and things like that. Because I did hide, like, dating earlier in my life before, like, Dozen stuff. But once... You know, I got into the serious relationship. I was like, I'm not gonna hide this. That's ridiculous. Like, and it's funny because, like, I don't know. It's just something you have to go through being like an immigrant daughter, being you know, first generation Indian American or others. Oh, yeah. Like, there's so much that you can resonate with, like with even the Asian cultures and stuff too. Other cultures. I I wish there was like a Lane spinoff, honestly. <laughs> Lane would have been a much more compelling and interesting I still story want... than all mm. of Yale Rory. I still. <laughs> I still wanted more about Lane's like family as far as like the dad because like she, he does show up and then it's like where were you <laughs> you know I know um, right uh. and you know Doza and I were totally down for the whole like two weddings thing to make both of our like families happy but then like it got a little complicated too back when like some of the conversations were happening to be like oh like but you can't have this unless you do this like who says that like who like no. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, it's ex it's exhausting. And this was around the time that we were both kind oh, of like geez. struggling professional, not struggling, but like professionally wanting more out of like our jobs and like figuring out our careers and things. And it's like, you know what? Let's just focus on things that are a hundred percent in our control. Which, you know, like that's why you know we started the new Shindoza journey. We started the freelancing. We started all of the creative stuff, and it, we're better for it. We're happier for it. As hard as it can be. We don't have a guaranteed paycheck every week or anything, but it's been rewarding in its own way. Certainly so. 
Um, and it's helped us grow even stronger together uh, to navigate all of it, for sure. But we'll see. Maybe a couple years from now, you guys will hopefully still be around and like be like, you know, oh my gosh, you guys are married. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> uh, won't that be great? Yeah. Uh, Kester said I'm Catholic, so I know how some people can be, but I believe in y'all. You guys make each other happy, and that's what matters. Right? Thank you. Thank you, Kessler. I think the wedding should be up to how y'all want it to be. Two weddings sounds like a headache. I mean, one of the things for the two weddings is logistics of, like, getting family members to different parts of the world <laughs> to make sure everyone feels included. But then, like, that's the thing. We're trying so hard to make sure everyone else is included when there are people on both sides who don't make us feel welcome. Like, there was something wrong there, but I think we were just young and in love and just confused, I guess. Just a lot of, uh, a lot of hoping people see the light. And come but, around, yeah. Yeah, when, when you stick your head in the sand and you, you, you don't want to take in anything new, it's, it's a lot harder to learn and grow that way. I don't think that's uh, a good way to live. No. Um, I did dating because my parents wouldn't have approved. Um, I did go on dates that were approved by them. My my parents would definitely set me up with people to go out. Um, I hated it. Most of the guys also hated it. Not like because of each other or anything. Like we would actually be like, don't you just hate when like your parents set you up on these dates and you have to do it? And like, we kind of just talk about the fact that we can resonate, but like no one wants to be forced to date someone, right? Like, I mean, arranged marriages can work out and arranged things can happen. Like it's, common it you know it, it it works for some people but it doesn't work for everybody and i really wanted to choose my own yeah but i'm definitely like it was mostly just choosing people who like i knew my parents would approve of so why even tell them <laughs> <laughs> it's just easier that way sometimes you know yeah oh my gosh i'm getting my ass kicked out here let's just rewind a little bit when i had more health yeah, I know. it's funny, Kessler, you say that, like, I think the wedding should be for people who want to be included, but I know how it feels to want to include everyone. Uh, early in our relationship, we did kind of create, like, a wedding plan, if you will, of like, oh my gosh, like, who would come and things like that? Because we were, I mean, I think I've shared this before, Doza actually, like, had bought a ring and was ready to propose and do all of the stuff pretty early on. Very early on. Um, But it wasn't the right time, but it was fun to still talk about it, like, between each other and, like, that list has gone down is basically what I'm getting at. <laughs> the amount of people in our lives, the things that we wanted to do and everything. And he returned that ring and we used it to invest into our business instead. It seemed like the smarter choice and I don't regret it at all. I don't either. Um, but yeah. <laughs> the way I see it, as long as two people respect each other, it's fine. It only matters with kids. So a couple just has to figure out what to do with the kids. Yeah. And like you said earlier, I don't know if I commented on it, but like, when when and if like kids are in our future um it really will be up to them to decide what's best for them we will definitely like share you know and expose them to so many different cultures and different things i think that's part of the beauty i grew up in such a diverse way like even being indian and being hindu uh, raised that way i was surrounded by um like whether it's catholicism or christianity or islam or um, the Jewish community, like, I had friends from all over, just luckily, like, growing up in New York and then also here in Texas, which is pretty diverse, too, in San Antonio. Like, I don't know. It's always been, like, this melting pot, and it's been nice to explore. Like, I've been to friends' families for celebrations and things, and it's, you know, it's cool to just kind of, like, let kids explore all of that in a way where it's not, like, one size fits all. Like, you can love and respect and like make a more just world even just through the actions of raising your kids yeah i think that's a much newer concept but we've definitely seen uh at least there's been a growing population of parents who are intercultural who do make an emphasis to like have their kids learn more than what they grew up with yeah i think that's a really good way to keep um you know the future generations like open to other people because if not you if you, you see what's up, happening <laughs> if you grow up closed off then it's gonna be a lot harder to not perpetuate that like closed off kind of way of looking at the world and it can be very limiting and damaging and can, can you lift that. those rocks that were there earlier uh chris is asking uh i don't think so let me see these rocks 
or these rocks. These rocks. I, I don't think I can interact with these. I I'll try, though. I, I didn't expect to get so relationship-heavy today. <laughs> <laughs> but, um... Thanks for, thanks for the conversation, guys. Uh, we appreciate y'all. <laughs> mm -hmm. We haven't figured out how to deal with those rocks just yet. I'm hoping something comes around. I don't think that we can. I think they're Ever? just... Ever? Yeah. Is Streamlabs not working, y'all? Why wouldn't Streamlabs be working? Because I saw um, Rylan put points and nothing came on. Let's see. It might um, be just the commands that might not be working. Let me refresh it to see if that works. Yeah. Let's see if it works now. Um. Man, I can't really go anywhere around here. I really hope we didn't bust stream love. Oh, there we go. It should be working now, Rylan, and anyone else. I'm sorry if it wasn't working all stream. I didn't realize, but I had to refresh it. It's literally like a little toggle button. Very random. Yeah. It hasn't happened in a while. And now everyone's checking the points. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> it's a good thing to know where it you is. stand. Okay, we're gonna leave this place. This was actually this uh, the Temple of Seasons. Oh my god, I'm getting my ass kicked! Oh, Chess is back on Devil May Cry. <laughs> I hear that's a good game. Yeah. <laughs> Damn you, <all> right. <sighs> uh. oh, they've been around. <laughs> Eight ball banana ask our mod, so Jess, you get to ask yourself. <laughs> wow. Got what him. about banana? <laughs> oh, man. Well, good luck to me. Let me go ahead and get ready. <laughs> and Castle, you are in the top 10. That's awesome. Way to go. I, sorry. Bless you, I was busy sneezing. <laughs> uh,. Brother's girlfriend was raised in a different religion than us, too. My dad asked about it. My brother said it's not a problem. And ended the conversation there. Sons have it easy sometimes. Sons do have it easy. My brother, like, never had any issues with his dating. Like, he he got to date outside of, like, our culture and everything. I was just like, this is such a double standard. <sighs> Sorry. But, yeah. I think I was in an area I wasn't supposed to be in yet because of this jump. <laughs> Whoops. Well, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I'm going to pass over the controller to you in a little bit. You got some bless from chat as well. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I feel it. <laughs> <sighs> My stats are already increasing. <laughs> that's an internal conversation. <laughs> uh, so, um, I'm curious, Kate, um, if you don't mind me asking, is your brother's girlfriend, was she uh, Buddhist by chance? I I'm curious, because I know she's Japanese, so I'm wondering... Um, because, and I know, like, isn't it coming soon for, like, the, the proposal, right? I oh, think? I don't know what the turnaround time on. That was, like, like I, I've been waiting, like, <laughs> since you told us, I'm like, I can't wait. <laughs> I don't even know tea. them, but she I'm excited. spill the tea, okay? Spill it. I just love love. I think it's exciting. <laughs> yeah, you love love more than gossip, so. I do. I I'm not really that. big on gossip, but I do like the spill the tea as far as, like, I just want the deets. <laughs> No. Okay, you want me to play again? Yes. What should I do? Uh, just Dig? explore. Go to the right. I, we just came from there. Okay. I wanted to put this you in flower. an area that I hadn't really explored yet, like, so that you don't do a lot of backtracking. Does that make sense? Okay. That makes sense. The conversation literally ended there. I don't know what her religion is. They'll be here very soon. I'll tell you when in DMs. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> um. That's awesome. That is. So what is this? No shields. No deflecting seeds allowed. So these Deku scrubs, they, they don't want you to fight back. But th by Clearly. saying that, they, they basically do told you how flippers? to beat them. Yes, you do. That's always on. Um. I wonder if you can call... Can you call Ricky the, to this area? I wonder. Ricky? Yeah. Because uh, Ricky doesn't like the smell of medicine, which makes sense because the witch the witch was there, and I'm presuming that she makes the medicine out of the toadstools. Oh, that's, uh, too, bad. that's too far, probably. Maybe you have to jump from above. Maybe. Mm -hmm. You're gonna go eat a banana, Jess. Have fun eating the banana. Enjoy. <laughs> I know that was in reference to. Oh, oh hello. Who's this? It's a big bear. 
Sniff, sniff. There's a spring banana tree up Bananas? there. Bananas? Jess, did you know? <laughs> wow. You what? foresee the future. I always knew Jess really loved the Legend of Zelda series. <laughs> Will the rock flowers bloom in spring? I can't climb to it. Can nothing be done? That's I can so change sad. it to spring for the bear. Let's help out the bear. We haven't unlocked spring yet. Frick. <laughs> <laughs> Poor bear. I will help you one day. Don't you worry. The bear is a really good show, too. I know, like, it's going to be a while until we get the next season, but I'm so excited. Me, too. Wow, you're really high. Can you check the map for me? Is this the end? This, no, this is select. Oh, <gasps> it's the wow, end. Wow, look how far you've explored. I know. Isn't that insane? I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Oh, I need to jump. Yes. Wow, that was fast. Probably smoothest transition you've ever had. Don't hype me up, because, you know, the moment I get hyped... Well, I get there not. you go. I don't know what this is. Dancing with the screens. Dancing in this moonlight. There's no oh, vines. But maybe if it was snowing. <laughs> <laughs> maybe if it was snowing that... Oh, hello. Okay, so that worked out. Good. So let us Almost do... Almost like they designed it. The rod. And then Using the character AI when I'm bored is enough drama for me. Yeah, that's always fun. Okay, so now we're in winter. Now if we go back up... Oh, you were right, Doza. You were right. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. I've got this feeling. Pico, are you going to cry because of the Taylor Swift album? I believe so. Mm -hmm. That's exciting. I'm I'm happy for you. And Jess knew all about the banana thing, obviously. You're goaded, Jess. That makes sense. I think With Jess... the sauce. The banana sauce. Is banana sauce good? I don't know. Banana it pudding. Doesn't sound good. I love banana pudding. Isn't that basically banana sauce? Yeah. That's <laughs> why I, was, I made the connection. Yeah, like ketchup is a tomato smoothie. Thanks, Fairy. Finally, we met a fairy and we needed it. Yes. Okay, so that happened. And then if I... Can I jump to the... Over there? No. No, unfortunately cannot. Okay, so where else should I go? Well, who's that um, little guy? I can't get over there, though. I think we need to find a way to get into the little... The swirly thing so that we can get to spring. It seems like it's going to be the next... Uh, the objective. next Objective. Yeah. Oh... Did you figure it out? I did. It's right wow, here. Wow. Okay. You were you went dead silent. There's no aha moment. Well, I knew. Indicated. Like I hadn't jumped down that way yet. Okay. So what is this? You can just jump over the lava. Oh right. Okay. And I still have it equipped. So. Uh oh. Excuse me. Oh no. You're stealing my feather. What's that? It's so weird. I'll trade you this ore for it. Thanks. You frick. Stop. You got fool's ore, but that's no good. Get your feather back. I can't oh, believe you just got my robbed. That's a Where'd rough they area. Go? I don't know. Those two were hurrying home. I wonder if they found some other weird thing. This is their home. Hmm. Guys? Let's go bury some treasure. Make sure no one sees us. <laughs> if anyone does, run! There's a rumor it's not actually about Joe and it's about the ex before Travis. Who was the ex before Travis? I'm thinking of like somebody who was Did on One Republic. Did she date like a Kennedy for a while? I just, I have no idea. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, someone's here, run! Yeah. Cause Ooh, I'm not really good this at time? this stealth. You got this, babe. Just don't be, don't be slow. Now there's two of them. But usually it's, you're gonna need to be on some side of some, somewhere. Don't overthink it. I love tapioca pudding, personally. I think that's fire. Okay, you're doing great. And then we're gonna move down. There you go, there you go. Move no! Oh, oh no, too slow! That's alright. Try again. Maddie Healy? Who's that? I don't recognize that name. But I don't know all the people that Taylor Swift stated, so... I do not either. Remember, I do remember that Joe Jonas broke up with her through a text message, and then that's how her and Selena became besties, because Selena was dating Nick, and now Nick's dating Priyanka Chopra, and I only know this because I like Priyanka Chopra. <laughs> that's okay, sweetheart. I, I'm fine with you liking Priyanka Chopra and Nick Jonas. She was a Bollywood actress that I really, really liked. Mm -hmm. Careful, I don't know if they're going to, like, I liked her before up. she came to America. Yeah, you're an OG. I really am. I knew her when she won... Miss Universe. Oh man, where do I go from here? Oh, are they wow. stupid? I, I guess they're <laughs> stupid. I don't know. You're doing this in such an unorthodox way. 
compared to what I, I feel like I remember doing. And Twinkles, I saw you say duck life earlier. I love ducks. Like, is it about a duck and its life? Because I'm here for it. We played Untitled Goose Game, and I feel... Oh, watch like, out, watch out, Noosh, watch out, watch oh, out. Oh, you I was busy talking there. about ducks. Okay, well, this Do one's... Do I have to start over? Yes. Doza, you got this. No, you... Can you get was... me to where I was? Thanks. Okay, that's, that's, <laughs> that's, that's fair. A, that's fair. Yeah. <laughs> I proved I can do it. <laughs> right, yeah, that's fine. I'm fine with you being able to uh, do something once. And you, you're gonna tell that final boss what's up, Jess. Tell me why he has two big swords when he usually only has one. Maybe he leveled up since the last yeah, time you saw him. Yeah, he was him. like, I need to level up in order to take Jess down, but you, you've got something secret for him too, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Kate, you know, now that you bring it up like that, I, I guess I never, I never, I never really put that together. Also, Noosh, I just stood over here and nothing happened. Oh, that's smart. <laughs> oh, we could have rewinded! Crush, I forgot! Well, we're, <laughs> we're basically almost there. Yeah, Joseph's is kind of crushing it, so it's fine. <laughs> I wonder I keep, if I stand here if they'll I see me. I keep forgetting I can rewind. Alright, here you go, Noosh. No, <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It's so, hard to remember rewind when it's I like such a minor right inconvenience. Here? Would I be yeah, you could try that. No. no rewind, okay, rewind. right, right, rewind. So just don't stay still. Got it. Now <laughs> it's rewind time. What if you st stood underneath it? I mean, you're probably fine. You can you can dodge one guy. <laughs> okay. Just just uh, right. you know, pick yourself back up and uh, dust yourself off. You got this. You, you still got this. We're going to still keep hyping you up, and you're going to beat this game, and you're going to love it, and it's going to be glorious. Well, Twinkle Toes, that's another, that's another, uh, what was it? Cool Math Games reference? I mean, you just stood there. Well, I... <laughs> I'm trying to look at chat. Run! Run! Not away. I just, like, hide. <laughs> you used to love duck life? You train a duck to be athletic and have it race against other ducks. Oh, so like a chow from like the chow garden that, that, that sounds like a lot of fun is it on game pass or steam or like how, where do we play it's this cool math video games. game oh cool math games yeah. that's free we love free we love free oh well, the way you said that was the best <laughs> kessler has uh, one of the many reasons why i love her she's just a very expressive uh -oh. very unique individual and that seemed to work out for you that really did way to go Oh, it's right there. That's so good. Come on. Let's go find more treasure. These dumb dums. Okay, so I'm going to equip um the shovel. Yeah, that'll work. And I'm going to No, cuz if they see you, they they run away. I got my feather back. Now return the ore? I guess that's what a hero would do. Return their fool's ore to them. Um, so I need to... Just, just go give it back to them. Where? Oh, to them? Yeah, to them. Directly. Like, go talk to them. Mm, gotta make my way back downtown. <laughs> How affordable. True, Andrew. True. Free is delicious. I just hate Jake Gyllenhaal. Because he broke Taylor Swift's heart. Is well, it... I mean, she's she's better off for it, right? After everything. I don't Every know single about one... Jake Gyllenhaal. I don't know much about him either. Or th th there's multiple, right? They're like brothers and sisters. Wait, there's there's a Maggie. There's a sister. There's more Jake Gyllenhaals? Like, is it a common name combination? Wait, what did he say? Something Some about South? weird South, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I have to jump. <laughs> no okay. fear. Um. There you go. I guess nice. I don't need to return the ore? Uh, I mean, you'll probably find them eventually. Yeah. Maybe we don't worry about it because who cares? Hey. Oh. There's a bunch of pirates. I love this song. Our that ship got... Ship. Oh, go ahead. No, our ship got caught in a storm and sank. When we woke, there we were. Where are we? It all looks so weird. It was so stormy that Captain lost the bell he got from a special... Someone. That's a bit of trouble. Bell? We need a bell. With the Captain in such a state, we'll never get the ship out. That bloke we said looking for the bell hasn't come back. I told him in all to search the ship. We do need the bell, Doza. I uh, you saying our ship bell by the graveyard? We haven't fixed it, so it's in terrible shape. 
They didn't talk to the guy down there, that's fine. Useless fools! Can someone help me find me, Bell? Hey, you! Ha <laughs> Don't be silly! You ain't an experienced adventurer yet, if you haven't at least proven your adventuring skills by seeing the inside of some ruins. I've no use for you. Um, Twinkle says, how long does the game take when you say you can beat it in a day and you will? <laughs> I'm curious how long is, like, to beat What's it. What's a day? 24 hours or, like, one hour? Because you said a stream earlier, and usually our streams are anywhere from, like, two to three hours, typically. Mm-hmm. Okay, so... And so his love was some queen of some great land? That's yeah. That's kind of vague. Hello? Is he all right? That bloke's so forgetful. Now, how'd that go? Did you get all that? I was oh, supposed to watch? It. Yes. <laughs> okay, let's do it again. Okay, so the third one, twice. The second one, once. The first one, twice. And the fourth one, three times. Okay, you want to do it? Um, sure. The way you said it was different. I would have done it a different way, and you kind of talked over my thinking. Well, try it again. Try it. No, no, you do it. How do you do it? You do it. You got this. You messed up. I'm just kidding, I don't know. <laughs> I remember taking about two to four hours, but I was also a child, so I don't know. <laughs> All right, good to know. We'll look it up, but thank you for the suggestion. I've added it to our list. I think that was just to practice. I think it's relevant for somewhere else. No, not like this. <laughs> how long do they plan on staying here? I wonder how long they've been here. I, I guess I'm used to the life for now. Well, I guess we'll take this teleport, huh? <laughs> also, Kate wanting us to not return the ore to them. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we don't have to. Hey, this okay, is the other so side of what? that. Turn this? Yeah, go ahead and turn that. I haven't seen the wee baby bears or whatever the name is, but seeing the skeletons remind me of Toby Fox who voiced Jared, a skeleton pirate bird guy. Well, that's fun. Hey, we're back here? That was a warp all the way here, like the stairs? I guess so. This is the guy that says the same thing every time about the seasons. Yeah, because look, we're down here now. So where were we before? Um, I don't know if like does the like, if I go back to it with the top. Wait. I mean, you're just in the basement. You you've been to this floor before. Oh. I need to stand up for a sec. So should I go back here? Um, um, I mean, this is a nice thing that you unlocked, like a shortcut. Do we have any rings? I don't know. Did you perhaps plant anything in the top right? That same soil area? Maybe we should check. I'm not sure. I don't think we have. I don't think we have. Don't go check. Don't go check. I don't think we have. <laughs> I think we have. You're right. Let me go. I don't think we have. Let let me go You're check. You're gonna be sad. Why am I gonna be sad? I'm pretty sure I did plant stuff. See? What? I planted no stuff way. earlier and I got it. And there was another one that I planted too. I think. I don't know why I keep going in here. Oh, there's one that I planted near the sunken city. Where is that? Take your gale seed. Sitting back down now. Gale seed, uh, right, satchel. And gale. Good job. And back, and gale. Yay! And where am I going? What, what's, what, what's so bad about wee baby bears? Where, does it, where am I going? Uh, you're going to the water area. That one? Yes. Okay. Sunken city, there you go. Cool. City of, like four buildings playing fn with no guns is insane for fortnite with no guns FNAF? yeah like how do you kill anything how do you play fnaf without guns that's crazy so where do you want me to go up uh i think it's up there it is you got him down to half and then died again so you just have another half to go jess the mountain snows melted suddenly flooding the town i can't even leave the house it's terrible that is really sad we need to help her leave the house. Oh, there it is. <laughs> we got to help her leave the house. 200 rupees were inside. That's hype. That did nothing. We're maxed oh, out. Oh. <laughs> Get high. No. You can swim a little faster if no. you hit the A button. No one told me. It's just a thing that, like, maybe you could try. Should like, I change it to another season? Yeah, sure. What's... Give me a hint for where I'm supposed to be doing next. Go back uh, to the to the lava area. Which is... Yeah, if you go down back to the... That one. Yep, and then you go like four squares over to the left. 
go directly there. We unlocked the shortcut. That was great. That was fun. You can also appraise your ring here. You'll be you'll be good to go. Earth, water, fire. Oh, right. So the avatar stuff's going on. So like, Aang doesn't get to hold a gun like I was hoping. I call this Maple's the Maple's ring. ring. That increases maple meetings. Is that something you want to wear? Should I? You get to see Best Girl more. We do like Best Girl. Yeah. Okay. Oh, also, um, during all of our uh, talk about relationships and stuff, I unlocked a bigger box. A Goron helped us out. So pick your three favorite. I didn't mean that. Get hype. <laughs> <laughs> what, what's uh, really wonderful is Maple's Nush ring. does this quite often. And then when we go through our, our photos together, just to like reminisce and cuddle, like, hey, let's look through our Switch photos. And it's really nice to see like random things because like, <laughs> It'd be that reason. <laughs> I just forget the buttons. Did you want to hold on to like two more rings so you can switch them when you need them? Can you switch? What, can you just do that? I yes, mean, thanks. Yeah, okay. And sure. Jay has arrived. Hello, Jay. Welcome Jay, how's to the stream. How are you doing? Let's see. Let's go. And then <laughs> Take we can do this. I'm going to enter like that next time. <laughs> <laughs> I, it does surprise us the way you guys enter, and I like it, especially when y'all mix it up. Sometimes it's great. But even just a hello, just being here, like, all of it's great. It's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Um, <laughs> and I'm glad you're doing great, Jay. Howdy, howdy. I think we're gonna focus on some Howdy seems so, rooms. like, not me. Even though, like, we're in Texas, and we say howdy, y'all. <laughs> howdy, y'all. <laughs> Oh, man. If you go to like A and M or like College Station where Texas A and M is, like everyone says howdy. It's crazy. <laughs> okay, we I guess we only have one finger, so we can only wear one ring at a time. Let me just go ahead and put you in the place that you need to be. That would be ideal. Yes. Okay, so we're taking the portal back to hell. I mean, Sombrosia, and then here you go. What do I do here? Your best. Am I like, what is this? Those look like uh, tombstones. Oh. Maybe not all of the crew made it. I don't know if you can interact with any or if you can push them, but if you could, it'd be from the bottom. But I wouldn't worry about it until someone like makes a, a implication. Deal about it. Yeah. Okay, so we gotta go underground. Not underground, I mean, I guess technically. So now we're in the pirate ship. Oh, why didn't we do that? <laughs> oh, Let, hello. Who's that? Let's switch. Just pushing random gravestones. Respecting gravestones? Who does that? Oh, in the desert? That means... Oh, I see. You remember when you talked to this, a skeleton for the first time and you tried killing him? Uh-huh. We need to go there. So okay. go back to the shore. Okay, let's go back to the shore. Okay. I guess we could do that together. You and me? Yeah. Together. <laughs> so I'm going to get us to the shore, yeah, and then I'm going to give it back to her. Off. I'm basically like a taxi cab. He really is. <laughs> he also does the majority, if not all, the driving in our relationship. Well, he she does... She is Hold a on. passenger princess. I, I am a passenger princess in the city, but for long distance driving, I'm Out the queen. in the countryside. No, it's not the countryside. It's just, well, that's what it is. If we're driving from like San Antonio to Dallas, I'll do that. But if it's just around San Antonio for errands, it's Doza. <laughs> I think it's a fair trade-off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you not think it's fair? It's fine. Plus, like, Long Doza feels safer when he's driving. Hurt. I'm not as good of a driver. <laughs> like, I'm not as confident of a driver. What I don't like is not fostering your skill of driving. Because <laughs> you're only going to get worse. Which only makes uh, us more anxious. I mean, I mean, right now we don't it's even like have a, a bike, car right? Doza. So it's kind of fine that I'm not driving. Yeah, we'll be, we'll be okay. All right. I got you there. Wanna, now I want to live in a city that can walk. That'd be great. I want to get back to all my mates. We all want things. We can't have them. <laughs> Don't come back till you find me, Bell. Okay, so we have to do that. Okay. Can we... Can we touch the wall? No, that didn't work. Hmm. What do we do? I don't know. I guess we have to... I guess we're getting ahead of ourselves. Maybe we are. Let me get us back to up in north. Because remember that's what the tree said? I think that we might have gotten really close to somewhere. And then we just didn't turn the right direction at one point. 
which is kind of funny. Okay, so we're gonna take a warp seed. And Andrew, we appreciate that you say hello to everyone that comes into stream that too. Is so kind it is of very you. sweet. Yeah, um, we do like it. <laughs> Approved. Whether it's howdy or any other greeting, it's always very kind. Ay ay ay! There we go. I know what I want to do. Remember that Moblin King? He's most of the Let's driving in the city up. though, because like Doza can like nap and relax while I drive long distance. You know? <laughs> yeah. What about long distance driving? Well, because Kirby said most of the driving is in the city wall, because, like, that means you drive more, but, like... <laughs> oh, yeah, it's, it, there's a massive difference. But I don't usually... I'm not usually in pain after driving around in is the city. Is that the ship, like, with, like, the boat on top or something? Like, no, the you, flag? you saw part of the yeah, ship. Yeah, you're right. You saw part of it, but this is a castle. It's a totally different thing. But, you know, it's good that you're thinking about it. I think it. the kangaroo can be here. It can, but it can't you don't swim. Need him. Right. But now we oh, can. Oh, we have flippers. We never did this again. No, but now That's we're here. That's hype. So, like, can we, like, kill the king? Where is he? I want to kill the king. I want to strew his entrails across all of the lands. Okay, I guess this is a good point for me to be playing, I, I suppose. I think I was trying to say, like, the flag on a ship compared to, like, a flag on a castle. I was just all over the place there, Kirby. Do you think it's part of the port or the bow? Or the stern of a boat? The, the sternum of the boat? I don't really know a lot about boats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. And Jay, um, I mean, you're welcome to be a small celebrity in the stream if you'd like. Everyone is a celebrity here. Sure, why not? So the pesky kid has come. Is this Ganon? I won't let you stand up to me anymore. This time, victory will be mine. Oh, There's no. a poop deck? Yeah, that's, that's, where you, that's where you poop. That's gross. That's also not true. That doesn't I got sound you. sanitary. I, I joked you and you got joked. I don't really have any questions about boats, but good to know if I ever do have them. Um, <laughs> I I don't think I do well in boats, honestly. I'm, I'm scared. Well, I don't know how to swim, so like I get scared to go on a boat because like if I fall you overboard, I'm dead. I cannot be defeated as long as I don't drop my bomb behind me and start a fire. Okay, we'll just have to do that. You've probably seen or heard of any cartoon on Disney Channel, Cartoon Network, or Nickelodeon. You can go ahead and test me. Ooh. Um. Have you heard of Adventure Time? Got him. Oh my gosh. Checkmate. <laughs> ah, ah, how could I'm this actually child trying to think me? Of, I'm trying to think of something obscure. Well, we'll try. Um, I shall get my revenge. We beat him. First try. Easy. Oh, nice. Piece of heart. So this was optional. <laughs> <laughs> and have a good night to you as well, Jay. Thanks for stopping by. And I, I do wear a life vest if I if I am on a boat, because yeah, I'm not trying to do nothing, she especially really not do dying. Swim thing, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, it can be a bit can of a, a little struggle. Um, I'm trying to think of a show. Like, did you guys have any shows to test Twinkle Toes? Like, I want to talk about old shows. Have you watched Tenchi Muyo? Is that on Cartoon Disney Channel or Nick? It was on Cartoon Network. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, we'll wait and see. Yeah. <laughs> that that will that's my hat in the ring for maybe trying to stump Twinkle Toes. Starboard is right because starfish are right-handed sailor that washed ashore every once in a while. Oh well, good to know. Now we can Poop see if we can tell Gulliver that. Is usually the highest deck, usually over a cabin. I don't know why it's called that. Yeah, it's strange. what they made it seem like. <laughs> They made it seem like it was the main deck, you know? Like the main area that everyone hangs out in, not the not the area above the captain's cabin or whatever. Unless anything is a cabin in a ship. Again, I I don't really know. Lost in space. What's that? Lost in space. Have I seen that? Mm -hmm. Perhaps. I don't think I have though. I don't think I have. Well there you go. Noosh got stumped. But is that a cartoon, though? Lost in Space sounds like a, a Like thing. a live action. It sounds like something Sandra Bullock would be in. Well, she did do I mean? some space movie. I don't think we saw it, though. No. We also the didn't last see Sandra Bird Bullock... Um, Miss Congeniality? Uh, there's okay. also The Proposal. Oh, yeah, with Ryan Reynolds. Yeah, there's we that saw new that too. movie with Ryan Reynolds that's coming out soon. Deadpool um, 3? No, it's kind of... It kind of reminds me of... Uh, what is it called? If! It's called If! 
Like, just if. It's with, like, it reminds me of uh, the movie, your favorite movie. Which uh, one? Rod Roger. Uh, Roger Rogers Rabbit? Rabbit? Robert, Rogers Rabbit. Robert to the... Uh, Rob <laughs> well, Ricky's here, the kangaroo. I'm just all kind of ours. <laughs> but um, who framed Roger Rabbit? That's your favorite movie. It's the whole, like, animated, live-action, intertwined kind of situation. That's what If is kind of like. With Ryan Reynolds and some other people. I think, like, Blake Lively's in it, too. Um, for a small part as well. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. So I we really... See the big purple thing. And, like, Please, imagination, it, it needs to be good. creativity, all of that. Like, I'm so worried. I don't really know what it's about, but I'm excited to watch it because I'm, it looks fun. I will cautiously watch it. I'm, I, for some reason, I'm, I'm not... I, I, just, I don't know if it's... I've only seen one trailer. I just... I didn't feel any passion behind it. So I'm really hoping it that it was just, like... You know, maybe it's on me, or maybe it's the editing, or whatever. I'm really hoping that it's good, because I, I'm scared right now. I'm worried that it's not going to be good. Because I've, I've had time to, like, kind of sit and think about it. Yeah. After we, like, saw it initially. The trailer, yeah. yeah. So I I hope it is. We'll, we'll find out soon, because I think it comes out either later this month or next month, for sure. I'm seeing more stuff about it. There's also the News and Data movie that's coming out, the Challengers, the tennis thing. Yes. I'm kind of excited about that. They've been doing a bunch. I've been seeing a bunch of her outfits for the premieres and stuff. Oh, I am not. I and yeah, if I'm glad you're excited for it. The imaginary friends movie with the naked banana. Oh, what about bananas in pajamas? Bananas in pajamas. Walking down the stairs. Oh yeah, have you seen that Twinkle Toes? I don't know or imaginary friends movie though with a naked banana. And just <laughs> me think the rest of the game was hard. This boss fight. You got this. Just jump in the air and shoot your gun. Is I hear that, that's uh. That works? I know in Devil May Cry 4 you can do that, and, and like when you shoot your gun, it suspends you in the air. So you just jump in the air and you spam the gun and you just stay up there. Forever, Wait, like almost forever. Is if stand for imaginary friends, Andrew? You know that makes a lot of sense. That really does. I didn't see it before. Now I see it. Wow. I said naked because the banana was told to put on pants in the trailer. Oh, okay. Right, well, that right. Makes sense. Yeah, I remember yeah. that. <laughs> I'm glad we all know, like, what we're talking about, though. For some reason, I think of that meme from that gumball show. Teacher's Pet? That was a show? Teacher's Pet. Um, how about Chalk Zone? Chalk Zone? Wasn't that, like, a skit type thingy? Like, it was smaller, like, episodes of different things. Like, it wasn't its own full show. You know, I, I want to I wanna agree with you because what you're saying sounds really right. Like, familiar. Yeah, it sounds super familiar. Oh, my gosh. How did I end up back here? So, Kate did all of us a favor by Googling or internet searching. And it says, poop deck comes from the Latin word pupus. And the French term is la poop. <laughs> I can't believe but what does this it is mean? A, this, is, this is the stream we've talked most about poop. Inter inter intercultural the... struggles and poop. Oh my gosh. We put it like that. You really never know what you're going to get in a new Shindosa stream, huh? No. And none of this would be possible without all of y'all in these conversations. Are you and blaming them? Because no. I'm, I'm with you. It's I not mean, <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm blaming them either. We Who can all, could ever do that? It's not even a blame. I think it's so unique that we can talk <laughs> about all sorts of things here, all of us together, like the diversity. It's great. I I, I, I thrive off of it. In fact, I didn't even realize it was already 9.30, Doza. How is it already 9.30? Time, like the seasons are changing, the time's going on, you know? I just need, I just need a little more. I just want a little more. Oh my gosh. Why are these Chalk so much went help? for a bit, had half hour episodes. Oh, okay. Oh, it did? Hmm. I was so unbarred with you, Noosh. Oh well. Sometimes it works, but then this man jumps up super high, takes his sword, and stabs me down into the ground. So... And then just, just at all caps, I just realized he heals. No! <laughs> does he heal on hit, or does he have like his own healing potion? That sounds really rough. Just as Leo crying, has he been doing that before? <laughs> I hate when they heal. <laughs> it is really sad. Just let me keep your, like, like the progress bar, like how much I already have. Like, don't make it go up. <laughs> Bit of a struggle there. That's all right. Oh, let me, uh... The internet refuses to tell me, and I'm not learning French now, maybe later. I was forced to learn some Latin in fifth grade. A kid on the bus asked why I had 
written in my notebook. I was like, it's Latin. It means six. <laughs> <laughs> I took Latin throughout high school, and uh, it was fun. You had a good time? It was, it was really to help me like with my future medical career, because like medical terminology and a lot of stuff derives from Latin, so like context clues of knowing like basic Latin kind of helps you with that, even though it's a dead language. So like when you had to learn about like larva and pupils, you're like, oh yeah, that. Like poop. No. No? Okay. You tried. I tried. <laughs> Look at me trying to, to, to bridge the gap. Trying to hashtag relate. Oh, you know what we didn't do? We didn't go to the right after we got stuff. No, we didn't. No, no, we Because, like, did not. we went back down. <laughs> yes, we did. Oh, look, Hello. Seed. Who would want a dirty feather? Oh, does it, did everyone hear about us getting mugged? Apparently. Yeah, I guess so. But maybe now we can... Okay. <laughs> maybe now we can get, uh... Oh, hello. The next, um... What do you call it? No! Death. Like lava. Yeah, well, I don't if have only a power, a power star. star yeah, that only. also would you not know, make you, you know. invisible. Ah! Death again. Any cool cats in chat know what we're talking about? <laughs> I'm sure they do. <laughs> oh, another, another one. Wow, they're gonna start planting cool these. Here. I like planting them in areas we can easily find them again. Like but the, the town. Yeah, the town. Near the town. It's basically the town. Whoa! Hell yeah! Do we Let's finally go. get spring? If it's spring, that means we can help the, the, the bear get the banana. Just like Jess always wanted. Yes. Which I hope you enjoyed your banana. We don't have any. What? <laughs> Why do we not have bananas? No, no. Like, the thing is on the screen. I am the spirit of spring. You are? Rock hard buds bloom in spring. It is a season of discovery. To think I can add to the power of the hero with the Triforce symbol. I loan you the power of the spirit of spring. When we first played this, like started yesterday, I said triangle instead of Triforce. You know, um, you just, you're just hoping to not uh, ruin it. Ruin it for, for anyone other that people doesn't who know about know. the Triforce. Yeah. Of course. Something to call for the spring. So we, okay, so now we have the spring. Yes, now we have the spring. So now we can go back to the bear. Yes. Can we teleport there? We, are already nearby, yes, basically. Okay. I am not playing right now because Doze has been navig- He's better at the map navigating, especially now that we've opened up, but I'm going to help the bear really soon once we get to that area. Yeah. And I'll be taking over again. And then a little later, we'll call it for the night. Yes. Tomorrow, we'll we'll be streaming again at, starting at 6 p.m. CT. For but probably longer because it's Friday night. Or I, it will be tomorrow. It, <laughs> it, it, it will be tomorrow and it will be longer. At least doing pretty good today. Oh gosh, uh, I don't want to mess with this. I think the nap earlier helped us stay up later. Yeah. But we also woke up super early to work today, so like, it kind of makes sense that we needed a nap. Yeah, well, you know, super early for us. I mean, sometimes I wonder, what is super early, like, what is early for y'all in the morning? And just everyone let, let us know like, what early means. are you a morning means. person, night owl? Like, do you like wake up super early? Or do you wake up at like 6, 7, 5.30, 4, oh, geez. 10? Maybe you're 11 a.m. Are you an 11 a.m. individual? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I was not a morning person, but now I kind of have to be. Well, what are you going to do about it? Is that a reference to a certain short? It is, Andrew, it is. <laughs> Yo, Andrew goaded, let's go. It sucks to get all the rings you need to play the game like three or four times along with ages. There's a lot of things that's frustrating about these games. <laughs> with the right time, you jump over two holes normally. Really? You can jump over three with the Pegasus Seed. I did it earlier and oh, with the detract speed. us for a while. Yeah. Castle Rick's about 5.30 a.m. 5.30? It's too early that, for me. That, that is a bit early. I mean, we've done it before when we need to, but that's not our typical. No. No. Big Night Owl, if I had the choice, 10 a.m. every day. Uh, ah. Yeah, we it ranges for us because sometimes we have calls with people in other time zones and that like I'd rather do it in the morning than us stay up late and do it because then that would take away from stream and like other things that we like, you know, we like our evenings for ourselves for the most part. Oh, gosh, um, five is really early, but I try to get up from seven to eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twinkle Toes is a morning person and a night owl. Sleep is my worst nightmare. <laughs> it's 
to when do you get your Sorry. sleep? Like, if you're morning, like, you're early to rise and late to sleep. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. Why is this one so much harder now? Uh. <laughs> We're definitely more night owls in, like, if we could choose, because we've definitely done the whole nocturnal thing. <laughs> you know it. Sometimes it has to happen. Or, you know, sometimes because of circumstances it just ends up happening that way. It's like, well, we better just make the most of it instead of, you know, complaining about it. And we we have to make plans days ahead to be like, okay, we know that we can't just, like, flip a switch and everything is gonna go back to normal, so, like, let's figure out how we can adjust back to, like, a, a sleep schedule that's Couple more hours productive. Each day, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely a proponent of it. No! Why are we doing this again? Because they have treasure that they buried. Uh... <laughs> but luckily, I can just rewind and not have to do the whole dang thing. Go ahead. Um, what was I gonna? I forgot what I was gonna say. That you love me and that I you like, you enjoy you. my plans to I, get us back on schedule. I do enjoy your plans to get us back on schedule. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good. I just yawned. Sorry. <laughs> well, probably because it's getting late. We're talking about sleep and waking up and all of that. Okay, I wonder what they buried. Because it, like, if we can do this again and it's being different, obviously it must be something good. Oh yeah, another seed. Let's go. I don't know if they keep doing this, or like, I don't know if this is a repeatable mini game or not. But we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and and leave and get back to the uh, to the things that Noosh cares about, like the, the bear. bear and the banana. Because I know that uh, that poor little bear is just sitting there, going, "Dang it, these uh." These stupid little flowers, they're, they're rock hard, and I can't do anything about that, and it's a we sad day for the, bear. for the big old bear, you know? Like, if you saw Snorlax sad, wouldn't you help him? Uh, Snorlax loves to sleep. Exactly. He sleeps quite heavy, just like you, Andrew. <laughs> there you go. All right, I, Noosh, with the power of spring. We're both quite sluggish in the morning, though, and a little, like, we, we need time to, like, readjust. Bear! Ooh. There's a spring banana tree up there, but until the rock flowers bloom in spring, I can't climb it up, and nothing be done. I can do something. Yes, you can. I'm going you to help you, it. bear. I'm going to jump up here, and I'm going to... Oh, I already have it equipped, so I'm just going to press the button. It's the B button. Don't you know? It's not winter that you want. You want spring. Is this spring? It is. Yes, ma'am. I think bear. over time I've learned I'm not a morning person. I'm not a, a night owl. I'm a, I'm a rested individual. I thrive when I'm rested. Just in general. That's what I like. Wait, this is not spring? This is spring, but um, he's uh, he's a bear. He, he doesn't realize it. Did, give him a break. I mean, it changed in an instant. So I need to you know? him? Well, you need to go back, go back over there. Because with, with the rock flowers now blooming, maybe you can interact with them. There you go. <laughs> That's all it was? That's Man, I need a nap. <laughs> or I need to go to bed for the night. Okay. Like I, like I always say, if uh, if it's if it seems like you should be doing more, you could probably just try something and maybe it'll work. I think the last time I took a nap was when I had COVID, I think. That's a long time to not take a nap. But I guess, um, I guess, yeah, there were a few years I didn't really nap either. Flying cuckoo flaps when held. Otherwise, it's dangerous. Right. Okay, so maybe we should pick it up. That would be my guess. Oh, cute. <laughs> can you move? No, it's moving for me. Oh, so... Maybe it can do only you, do one thing. Do you think the Undertale thing is a reference to this? Well, actually, maybe I can move. I don't know. How do I... Oh, I have to keep spamming it. Oh, I'm glad you figured it out. Well, we're... How do I get it to go over here? Just start doing it immediately. Wow, Noosh. I didn't know you had it in ya. Yes! Okay. Way to clear it. Alright, let's go <gasps> It's a banana tree! Uh... Right? Um, I can try to help you be the boss by giving you... Like, hype. 
<laughs> I mean, I don't know. I've never played Devil May Cry. I feel like that's intense just because it has the word devil in it. I wonder, is there a parry button or a dodge button? No! Wow, and you got hit by the keys on the way down. What? I pressed it. I swear. Sword attack. What is going on? The keys are knocking you off. Yeah, but they need to die. So kill them. Right, right, right. <laughs> oh my gosh. It is late. I am tired. You're getting a bit excited there. And don't worry, you can always rewind if you, uh, feel... <laughs> You're doing great, sweetie. Uh-huh. Alright, back to full hearts. Let's try this again. Round two. A little jump attack. That's cute. It's like the bird Why? Is I swear I'm pressing it. I I am like what is going on? I think I think what happens is when you touch the ledge, you start slipping and once you start slipping you can't jump. So you need to jump before the ledge. You have enough distance to clear it just fine. You can always hold that down and wait for it to come to you and do a spinning oh attack. Oh my gosh. <laughs> This is what you're making me do before bedtime? I just, I'm not sure what the struggle is. It's jumping. Okay. Maybe give yourself a little... <laughs> I don't... What? Does it, can you just do... Like, I'm tired. Okay, okay. The parry is just trying to time hitting my sword with his at the same time to stun him. There is parry, but I really use it, is what it just said. Oh, okay. So, how long does he get stunned for? Um, and Rylan, we have not played Minish Cap yet, but we look forward to it. It's another uh, great game that we've heard about that we want to play. Definitely. And it's on the Game Boy Advance of the Switch, right? I think so. So that would be pretty hype. Okay, Noosh, there We're you go. The tree We're at the, the tree. Banana. Get the banana. Get it. You got a spring banana. It sure smells sweet. Good job, babe. I'm proud of you. I gotta help the bear. You Have haven't gone, gone in there. Yet? No, not yet. So let's make sure that we kill those keys on the way, okay? Just a, a blaze of fury. Got, right, I'm supposed to get off. spanked on the booty, huh? You, you know what's gonna happen. It's just so... We're acting so late. To the right. I tried! <laughs> yeah, you're acting too soon. I'm just sleepy, okay? Come on, you gotta do this Goldilocks style. Oh my god! Now. <laughs> okay, you got this, you got this. Now. Perfect, look at that. Oh, and you saw the keys, I wasn't sure. Whoa, you're so good! That's alright, you got another try. I'm holding my breath here. Now! Yes! <laughs> Gosh, I'm so proud of you. Now you can just fall off or you can do the whole thing if you want. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to give the bear the banana. Yeah, speed run that was literally strats. my only thing I wanted to do. Four seconds if I keep hitting him quick enough. Bear, Jess, it sounds like it's worth parrying. You brought me a spring banana. Is it for me? Are you happily is asleep? What did he say? So do tasty. Do I get to ride you moosh? Just like noosh. <laughs> You fed me, so I'll help you. That's Noosh and Moosh. We're riding today, gamers. Oh my goodness. I hope you read the d d directions. No, water is my weakness. The shallow stuff is one thing, but I can't take deep water, so be careful. I didn't read what he does. Oh, he can fly? Cute. This is so much better than the bird. How do I use him? Like, where am I going? He said that you can jump over things and tap A to fly. Why don't you try it on that singular hole right there? See if you can manage that. Cute. Nice. <laughs> oh man, this is great. There's a key that we need to get. And then I think we can call it for today. It's to the left. Okay, so he still gets hurt. And you can't it's not about height, it's more about distance. But it's good on you for trying. Did you like Minish Cap more than ages? I can't wait to play it. <gasps> you can take that flower up. I mean by yourself, but yeah. I wonder what's over here. Hold A to power up. If you build up enough power and let it go, I'll ground the pound. Try it. <gasps> Goaded with the sauce! The banana sauce! 
I can float if you tap A. If you move as I float, you can float across pits. Try it. Well, you would tap it. You gotta fly over the holes. Think of anything that's in your way as like, that's in your way. You gotta go around it. Okay, I know the 2D is an adjustment, but you, you got this. And then it's too, it's on the ground, so you need to get off. You, you gotta, you gotta get down on the ground. There you go. Got it, got it, yeah. Oh, you gotta, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I just tired. No! <laughs> there. Okay, ready? So you've already met like three animals that help you. Which one's your favorite? Um, the bear. <laughs> I like the bear. Where do I go now? We got a, we got the key. We did get the key, and I bet you probably have to go up there once you change it back to spring. Okay. So once you do that, we'll probably be to the next level, the next dungeon. This would probably be a good, uh, yeah, stopping point. So go ahead and change it. Oh, oh, I'm getting a little fancy feet up there. Happy or two. Does ever plays this game and he beats in like two minutes, I will die laughing. Yeah, well, maybe. The problem is that I've been content with dodging until now, so I'm not good at it. I'll have to remember that if we ever do play it. Is it spring? It's spring. Good job. Okay, so now we just have to backtrack. If you have the GBA Online thing, Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga is on there. And if y'all play it, I want y'all to remap a pair of Joy-Cons so each of y'all can have the A and B. So it's an unofficial co-op. That's very cute. It's a very nice idea. We we'll need to figure that out. Imagine blue bears in TOTK. I would love to. You have not been down there, I don't think. Oh, I should have taken that heart. Yeah, you kind of need them. Remember, you can ground pound, too. Right. right yeah, you right. don't have to get off every time you want to, like, you know, do some yard work. I would love to see a blue bear like this. I... I don't. I don't know if we ever even get a reference to any of these guys I in know. the other games. It's a shame. We played them, right? So we would have seen something, remembered something. There's like the little blue um other thing, like the little rabbit. The little blue rabbit things. Yeah, I yeah, guess that's true. The burrow and all that. All right, you so have to this go way? up the. Oh wait, no. Okay, you need to change it back. Why don't you just rewind? Right here. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, and then go up. Yeah, and then you can go up and then and to the left. Oh. Oh, nope, he doesn't like water. Right, right, right. <laughs> that's cute, though. The flower? Get on the flower, like you. Okay. Oh. Like, by yourself. Okay. I'm up here Very now. cute. And... You can just go inside. I think that's all you can do. You either go inside or you go to the right. Okay. We're here. Oh, a toadstool. Can we not do anything? It blocks the... He doesn't seem to hear you. Then I guess we'll have to come back when he's awake. So we'll go to the right then. Um, y'all don't have to buy it, but it would be neat. Well, we have to play. Um, what do you call it? Pokemon? Not Pokemon. Paper Mario, right? Paper Mario is the next game that we're gonna play, right? Yes. Okay, good. Paper uh, Mario is the next game we're gonna be playing. Can swim. Um, and uh, we were. Oh, I can change it to. What does he need? This would be. The, he wanted the. Not snow. I don't know what I'm doing. What? Is this a good stopping point? This is a good stopping stop. point. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotten <laughs> late enough to where I just all... Oh, that's what I was going to do. <laughs> we did it. Oh my Yay. God. I didn't read the first thing of that other guy. So let me... Is it summer right now? Oh, thank God. It's spring. Oh my goodness. I want to see what that dude said when he was sleeping, because he said something about not moving. Stop! Get out of my way! And we appreciate the suggestion, Andrew. The snow, it blocks the... We, I know we always say, like, for a lot of games, like, soon, it's in the works, like, things like that. Like, I mean, they, they really are. Like, we've been, you know, working on thumbnails, we've been trying to get ahead, and it's just one by one, getting them done. Ever so slowly. <laughs> yeah. But we do appreciate all the suggestions. We have a long list from, from all of y'all over this journey, and it's, it's great. And this, of course, even the list of games that we just wanted to play together. Lots more Mario, Kirby, uh, Zelda, the classics. <laughs> all the ones we There's also, like, love. we saw the Indie Showcase earlier this week, like, on the Nintendo one, and, like, there was this crab game that looked really fun and cute. 
And turns out that's on Game Pass. Yeah. Oh my god. I thought we were gonna stop on stump. What we were happened? gonna. I I thought you meant like metaphorically. No, 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 Dozo. Like, like it's. I'm tired. Okay. <laughs> Let me get to the other side of this cave, and then we'll stop. Oh my god. Okay. Other side of the cave is gonna be like in 20 hours. No. <laughs> like the longest cave ever. Like I was gonna say 20 minutes, moon. and then I committed to 20 hours. That's fine. I think it's fine to be hyperbolic. I think it's fun. Hyperbole? Uh, yeah, I guess you could say that. On a I don't Until think Until we finish the game, I would be so much loopier than I am now. I think I am in a bit of a sleep deficit at the moment, even with a nap, is why, like, I just want to get to bed. Yeah, well, I hope that you and sleep through the night. And to rehydrate. Please sleep through the night tonight. I slept through the night last night. And the night before. Yeah, I, this week's been pretty good about sleeping through the night. I'm very proud of you for that fact. Especially with even all the anxiety things, you know? I, you have every reason to be up at night worrying. Yes. And yet, you've been, you've been very good about it. Yes. Thank so you. I think Thank that you for that's, recognizing it. Yeah, it's a lot of good personal growth there. And I... And Dosa gets to sleep. <laughs> I do, which means I get way more work done. And then she loves it when I have work that it's gets win -win done. It's a win-win all around. <laughs> it is a win-win. So yeah, tomorrow we'll come back and then we'll do the, the Undertale thing where we fly over a small gap. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to go ahead and overwrite because there's yes. no reason to hold on Thank to you that. guys so much for all the great conversations and hanging out with us again tonight. We'll be back tomorrow um, for a wonderful next stream of this day. I don't know. <laughs> yes, don't forget to like the stream. <laughs> yes, and um, enjoy your tortured poet society, Pika. I hope it's as glorious as you want it to be. Fingers crossed. And good night. Good night.